Okay, everybody, I think it's time to go ahead and get everything started. And I think Draco might be on the move. Yep, you can, guys can see him on the move right now. He's now popped up on camera for you guys, which is good. Um, yeah. Um, woke up this morning. Found Draco's uh, food bowl on top of his little house. I did not do that, guys. And, oh, hang on. Draco? Are you okay? What are you doing? <laughs> Excuse me, Draco, what are you doing? What are you doing, Drake? Draco's, um... I, I, I never thought I'd see the day, guys, but Draco is renovating his enclosure. It only took you three and a half years, but you're finally renovating your enclosure. Guys, 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 do you know what this means? Uh, I don't have to do any work to decorate Draco's enclosure. <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. All right. Let's get the stream loaded up, guys. Uh, let's go into chill screen for now. Uh, and let's get you a good shot of Draco. He's renovating. Goodness. He wants to become plant. He is plant. Draco is plant. He's, uh, he's now a grass and dragon type. He's doing silly stuff. I don't know what Draco's been doing, but... Guys, you would have to be insane to put Draco's uh, food bowl. You can probably see it on camera right now. Draco's food bowl, the kind of orangey um, thing at the back. I think you would have to be insane to position his bowl like that. I don't know what you're doing, Draco. But, yeah, keep it up. If it's, uh, if it's entertaining for you guys, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Anyway, 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 anyway. Hello everybody, hello and welcome. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Please enjoy your stay as always. Let's see who we got to kick off the stream. We've got Firex, Jake, Jessica, Noah, Raquel and Shay. How you all doing guys? Yesterday in the stream I found Shiny Voltorb and Shiny Petal. Alright, Petal, I'm a bit jealous about Firex. <laughs> but good job, buddy. And an hour ago you found your first full odd Shiny. It was a Staray. Oh, it was a Staravia. Kind of like what we're fighting right now. Uh, Printplop isn't shiny. Yes! There is a god! There is a god to stop Shay in his tracks. And his name is Arceus. Praise Arceus. Uh, he's doing silly stuff. He wants to become plant. Oh, yeah. Draco definitely wants to become plant. Printplop won't be shiny. Oh, you'll get it eventually, Shay. Don't worry about that one, buddy. Are you feeling any better? Hopefully you're feeling better. No Gaming is here. How you doing, No Gaming? And uh, a hello from Jake as well. You got shiny Zora yesterday. Nice. Very nice. The Lilligan set isn't alpha, is it? Well, I don't know. She just trying to, uh, <laughs> she's trying to pick a fight, guys. All right, three after three outbreaks. Oh, pff, that's good. That's really good. Uh, it's worth mentioning, guys. Um, yesterday, I'm just gonna, yeah, we can just knock this out. Yesterday, um, and this morning, I got uh, two more shinies to add. I got shiny pile of swine. And I also got in a shiny um, Bergmite, which was kind of cool. I was really disappointed because once again, off stream. Well, to be fair, it was not the first thing. Uh, it was not the first outbreak that time. But off stream, it was the second outbreak. We got I got sh shiny Bergmite. It's crazy. I I really wish that was one I caught on stream. But uh, let's show you guys what we got. Shiny hunting scyther. Hey Holly, how you doing? So like that you can shiny get a shiny cleaver. You got the you got the items, fan dabby dozy. That is good. So there's our shiny bergmite guys. Shiny bergmite. I'm gonna be honest. Quite like the shiny. Looks very good. It does look kind of cute. I have to have to be honest. Uh, the the word cute did not. I I thought it looked cool, and I'm not saying that because it's an ice type, and I'm trying to make a pun out of it. I think it looks kind of cool to be fair. Uh, I also got uh, another yellow shiny. There's pile of swine. Uh, need to evolve that into pile of swine. Which, uh, sorry, this is pile of swine. Need to evolve that into mammal swine. So, I think the shiny color is uh, really nice. Let's go back to Bergmite. So, yeah, we're not too far away. We're not too far away from getting all Hisuian forms shiny. So we are getting there. We definitely are getting there. We're missing five. We're missing Weirdeer, Lilligant. Uh, Basca Legion and Arcanine. And we're also missing uh, Zora. If it comes down to Zora being the last one, I think I'd be happy with that. You like uh, Bergmite? I think it's cute. Ooh, what's Holly going for? Also got your shiny male combi. Oh. Welcome to the shiny male combi club. Um, 
featuring Draconic's logo, which will not become canon. <laughs> what about the starters? I haven't done the starters. Um, I don't know. I'm going to assume that you can get them shiny. I'm assuming that you can, based on the fact that you can encounter them in the wild. And it's not exactly shiny locked, whereas you can... When you get them for the very first time... Uh, Draco, you're... What are you doing, Draco? What are you doing? I don't know what Draco's doing, guys. I have no, I have no idea what he's doing. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna keep on the screen for now. But you know, um, it was an instant shiny as well. Oh, fantastic! You guys are doing fantastic. So, what about the starters? Starters could probably be shiny in the um, in the time space distortions. Yeah, good luck with that one. <laughs> Very good luck with that one. Uh, probably better getting the shiny charm and uh, max research and all that kind of stuff before you do anything about that. So. All right, um, so guys, depending on the outbreak that we get, uh, hopefully it's, well, I just need to wait and see what happens, but depending on the outbreak that we get next, will depend on whether we're going to go ahead and do, um, it's going to completely depend on whether we go ahead and do uh, the Legends, because of course we're doing the Legends today. I don't know how long it's going to take, but just need to wait and see what happens. Imagine not having the shiny charm. Shay, you can shut up. To be fair, I could... Go out and get it. I could probably go out and uh, get it. Oh, luxury. Okay, right, we're not going to bother. We're not going to bother. We're just going to go ahead and start doing some of the legends just now, guys. So, I think we're going to do the post game and then we'll do Shaman and Darkrai later on, I reckon. I think that might be... Unless you guys... Um, I don't know how the post game works. I have got no knowledge, nothing based on how the, um, the post game works. I also... Got a uh, real time scene. I uh, got a refrigerator. <laughs> got a refrigerator, which was <laughs> just a random refrigerator. That's kind of cool, at least. All right, let's get uh, back to our proper style. So, Ruby Core uniform, and there we go. Just need the hat now. Perfect. I, I like this look. This look is kind of cool. You're hunting Shiny Burma. You completed every task on the page. You only need to catch uh, Arcus for the Shiny Charm now and uh, that the Shiny Burma hunt starts. Well, that's kind of cool at least. Arcus will be, um, Arcus will definitely be a very interesting one. So, well, the final boss is uh, in post game is just completely unfair. Is it Rekel? Uh, no, I, I, I should shut up. Okay, I'm going to shut up. Um, Palkia? And I guess I should be saying uh, Dialga depending on whatever one you chose. Uh, that fight was, that was already unfair. And I also didn't realize when I was watching back, um, you could send your Pokemon in. So, Draconic is dumb. All right, I think I'm going to need a hundred more of these. A hundred more of your finest Pokeballs, my man. And um, let's get uh, stocked up, guys. I want to stock up. That's just not fair. Stock up. Just make sure that we're all good to go. Sure, this is probably the last time that I might purchase Leaden Balls, but we'll see. Um, my budget is kind of going down right now, which is really unfortunate. Okay, that's fine. Uh, Crash, no, Jessica, do you have a level 10 research on every Pokemon? Uh, no. Is that important? Uh, guys, remember... Um, remember, no spoilers, okay? Because we are starting to go into post-game. As of now, well, not as not as of now. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go and decide my party. I'm gonna let you guys decide who we take. So let's go ahead and organize our party, guys. Okay, so Samurai level eighty, fantastic, and mo most of them are level apart from Lulligan, Every Pokemon and Bravery, <laughs> Bravery. Uh, every Pokemon that I have is uh, level fifty. Oh, I need to get Sneasel to evolve as well, so. Alright, so. Here's what we got. Here's what we got, guys. Well, I'm going to leave this entirely up to you guys on what we should do and what team we should uh, finish with. We've got Weird Deer level 64. Ursa Luna, 61. Basque Legion, 62. Sneasel, which I can evolve into Weavile. Uh, Sneasler. I can evolve this into Sneasler. Level 62. Breveri, 59. Gudra, 68. Zorog, 68. Overquill 64, Avalog is 60, Electrode is 70, Arcanine is 74, Lilligan is 59, and Cleavor is 80. What would you guys recommend, sir? 
you're crying in the corner, Jessica, or why is that? I need to catch up with the chat a little bit. If you have level 10 research on Burmy, uh, then your odds decrease from 1 in 4,000 to 1 in 2,000. That's pretty damn good odds, right? That's pretty damn good odds. Scyther, here is an invitation to die. <laughs> oh, God. Scyther, would you like to die? No. No, I would not. She says Sneezer because, of course, not. Because, uh, oh, I mean, I'm going to take Cleavor. I'm going to take Arcanine. I'm going to let you guys decide the rest. The highest level we've got here is Electrode at level 70. The others are 74 and double 80, so. I'm going to catch up. Let's see. You need level 10 research on everything for the Shining Charm. It took me a few days to complete that. I've been kind of doing it and not doing it. Well, in terms of the outbreaks and... Every single time I get a new outbreak, I'm just I just complete the level ten research just like that. So, Farrick says electrode, um, and Shade says Sneezler. We could probably do that. Basket Legion and Sneezler. Basket Legion and Sneezler. We could probably do that. Oh, uh, Basket Legion. I would not had a chance to properly use that. And Sneezler. Let's have a look and see what we got. Is that what we're going with? Sneezer is very good for catching the mons because of its signature move. For all right, interesting. Electro Bravery and Gumi. Well, Gudra, you mean? Gudra. We can always mix this up a little bit. If there's ever a scenario where we need to mix up the, t you know what? I assuming that we're going to be fighting multiple legends, we can swap out the teams, uh, just based on the legends that we're fighting. Um, I think that would actually be a good compromise, guys. If that would be good, so we can always we can always adjust our team. Based on what we got here, so we can always go back and adjust our team. This will do for now. This will do for now. Uh, Bravarian Gudra. I'm gonna get Bravarian Gudra in the at some point. I think it's gonna completely depend on what our post game is, because we can always swap out our party anytime, guys. Always. So Razor Fang. Wait, this is a Fang for. This is for uh, Gliger, right? Never mind, Shay. I don't think I have the item. <laughs> don't think I've got the item, so. Oh, man. It's it's, it's really annoying because, you know, I just don't have the item for... Um... If I find it, I find it. We'll see what happens. Okay. All right. Let's head on over to... Uh, why don't you use the shiny version? So, I'm not using the shiny version because... One, these are the kind of the Pokemon that we've encountered throughout our journey. And... Um... I kind of want to stick with them. I, re I really do like them, and I kind of want to stick them. And I've been using them throughout all the outbreaks, and it just feels good. Uh, the shiny versions of them are under-leveled. Well, most of them are, of course. And at the same time, I kind of want to transfer the shiny versions into uh, Gen 9, when if, if that's available, of course. So, Razor Claw. So, we had a Razor Fang there, unfortunately. So, uh, Just a tip for Final Boss. You definitely need Dialga and Palkia. Oh, that's right. I could probably bring them into the party as well. So, I guess that does make a bit of sense. Um, if we need Dialga and Palkia, we can definitely bring them in, so. But, so far, at the moment, I have not had the need for Legends, so, hopefully, hopefully, we won't need them. But, we'll wait and see what happens. Could always bring Manaphy in. Manaphy would be, uh, would be interesting. Alright. Guys, we are now officially starting post-game. So, if you have not reached this far in the game, um, assuming most of you guys have reached post-game and you've done post-game, um, I'm going to start post-game. So, if you don't want any spoilers, uh, I'm going to ask you guys kindly. Uh, you are welcome to leave the stream. I'm not going to be mad. Uh, I would rather you guys not get spoiled from anything. But if you guys want to stick around, then that's absolutely incredible and awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and enjoy the post-game, all right? I'll give you guys a quick one minute warning, all right? And uh, Noah Gaming, hello, 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 hello. How are you doing? Hope things are going really good, buddy. And Onion is also here. Going to the villages and main building. I did, Onion. Plenty of times. Plenty of times, buddy.
So just re just for reference, guys, how long does post game last? How long does uh, post game last? Is it two or three hours, or is it going to be a lot more longer than that? So, uh, got to me in building in the village. Did that already, Onion. Um, did that already. Level ten research or completed uh, completed decks. But it just needs to be level ten research on all Pokemon. I think that's what Shay's saying. Jake is in a space time distortion. Good luck with that one, buddy. Here's a tip for post game: use super effective moves. Oh, thanks, Freddy. <laughs> thanks. If you get to the point uh, I'm at, uh, or until you finish the ass bonus. Oh, God. Okay. All right, let's get going. You know what I should have done before doing this? I should have done Spiritomb, but this is okay. I I'm fairly okay with this. We'll do Spiritomb after this, I guess. Draconic, there you are. Have a look here, if you will. A good, long, close look, please. All right, it's been a long time, but let's get some narration on the go. See these patterns modeled after Pokemon? I've come to think that they might be letters rather than hieroglyphs, if you will. I've inspected ruins across the region and have concluded that they are all seem to tell the same tale. The tale of a brave soul who, together with the Pokemon at his side, went on a journey to search for the fragments of an all-encompassing deity. Uh, deity? Uh, let's see, I, th uh, I thought it was, uh, I have to do that. <laughs> I got uh, Shiny Seasel. Nice. A full odds. Bronzong and Shiny Scyther. Decidueye. Doing good, buddy. Also welcome. Hope things are going good, buddy. If you can play a certain Pokemon's uh, page, it's Shiny Odds that go down to 1 in 1,000. That's pretty damn strong, Shay. An all-encompassing deity, the creator of this very universe, and its name is... Arceus. Yep. Perhaps you've already heard this name. Does sound familiar. It does sound familiar. Of course, what else could I have expected from the hero who saved the Hisui region? But now, let us discuss the fragments. They must surely be the plates. Yes, the very plates you collected as you went about quelling all the frenzied nobles. Haven't you noticed that they all have words carved on their backs? Go on, give them a read. Alright. The original one breathed alone before the universe came. The original one is none other than the Pokemon known as Arceus. So what do you say, Draconic? I think we should try to gather all the plates. Let's gather all the plates, guys. Um, and I've got just the idea where to start our search. Join me in the heart of Grueling Grove. All right. So I guess we're going from each area to... Uh, I guess we're going from area to area. Oh, um, finally going up there then. Okay, sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. Very cool. What's going on with you, buddy? If it be, uh, let's see, Shay, if I get another Sneasel, I'll give it to you. No, 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 no. Only I am the one that gives Shay the other alternative shiny Sneasel. You cannot do that. You cannot bend. You cannot bend that uh, reality. <laughs> uh, it would be time to uh, consume to start the hunt now. If uh, you've done only burn me like that, uh, I've just wiped in uh, for the Shiny Charm. Shiny Charm sounds like it's going to be very, very important to grab, so... Shiny Charm will definitely help out with your hunts, but from what I've heard, Outbreaks are way better than the Shiny Charm, so. But with Outbreaks, it's very, very, you only get one shot at Outbreaks, which kind of makes sense. I guess they uh, underestimated the uh, the kind of exploit that people are seeing where they can keep the, um, where they can kind of keep the, um, the Outbreak that they want, so. You'll get it eventually, Firex. I've found Quillfish. Um, I found Quillfish a good few times. So, uh, two Octa Race. I think you two Octa Race. <laughs> Ooh, sounds exciting, Shay. You be the referee. Now, Draconic. According to my own investigations. Oh! Wow, an Alpha Vespaquen. Terribly sorry. Draconic, but do you think you can handle it? <sighs> sure. 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 Nothing to see here, guys. N there's nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Yes, I know I can catch this. Oh, it is Alpha as well, so I may as well catch this. Draconic scared by Big B. Yeah, Best Bitcoin is still haunting my uh, my dreams to this day. That male combi, all right. Look, listen, Best Bitcoin. If you're if you're here because of how much I've insulted that shiny combi that I caught 
Uh, a while back? I I'm sorry, okay? You didn't need to jump scare me like that. I had flash guns. <laughs> yeah, you're absolutely right, Freddy. You're absolutely correct. God damn it. All right. All right. This might be the, the one time where I might disable the, the Dracoin stuff. Only until we've done the post game. But I'll allow it this first time, guys. I'll allow it this first time. Uh, Draco, was that Draco Appreciation and lifting weights? I think it was. All right. Let's get Draco Appreciation and let's start lifting some weights, all right? And then we're going to go ahead and deal with the best of Quinn. Sorry, the um, the queen who's uh, called... Uh, you guys already know. All right. Draco, you're getting appreciated, all right? There he is. There you are, Draco. <laughs> All right. We've been insulting the bee, guys. We insulted the bee. All right. Let's lift. Get lifted. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You like this, Best of Queen? Thirteen, fourteen. Gonna knock at this queen in a second. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. There we go. That's good. Uh, gamer muscles, guys. Gamer muscles. <laughs> hey, buddy. Okay, okay. Draco looks like he could be a bit on the move again, so we'll just position the camera like that. And let's get back. Let's get back to the action, alright? This is what the internet was created for. Welcome to the internet. Reticonic uh, gets scared by bees and lifts some weights. He's also got uh, a pet lizard where we uh, appreciate him every single time. Oh, look, it's daytime now. Uh, let's... Agile air slash, let's see. It's my dumb bee. It's, it's the dumb bee. What do you mean you're a dumb bee? Alright, okay, that's good to catch. That's good to catch. Oh, power jam? Okay, that's, uh, you know, that exists. Let's catch it. You hope for a combi outbreak? If we get a combi outbreak, uh, I think we do it, right? <laughs> I think we have to do it. We got the best for Quinn. That's what you get for jump scaring me. I mean, what? Um, that part of the stream got absolutely cut out. Draconic getting jump scared? Absurd. Unlikely. Um... Draconic is the the bravest YouTuber alive. He would never get um, he would never get scared like that. Oh, we just got a stone plate. Nice. <laughs> That's my facial reaction, getting scared by Vespa Quinn. I think a combi outbreak would be absolutely fantastic. Facial expression of me getting scared. Ah. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's see. I kill for any combi of either gender. Hey, well, le well, listen, no, no, listen, listen. You only want female combi because it only of that's the only one that evolves into best of coin. The male ones, they're terrible. You don't want that. They just don't evolve. We got the stone plate. So why a stone plate? That's weird. Best of coin's a flying in bug type. Why do we get a stone plate? Hey, I'm not gonna argue. We get another plate at least though. Uh, Davin, how you doing, Davin? Welcome, welcome. Hope things are going good with you, buddy. And Pob Alpha, poor Alpha Best because I'm ads. Fine, don't don't worry about her. The outbreak won't appear. Yeah, you never know, never know. Why did the Alpha Pokemon have the plate we were looking for? Maybe it just happened to find the plate lying around. In any case, that's the only other plate that I had any information about. So that's that. And yet nothing seems to be happening, which makes me suspect there must still be more plates left out there for us to find. Not to worry though, I know the perfect person to ask. She's bound to know all about the plates. Mistress Cogita? Sounds about right. The one and only Mistress Cogita. Yes. You haven't had the chance to properly thank her for your, her help in obtaining the red chain. Am I right? All the more reason to pay her a visit. So onwards to the ancient retreat. Let us retreat to the ancient retreat, guys. That sounds like a plan. That sounds like the best plan of all. 
And let's cash in our Vespa Quinn. You've ever combi to Vespa Quinn? I think combi's got a cute side to it, but Vespa Quinn, of course, has that very um Vespa Quinn has that kind of what am I what's the word we're looking for for Vespa Quinn? The first word that comes to mind is elegant, but I don't think Vespa Quinn is elegant. Uh Vespa Quinn's more it's more of a leader. More more of the leader type of role, if that makes kind of sense. So Follow is sus. Very, very sus. Um, just keep that piano away from me. <laughs> Let us. You won't be talking much about still watching. No problem at all, Jake. No problem at all, buddy. It's uh, it's kind of reassuring to know. God, I haven't, still haven't done the research for this. It's okay. We'll rack it up anyway. Um, I have a funny feeling we're going to be going to every area. So, oh, we're, uh, we may as well just do Spirit Home in the village. That kind of makes sense, right? Horrifying. You think Vespa Quinn is horrible? Well, to be fair, others oh, are shine. Oh my goodness, the big, the big ones are out. <laughs> the big ones are out, guys. There's our shiny Ursha Luna just hanging out, guys. What's behind Snorlax? <laughs> so that's a big, big Snorlax, guys. Trying to catch that was a bit of a pain, but we got it. And Grip Rocks is good, and we got all the Wisps. You've gathered every last one of the wisps. I really can't thank you enough. Now we can finally seal away that havoc wrecking bundle of mischief once more. But we'll need to go to the shrouded ruins. That's the only place the sealing will work. And that's in the Marlins, right? We should meet there at the same time of day as when we first met. Hope you remember. All right. All right. I said, I, I seen someone say something about spoilers, and I don't want, if there's any spoilers, guys, uh, Shay, just, just delete it, okay? I don't want to know anything about spoilers, okay? Please, no spoilers. Also, got a Greg's uh, sausage roll. Nice one, nice one. Uh, Don't give me any spoilers, guys, okay? Please don't give me any spoilers, okay? Oh, you know what? Guys, I gotta do this, alright? I gotta do this. Please bear with me for just a brief moment while we embrace the sound and effects of Cricketune. I seen Shay put in spoilers and I, I, I've i stopped reading the chat. So Shay, can you get rid of any spoilers right now? I just don't want any spoilers, please guys. I was kind of spoiled leading up towards the uh, the end of the, the original story, but now I don't want any spoilers for, uh, for this last bit, okay? So please, 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 please. Please none. Please none. Let's see if we can get the cricket tune though. Just the cricket tune, that's it, and then I'm gonna get back to everything else, alright? Just using a feather ball. Just doing another one because why the hell not? Because cricket tune makes the funny awesome sounds. Excuse me? Excuse me? What? Oh, maybe it's just because it's angered. Or whatever. I don't know. I don't know. That's weird that the attack's not working. That's so weird. Okay. That is so weird that the Feather Ball would not work like that. Yeah, okay. Feather Ball sucks. Feather Ball sucks. Yeah, feather balls sucks. It really does. These feather balls just don't make any sense at all. Let's try and catch that one then. So, you saw it and deleted it. Okay. Okay, outbreak is done. We don't need to do anything else. No shiny uh, cricket tune, guys. Uh, I already got the. But uh, I've already got a shiny version of it. I just wanted a bonus round. Just a bonus round because I don't think I got it live on stream. So, that was a little. Um, that was a little bonus for you guys. We didn't get it, but I already got it, so. Omni Adam's here. How you doing, Omni Adam? Uh, Malik is here. Guys, stop overreacting. Someone already told all legends to Draconic. But Malik, I don't know what legends are available. So please, please, guys. I don't want any knowledge, okay? Spoiler free, spoiler free, spoiler free, guys, all right? I didn't know that was uh, in this. Uh, that's why I did it question mark. Yeah, but okay. I, uh, my name is Coordinator Cornadius Cornwall. <laughs> That name sounds so familiar. Where have I heard that? Oh my god, Chansey. Uh, no, I, I, I'm escaping. I'm escaping. Uh, get doo whoop. <laughs> Whoopers. Oh, you know, I'm disappointed Whoopers not in this game. 
Looper would have been a very fun one to, to hunt. But it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Is there an unknown around here? If there's an unknown in this area, uh, just let me know, guys. Of course, just let me know. You also have a shiny Dilla Whoop and my favorite Pokemon. And that's good. I know Banjo's a very uh, big fan of that as well, so. Uh, on the team. Uh, my name is Cord Cornelius Cornwall. Corne Cornelius Cornwall. Where is that from, Omni Adam? Also, how you doing, buddy? Where is that from? There's no unknowns here. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. I don't know why I'm thinking this, but why do I get the weird feeling that she's related to Cynthia as well? Just a black outfit and the hair? I I, I, I don't know. Volo does make sense. Volo makes sense. I don't know about her. I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Shiny Shuckle, how are you doing, Shuckle? Hope things are going absolutely brilliant today, buddy. Hope things are going good, buddy. Uh, there is an unknown on the roof of the main building of Jubilife City. Oh, is there? All right. Well, I'll keep an eye out for that one then. Oh, lost one. It's miraculous what you've done. It seems the red chain served its purpose well. Oh, hey, Volo. He just popped out of nowhere. I thought it was uh, Corporal Cornelius Cornball or something. It says Corporal? It was a joke. It's not my real name. It's a joke. Now hackers are going to uh, snatch your account. Oh, God. <laughs> You spoiled your name, the hackers are going to steal accounts. Don't let the hackers steal accounts, guys. We're going to get through this bit of dialogue, then I'll get back to you. And you carried out your duty as you were bid. But what brings you here? Have you yet need of me? About Arceus, of course. Ah, yes. A tale whose origins lie a millennium or two days old. Or two, two days. Yeah, two days ago. Those were the days of the ancient Sinnoh people, from whom I am descended across many generations. These forebearers of mine worshipped Arceus as the Pokemon that created the Siri region. And I have heard of certain fragments, plates as they are called, that were given to the ancestors of Pokemon such as Cleavor and Weirdeer. Is that all? I thought that surely you could tell us more about Arceus and the plates. I'm afraid I've nothing new to tell you. Why, the Diamond and Pearl Clans would never confuse Dialga and Palkia with the creator. Arceus had anything concrete been passed down. If only we had more to go on, the answers to these mysteries may even shed light on why Draconic here fell from the sky. I see what you intend. Very well, I'll help as best I can. You got a plate to give us? There are still other tremendous Pokemon in Hisui, other mysteries to be solved. Whether they are connected to Arceus, I cannot say for certain. But in searching them out, perhaps you'll stumble upon the path you seek. Let me think. There are the Pokemon of the lakes, of course, and the Temple Giant... Gigas? The crescent moon, the volcano, and perhaps you might even return to the very beginning. Now then, what would you hear of? Okay, interesting. Three lakes, we know that. Volcano, that's Heatran. Crescent moon is Cresselia. Temple giant is Regigigas. And the beginning? Um, the only other one is Garatina? That's not Garatina. I'll come back to that in a second. That can be Garatina. MJ Murray, how's it going, buddy? We're just doing the um, the post game right now. Trying to avoid spoilers, of course. So, I think we need, what, there's 18 types? 18 plates? We've got 11. We need 7, right? 7 more. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We get these? Okay, all of these have got the, the remaining plates, right? Or was that, oh Jesus, he made my heart jump over, over Mars. What, the, the character Mars, or, uh, <laughs> we need seven, we need seven more plates, I'm assuming, Davin, assuming that there's 18 types. You don't actually remember who the beginner is. I have no idea, I have no idea. It's, the only other one that I can think of is Garatina, because Shaman and Darkrai are quests. Three lakes. You already know. Go give them your thanks for the red chain and show them how strong you've become. Okay. That's that one. Uh, the volcano. Well, where could that be but Firespit Islands? Okay. The Crescent Moon. 
Yes, the moon. You must go where you may meet the moon's gaze unobstructed. Does that clue illuminate your path? That sounds... There's a quest. Yeah, okay, Highlands. There's a quest that I did yesterday, which involved Clefairy. So I think I know exactly where I need to go. So that's fine. I might be wrong, though, but we'll see. Now then. The Temple Giant. The secret that lurks in Snowpoint Temple. To find it, you must open the door that is sealed. Oh, but I need to do all the other Reggies as well. Are they in this game? Is Drago and Alecky in this as well? That'd be interesting. Alright, beginning. Indeed, a beginning for you, certainly. Where was it you first fell to the... A plate on the beach. Okay. Okay, interesting. Okay, okay. Yeah, I guess we're all done. I guess we're all done. Alright. Uh, no spoilers, of course, like I said, guys, okay? No spoilers, of course, like I said. But, well, there was no spoilers going forward. I, I think we already know that these already existed, which is good, but I don't really want to know. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see, we'll see, okay? Do the beginning first. What do you guys think I should do first? I'm going to go ahead and let you guys decide, all right? What to do first? Lake Trio. Oh, hang on a minute. Lake Trio. And okay, <laughs> let's see. Let's see. There's a question going out to every single one of you guys, and we're gonna go ahead and do it in order of most popular. Um, the beginning sounds like Garatina could be at work here, so I'm gonna save that one for last. I would assume that's Garatina, right? I would assume that the, the beginning is Garatina. I kind of want to do Garatina last, though. <laughs> no, just grab, just grab the corn. Volcano sounds good. Volcano. Well, a majority of you guys will really want me to do the volcano, so. Nobody wants me to do the temp. Guys, Reggie Gigas is my is one of my favorite legends, all right? No spoilers. Please don't say spoil the post game for the crying. Yeah, no spoilers, okay? No spoilers, of course. Just let me, let me enjoy this. But it looks like majority wins for the volcano. We're going to the volcano, guys. So I'm about to get hat. Let's get going. It appears that the opening of the space-time rift compel Pokemon that might otherwise have stayed hidden to come out and see what has befallen the world. I hope you succeed for your own sake and that of the Pokedex you labour on. Alright, I knew we could rely on you, Mistress Kogita. That's more than enough information to work with. Now, let us find those plates. Alright, let's get going. Uh, you're, you are your local moon voter. Hey, thanks, cookies. A voter of the moon, I see. Should we pin that after the poll? Uh, should we pin what after the poll, Holly? No spoilers, please won't uh, spoil the post game. Uh, I'm going to put that right there. Pin message. Holly, you've got your message posted. Wait, grab the corn. <laughs> There's an unknown at the volcano as well. I've got the unknown at the volcano. I'm very disappointed I couldn't catch it in a Pokeball. That's my biggest disappointment, unfortunately. So. Uh... It is for the better good. Uh, what, uh, what is Callum? What is for the better good? And uh, Godless is here. Is the Yugo tournament this weekend? Uh, I don't know. I think we're going to give it a try, Godless. We'll try and see how many numbers we can get for it. So, If we can gather all the plates from them and decipher the message on the backs of the plates at last, perhaps we can meet Arceus itself. You should go search for the Pokemon that Kogita mentioned, Draconic. I have my own avenues of research that I like to, to pursue. Sure. Chase's last message. Oh, God, this is going to... Take a guess at who you think Laventon's ancestors are. Laventon's ancestors? Remind me who Laventon is. Laventon is... Um... Laventon's the professor. Um, Honestly, I have no idea. I have no idea. We're doing the volcano first. Volcanoes first. Arceus creator of all I truly can't wait to see what kind of Pokemon it might be. It's a god. It's not a Pokemon. It's a god. Alright, let's head on out of here, guys. Dang it, I got muted. Damn, you didn't get muted. Instead of the Kino lies a griller waiting for you. Oh goodness. Right, let's go and uh, let's go ahead and um I guess when we get into each shape, I guess we can probably do the lake spirits as we go. Okay. I had a funny feeling it was gonna be a cutscene. I've uh, I've had a message from Mistress Kogita. I'm told you're collecting plates of some sort with the merchant follow. 
Yes. Then we must go to Prelude Beach. Meet me there. Um. Oh, that's the um, the play of Prelude. Be Hang on a minute. That's the beginning. All right. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna do that one. <laughs> I'm gonna do that one uh, last. We're gonna do the volcano one first. So let's make our team. Let's build up our team to deal with um, what I'm assuming is a heat trend. I'm also went to the wrong place. <laughs> he is the ancestor. He's the ancestor. Uh, I know who I think Valentine is the ancestor of. Leon and Hop? Really? Yo, that actually would <laughs> that would actually kind of make a better sense, would it? I don't know. I would think I would need I, I don't see it to be fair. I don't really see it. Um Oh my god. We we're actually getting cutscenes? Okay, that's fine. This is actually okay. That festival attended by everyone in the clans and galaxy team alike. Oh, it was wonderful. Being able to spend time with Iceskin in front of everyone was like a dream come true. Draconic Lena, uh, I'm sorry, Paulina here has something she wants to discuss with you. All right. Yeah, they're about whom I'm theorizing she. It could be, could be. Just like the, the brothers uh, take some instead pride in his work. I mean, Leon is a champion, but Hop just wants to be champion. I don't, I don't, I guess I would need to get a proper look at the professor and see if that ancestry does go down that path, but uh, you wish I had this game, it's so cool. This game is so much fun, Chuckle, and it, hopefully it gets good, hopefully it gets much better. Um, the evidence is that Levinson uses a rich phrases such as uh, jolly good and Hop goes on to study as a professor too. That's true, you're actually correct about that. You are 100% right, Hop does go and try, uh, tries to be uh, Sonya's uh, assistant. And Sonya's a pr professor, of course. That's right. You should also hear this, Erida. It seems something is once again very much a mess on Farspit Island. Ooh, Farspit Island. Once again. Oh, dear. You seem reluctant to get involved. It's just very hot there. Yep, it is a volcano. It is very hot there. Ma, you speak in such disparaging terms of the seat that my lord Arcanine calls home. And to think, you call yourself our leader, Erida? No, no, Lena. I didn't. Oh, stop with that silly old nickname in front of others, won't you? I'm sorry, I didn't mean anything by it. It's just an old habit. People also think that Paulina and Ice King combined makes Nessa. Nessa. I, you know, I could probably see it in Ice King. And do I see it in Erida? I don't know. I don't know. But that would, that would actually kind of make sense. That would kind of make sense. All right. Well, anyway, you heard her. Please get to Farspit Island so we can resolve this. Truly, please hurry. I might mail out there. Farspit Island? Right, guys, we need... If this is... Uh, let's be honest, it's Heatran, all right? We already know it's Heatran. So, let's set ourselves up. Let's set ourselves up for what we got, all right? Samuel, definitely. Um, fire... All right, so I've got to ask you guys. Are the catches guaranteed... Is capturing Heatran and all the other legends, are they a 100% guarantee catch? I would quite like to know that uh, just now, if you guys uh, don't mind. I'm just going to build up the team. Uh, Ursaluna's a definite. Ursaluna's a definite. Uh, Basque Legion's 100%. Gudra could be good on the special defense side. Avalog. Mm. Let's see. You think so? Go on the Vulcan. Uh, you think so? Okay. So if I, if they're in this fight, if I knock it out, so if I knock it out, it's, um, if I knock it out, it's going to catch, right? I think Arcanine? I don't think so. They're not you. Uh, they're not a guaranteed catch, I know, but the catch rates are very boosted. Okay, so, yeah, because we caught Dialga and a Pokeball, so don't worry, I have 200 Pokeballs with me. Uh, we'll bring Arcanine. Arcanine uh, and a Volcano, it makes sense, all right? Let's not bring Avalog to the Volcano. Um, all right, we got options. I think we could probably bring Quill, uh, Overquill. Overquill seems to do, good, do, do really good for us. All right, we got our team, guys. We have our team. To the island of lava we go. Uh, it is possible for Red Stripe and Blue Stripe Basket to evolve. Um, that's, very, that's a very interesting question. Because my Basque Legion is uh, is different compared to the uh, the right uh, the um, the Lord's one, so which is weird. Have you got a shiny? I've got lots of shinies, lots and lots of shinies, buddy. 
Lots of them. We're ne we've nearly gotten all the Hisuian forms, so we're just kind of working on that one right now. Uh, gender difference when it evolves. Okay, so I guess the kind of white striped one is male or female, uh, and the the red striped one is the opposite, right? I don't know which uh, which gender I've got for my Basque Legion, so. Right. Let's see. Hello, Draconic. Thank you for coming so far out of your way. You know what? I could probably see Iceken being related to Nessa. Probably. Because Iceken is water user. He's got Basque Legion. Nessa, she uses water types. I could probably see that. I could see that. Alright. Uh, Warden Iceken, wasn't Lena joining us? Oh, yes, about that. Um, it seems she wanted some time with her lord, so she asked us to check the Lava Dome Sanctum without her. What? The nerve of... She knows I can't stand sweltering places like this. I'm sure she meant no ill well. The Warden of the Lord of the Isles is such a kind, gentle soul. Anyway, Draconic, shall we go? Might as well get this over with. Let's uh, safety save. Blue is female and red is male. Alright, so my Basque Legion is female then. Okay. But I, guess, I guess it doesn't matter. I guess it doesn't matter on gender. Alright. Okay. Heatran, let's go. Okay. Alright, so let's see how these battles work. Careful, Draconic. Oh, be careful. Okay, uh, what are these things on the... Oh. I think I... Okay. Do I just need to weaken it down? Goodness, okay. Okay, let's try and catch it. First go, please. God damn. Okay, so this is good. Just weaken it down with all this ball. <laughs> Ow, we took a hit there, that's fine. Yes, guys, I'm trying to catch it in a Pokeball, because why? Of course not. Gotta be honest, quite like this. Ow, that was a little bit too preemptive there. Catch it, come on. Post game final boss is awesome. I hope so. God damn. Okay, this is this is a bit of a challenge. Okay, 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 okay. Can I escape? Can I escape? Okay. Do we get it now? God damn! All right, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. Okay, okay, okay. I did get to catch Arceus in a Pokeball. Oh, I'm doing it. I will be catching Arceus in a Pokeball. I've already made that decision. So, so of course I'm catching all of them. I'm catching all the legend Pokeballs. Nice little personal challenge, I think. Personal challenge. Maybe I should just engage it in battle. Gonna start engaging it in battle if this doesn't work. We got the Heatran in a Pokeball. Let's go! Alright. Alright, guys, you may start voting for whoever we're gonna go for next. We got the Volcano. You are welcome to change your votes. Go ahead and decide Lake Trio, the Moon, or the Temple, because Volcano is done. Alright. You know, I thought this, uh, that was a shiny heat trend, but when I realized that the only thing that changed in is uh, shiny's eyes, yeah. Well, we got the iron plate. Let's go. We got it in a Pokeball, guys. We got it in a Pokeball. All right, so we got Moon from uh, Cookies. Remember, you can vote, guys. You can vote. Let's see that volcano number start to go down, all right? We got a griller on the roster. We got a griller. We got a griller. Mm -mm, I can smell those burgers already. All right. One more plate. One more plate. Okay. Lake Trio, it gives three. Lake Trio does have three, but... Your pin message? What do you mean, uh, what do you mean, uh, what do you mean your pin message, Holly? 
it's uh, it's still there. The the Joestar technique is they're running away. So running away is a, is a JoJo reference. Uh, if you enter battle and then just uh, throw Pokeballs at it, yeah, just enter in battle, throw Pokeballs, and that works. You finally got distortion, Raquel. Good stuff. Like to hear it. Is it possible for you to nickname Heatran Griller because it looks like one? I don't nickname them. Um, Davin, I usually don't nickname my Pokemon. I think whenever I'm doing uh, Nuzlocks, I will. So, you can vote again, guys. Okay, let me do this again. So, so you guys all voted for the volcano. Holly, if you dismiss the poll, it'll be there. The poll, the poll is there. Okay, the poll is still there. Sorry, sorry. The, your pinned message is still there, Holly. Whew. <laughs> she does not like the heat. All right, she does not like the heat at all. Let's get the next poll up. Or two next. Okay, guys, we still have. I'm gonna also go ahead and put Spiritomb on there as well. Spiritomb isn't a legendary, of course, but I'm gonna put Spiritomb on there as an option for you guys. So now that we kind of have an idea of what we're doing, so okay, at least that at least the heat's uh, let up a bit. She does not like the heat at all. <laughs> With both Arcanine and heat transpiring flames about on a volcanic island, it certainly does get a bit toasty. Warden and Iceskin, I have to ask, do you think there was any need at all for me to be here? Uh, well, um, yes, of course there was. After all, you're the leader of the Pearl Clan. And this trouble cropped up right around the sea of one of your clan's nobles. So, um, yes, it was surely best for you to come see to it. Admirable of you to look after your clan's affairs. Okay, that's genius. I smell heat trying cooking burgers. Heat trying cooking burgers is good. It smells real good. Uh, clean water for Pokemon it helps the environment. That's true. Nice uh, boiling hot water. Uh, get rid of all the germs and it's very, very good. And our man's here, Dual Elite Trio, it gives, it gives three. How you doing anyway, our man? Uh, I've left it up to the vote, and everyone's currently voting right now. And most of you guys just want to do the moon over the uh, the Lake Trio. I'm going to let that settle for just a, a little bit, guys. I was wondering if it might not be revenge for all the times I pushed Lena to train her Growlithe harder. The, that's surely not the case. Even if Warden Paulina may have mentioned something about the need for um, tough love, I thought so. To think, she was so patient and kind with Growlithe, but when it comes to me, well, Draconic, you did great. Well, um, just head back ahead of you then. One down, seven to go for including Spiritomb. Uh, we gotta include Spiritomb anyway, but it doesn't look like you guys are voting for Spiritomb, so I'm gonna assume it doesn't seem too good. So it seems there might be four more plates left for you to find. Four? Only four? Three? What? That that doesn't sound right. Maybe the Lake Trio uh, only offers one. That's interesting. The Lake Trio only offers one? Four plates to find? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We need six more plates. The Lake Trio is only offering one. Reggie Gigas is two. Lunal is three. The beginning, which I assume is Garatina, is four. What's the other two? Arceus? And maybe uh, Volo has one? I'm not messing a leg. Okay, whatever. Um... No, wait, the Lake Trio, wait. That doesn't, all right, okay, sure. Uh, we'll, we'll just roll with it, we'll just roll with it. That doesn't, right, okay. Uh, let's get going. Dragon. Yeah, Dragon, I'm assuming that Dragon is going to be Garatina, right? Because I don't think we have the Dragon plate. That doesn't, okay, uh, sure. Where did you get Lunala uh, from? Oh, Lunala, uh, Cresselia. They're both the moon, all right? They're both the moon. It's Dragon that the Lake Trio gives. Well, don't tell me that, Arman. God, please. Stop spoiling it, guys. All right, so let me guess. Garatina is a ghost then. Sure. Okay, whatever. 
Right. Okay. Anyway. Anyway. Okay. Stops. God, I don't even. Off. God. Guys, please don't, all right? Please don't. Please don't, all right? I'm more than happy to get back into a good mood and start enjoying this, but if I get any more um, tiny little details or spoilers, I'm just going to stop streaming and I'm going to take this off, all right? Because I'm... Because I'm just... I'm just getting really, really tired, all right? Holly, if you want to make that pin message again, I feel bad about accidentally removing it, so if you want to see it again, then that's absolutely fine, so... So, please, guys, please... It's, I was spoiled a little bit here and there during the game itself, so please stop ruining the post game, all right? Thank you. Please. <sighs> Let me figure it out. Let me figure it out. All right? Like I said, I can, I can just stop live streaming and take this just off stream and just enjoy it in my own pace, so. So please don't. Please don't. Anyway. If you want to spoil it, go and find another YouTuber and spoil it with them. No, actually, don't do that, all right? Don't do that. Guys, put yourself into my position, okay? If I'm a huge, if you're a YouTuber and you're playing the game for the very first time and you get spoiled about every single thing, you wouldn't like it. You wouldn't like it, all right? New game comes out, you're live streaming a game for the very first time, Draconic pops along and spoils the entire story, everything you could do. You wouldn't like that. You wouldn't like that. I didn't ruin Spider-Man for you guys. So please don't ruin Legends Arceus post game for me, okay? Please don't. I'm getting really, I'm getting really annoyed by that. I didn't ruin Spider Man for you guys, so please don't ruin Ar Legends Arceus. And I'll just go ahead and replace that pin message. Uh, this is a blind playthrough of the post game in Legends Arceus. Thanks, Holly. Uh, should spoil as a result in the timeout. I think. Uh, yeah, Shay. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say this right now. If uh, hey, lady, how you doing? If anybody gives any more spoilers, Shay, you have full permission to time out, okay? And then once you do that, just please uh, put it on copy and paste, all right? Copy and paste, Shay. You have full permission to time out and um, just also put in the message there not to spoil, okay? Because I want to keep reading the chat. I kind of want this. I still want to hang out with you guys and talk with you guys because, but please, no, no more spoilers, okay? I just want to enjoy this. I just want to enjoy this, okay? All right, smiles are back. Smiles are back. We're all good. Hopefully, you guys understand what I'm saying, okay? Hopefully, you guys understand what I'm saying. Don't make Draco mad. Otherwise, I'll Dynamax him and ask you guys to... I'll ask Draco to... Draco will Dynamax and uh, find out where you live and um, chew your hand off. And then you won't be able to play any games. All right. Um... I mean, our man... There was no need to do that just now, Shay. Uh, no need to do that right now. Um, our man now understands, but as of now, as of now, no spoilers, okay? No spoilers. My luck has been uh, horrendous with these outbreaks. Reset this uh, so much. The reset stuff does is a bit tedious, cookies, but you'll get there eventually. And Lydia's been studying. That's good news. That's some really good news. Well, studying's a little bit annoying, of course, but. Hopefully it's going well. Should I update again to say spoiler will end up in a timeout? Nah, just just leave it as it is. It looks like Shay's got it under control. So Shay has got it under control. Just let 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 Shay have it, okay? Okay. And Shay, if you do a good job, we'll we'll keep your admin rights. <laughs> we'll keep it, unfortunately, but that's fine. <laughs> okay, let's get going. Hopefully we all understand each other. There is heat trend caught in a pokeball. All good to go. Just remember for chat, imagine you're playing a game for the first time, streaming it, and then all of a sudden someone comes in and spoils the whole thing for you. How would you feel if that was you? Exactly. Exactly. Just don't ruin it, okay? Just imagine it's the movies, all right? Just imagine it's the movies. Uh, just imagine you're watching Star Wars Episode Five for the very first time. Everything builds up to that dramatic fight. Luke Skywalker against Darth Vader. 
It all leads to the very end of the fight. And then I'm not going to say it anymore because that is spoiler territory. All right? You guys know what's going to happen next. But for those that have not seen Star Wars Episode Five, I will uh, not spoil it. Uh, right. Let's head on out of here. Let's see if there's anything. So you guys see the, uh, the moon. So we're going to go ahead and do the moon. All right? The moon makes sense. Since I fully completed uh, this game, I'll know what's the spoiler. Thanks, buddy. I was thinking about the same thing, Draconic. Um... All right, <laughs> what with the um? Okay, thank goodness it's a teddy bear, so that's fine. Um. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. So you guys want to do the moon? Uh, the moon is up next. The play of Moon View Arena. Wait, hang on. Is there an arena? In the Highlands? Is there also? I I guess for Snow Point Temple it does make sense, but is there an arena in the Highlands? I haven't seen that, so very interesting uh well okay i guess i guess we're going to the same place where teddy ursa is so i guess we're gonna try teddy ursa outbreak so uh you have been warned i'll stay for this but i'll be a uh, spoiled so i'll stay for this but i'll be spoiled so uh it's your choice BR okay brb that's fine that's why i don't uh, stream a uh, dying light 2 yesterday on day one i just wanted to complete it and enjoy it since i waited six years since dying light one the electrode arena stupid is there Wait. Seriously? Electrodes Arena is the is the place for Cresselia? I guess that kind of makes sense. I didn't expect the Electrodes Arena, so. Right. Let's turn, let's head on down here and do this Teddy Earth Arbor because you never know if it's going to be shiny. And uh, giveaway, guys. Let it be said that uh, Draconic will always... Um, Draconic will always uh, <laughs> make you guys number one priority. But give him a break, alright? Give him a break. I think I'm going the wrong way as well. I didn't mark this, did I? Oh, I didn't mark it. Okay, that's fine. I, I I look out for you guys. So, if there is a shiny Teddy Ursa here, it's going to be a giveaway. I'm going to give away a shiny Teddy Ursa if it's shiny. So, let's find out. So far, nothing out of the gate. Nothing is out of the gate so far, guys. Ow, Luxury. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me, Luxury. Alright, let's fight. Let's fight. Let's fight. Uh, Green Bear. i got to get Nintendo Switch online uh, when giveaways restart. Giveaways will be in sort of... Well, I guess we can do giveaways in this game, because why the hell not? That'd be awesome. That'd be fun. The Mesprit doesn't want to get caught. Mesprit doesn't want to get caught. Sure. Whatever, Malik. Um, that's fine. I kind of expected that anyway. Kind of expected uh, that we're going to capture and find Mesprit anyway, so it's fine. It's understandable. I don't even know if I'm using the right Pokeball or not. kind of don't want to use the uh, the other one because it's stronger in Teddy Ursa's... Um, it's a fairly easy catch, of course, but... Fairly easy. Fairly easy. Fairly easy. Is that all of them? No, there's, there's more. Okay. They're just keep on spawning. Right, that's all of them. And oh no, that's not all of them. Jesus, how many Teddy Ursus is there? There's a lot. There's a lot. Okay. But they're not shiny. No no shiny Teddy Ursus, unfortunately, guys, so. Well, I'm just saying that I'm struggling to catch Mesprit. Okay, then that that's fine. That's fine. Okay. Number you've caught without being spotted. One more. All right, we're good. We're good. Let's uh, head back up. Organize our box because we need to get heat train out of there. So Voltorb outbreaks are really annoying. Voltorb can be annoying, but there is a nice little tactic to uh, to dealing with the Voltorbs. Um, just quietly try to uh, battle them, and if you have, if they come up to you, uh, let them self destruct, but make sure you try and dodge out of the way. Just try and dodge out of the way. And simple as that. There's our Heatran. Heatran. We can go up here to the Legends box, buddy. That's good. Uh, no Green Bear. No Green Bear. So no giveaway for the Teddy Bear, guys. I'm sorry to say. Uh, I'm not just... I'm just uh, safe. Well... And uh, Shuckle's back. Welcome back, Shuckle. 
Okay. Uh, oh, I still need to change my party. That's uh, I'll be fine. Fine for now. I don't suppose a grunt like you would even. I guess we don't need to update our. I'll be fine. I don't. I don't suppose a grunt like you would even know, but I guess it behooves me to ask. Do you know the Pokemon called Cresselia? I do. We're all very, very, very aware of that one. Put your hands up. I am back. Put your hands up. The way to, I'm just I'm just taking orders, guys. The way to beat uh, the rolling balls is to become a rolling ball. Yes, you got mess with. Good job, Malik. Can somebody help me evolve my Haunter? Um, that's by a trade, Raquel, right? Or you can use the trading cable. And it's gonna love this mechanic. I hope so, Shay. Hope so. Well, I figured you'd know. I wouldn't expect any less from someone who managed to defeat me, even if it was just a fluke. Griselia is said to be the very embodiment of the crescent moon. Her feathers are called lunar feathers, and legend says that if you hold one as you fall asleep, you'll be visited with wondrous dreams. That's nice. Well, I call her a nightmare, that pesky Cresselia. She descended upon Moonview Arena and caused my lord to hide itself away. I'm so worried about Electro that I can't even sleep, never mind dream. Hmm. Think you might be able to catch Cresselia and perhaps even claim one of those lunar feathers? Uh, yes. Oh, do catch that pesky flying croissant. <laughs> croissant? Alright, you're French now? Do it for me, poor... Do it for my poor Electro. Though I suppose Cresselia can't be all bad if she at least recognises the perfection of the arena. Looked after with loving care by the great Melly. Yeah, sure, whatever, whatever. Shiny, shiny Sneasel from one outbreak? Good! Same as me. Ah, Cresselia! Lunan. Are you guys sure this is not Lunala? <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, this is interesting. Oh, we are confused. You've got to be kidding me. Okay. Ow. Okay. Okay. And uh, Pokeball away. Shay, I see what you mean. We just had the confusion effect, which is okay. It's okay. I'm the best! I'm the best! <laughs> uh, that was kind of short-lived. The dread plate. You know, was Darkrai holding on to that plate at some point, guys? Mm -hmm. JH Racer, hi. Yes, Lanala, I'm back. What are the best? Well, I just caught Lanala in a Pokeball. Not a great ball, not an Ultra Ball, not a Heavy Ball, not a, f uh, a Flying Ball. But just a regular Pokeball on the first go. I'll take that. The dread plate. Increases the power of dark. You know, that kind of does make sense. That does make sense. Because um, Cresselia and Darkrai are basically opposites of each other. So that was kind of cool. Where's Darkrai? Are we gonna get we're gonna go ahead and do Darkrai we could probably end up doing Darkrai soon, right? Told you catch rates were boosted. That's good if we're catching the legends just with Pokeballs. We don't even need to engage them in battle, which is even better. Instead of a lunar feather, you got some kind of a plate. I do feel power emanating from it, though. In any case, if Cresselia did not gift us with any of her feathers, then I suppose she thought we had no need for them. I'm sure we're going to have a need for them at some point. Not bad at all, Grunt. Though I suppose anyone with enough luck to best the Great Melee should be able to handle at least that much. Thinking about it, a halfway competent person like you might actually make a decent sparring partner to help my lord and I grow stronger still. I will go back to the settlement and tell the others about the feathers that we didn't get. All right. Uh, Shana Lunella equals the Blood Moon. That's right. Darkrai is in the Highlands. You may as well do it. I haven't accepted the quest for it yet, Shay. And that's why. There is three more plates left for us to find. Okay. Three more plates. Weird. That still doesn't add up. But anyway, let's head back. David, hello and welcome. I hope you're having a good day. And uh, please enjoy your stay as well. We caught 50. Oh, yeah, the, the Teddy Ursus. None of them were shiny, but we got the Cresselia, which was good. Good. Our Pokeballs are now paid for. Going to experience for grind. Good luck with that one. And David. Yeah, David. I, re I remember you, David. Hope things are going good. And Noah, hello. <laughs> Seems it. Godless. What's your opinion on Utopia Deck? Because I have some news for you. I think Utopia is... um, It's not top tier. It's not a top tier, but I think it's more of a rogue... 
to fun deck. It's not like a tier 1, tier 2. I wouldn't even class it as tier 3. But it's fun. I would say it's fun. Fun or rogue. One of those two. I'm going to leave to avoid any more spoilers. No problem, Holly. Take care of yourself and we'll see you next time. And Eric, how you doing, Eric? Hope things are going brilliant. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, so spam. No, it is a Spamton. G Spamton. Right, Teddy Arson Research is good. Cresselli caught for the first time is good. A long way to go before we get up to rank 10, guys. A good long way to go. Who knew that watching a guy forever would be so entertaining? Well, who knew um, speaking with you guys and being absolutely awesome in the process would be absolutely brilliant. In other words, you are the amazing people. You are the amazing people that I like to hang out with. In this super strong community, all right? Uh... Parasect? Okay, thank goodness we're not going for Parasect. Alright guys, that was Cresselia, so I'm going to leave the next choice up to you guys. Where are we going next? Where do we go now? So we got options. We got options. I'm going to give you guys... Um, what next? Lake Trio. And I, once again, I am fully aware that Spiritomb is uh, not, not uh, a legend. And, um... Okay, I'm assuming that those, I'm assuming that one of the quests on the board is for Shaman. I'm just assuming it at this point, so. You're all poggers. You are all poggers, guys. So enjoy some sparkles from Lydia. What's my team levels? So the range between level 60 and level 80, Racer. So, uh, uh, of course, our Samuel is level 80. And our lowest level, it, well, level 59, Lilligan. Lilligan is our lowest level at 59. Which is alright. Which is okay. It's something to work with. Okay, Cresselia. Can now hang out here. I don't even know if I, oh, I've got I've got enough box space. It's fine. Should be okay. Um, let's see what you guys are saying. Okay, I'll give you guys another minute or two, and then whatever it is, we're gonna go ahead and do it. I'm gonna go ahead and grab the quest in the meantime, so we can just go straight there, just whatever. So still no shiny print club after three hours. Gee, that's a long one, Shay. But part of me is glad that you're kind of stopped and you're. Maybe the shiny charm has the opposite effect. That would be interesting. Uh, Shackle is poggers. Still no show in print plot. All right, looks like most of you guys want to do the temple, and I think that might be the best choice. Oh yeah, and um, hey Palkia, what's up? The god of space, right there. Uh, the token of gratitude. Let's grab this while we can. Many of the Diamond Clan says she was saved by mysterious Pokemon many years ago. Listen to her story and determine whether there is anything to do in the matter of follow-up. The token of gratitude. Did our viewer count just... Give me a thumbs up. Who's still here, guys? Uh, I'm assuming you're all still here, right? You love Shaman. Shaman is available. We can go and do that, Shaman. And uh, while we're at it, let's go ahead and grab the Dark Sun Nightmare, okay? Kale of the Pearl Clan has reported seeing a strange Pokemon up in the corner at Highlands. Speak with a fellow in my lab and see if you can catch the Pokemon concerned. The Dark's a nightmare. Okay. You, the one who accepted my request? Well then, let's get right to business. There's an old tale that's long been told in the Hisui region about a dark nightmare that visits people on lonely paths at night. I never put any stock in it myself until I saw it. I saw a terrifying black Pokemon just like the one in the stories. Alright, you're all here? That's good. Uh, my view count just went straight down to one, so I didn't know if there was a technical difficulty or not, but that's good. That's good you guys are still here. That's awesome. One watching. One It was weird. It was really weird racing. One one person's in the stream, but, uh, well, 14 of you all are talking at the one time, so. Sentra must have put my odds back to one in 8,000. <laughs> must have. They say that people who are trapped in the nightmares it creates never wake again. We can't wait for someone to fall victim to it. We've got to act before that can happen. I saw it near the Clamberclaw Cliffs, partway up Mount Coronet, and it was when I was out walking alone at night, just like the old stories all say. Be careful if you go in search of it. I wouldn't want you to lose your life over this. Guys, I think Darkrai is uh, my favourite mythic. 
Dark Cry is my favorite mythic, so that's going to be a good treat. But we're not going to do Dark Cry. We're not doing Dark Cry yet. We're doing the temple. We are doing the temple as you guys have voted. I haven't played Legend Darkness as much as I like because of studying it, but I've played it at least once. This game is so much fun. It's so awesome. Pokeball stock is... Uh, our Pokeball stock is getting a bit low, guys. We only have 194. I think we should stock up first chance we get. Um, you guys did Temple. So... See, while we're up here, I'm going to make a judgmental call, okay? I'm going to make a judgmental call. We are going to go and visit Yuxi, and then we're going to go and see Reggie Gigas. I'm just making a judgmental call right here, right now, okay? Judgmental call, guys. Let's go and see Yuxi, and then let's go ahead and see Reggie Gigas, hopefully. Switching targets to Scyther. All right. Good to hear it, Shay. Darkrai's my favorite. I think Darkrai's got such a good lore to it. The Pokemon of Nightmares. I'm going to be honest. I, I I don't know. I don't know. Mythics these days just don't seem to do it for me. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I just don't understand this. Then again, I just haven't immersed myself in their lore as much, I guess. But Darkrai, a Pokemon of Nightmares. That makes more sense to me. Keep something called the Outbreaks on Link's Darkest. Uh, what are Outbreaks? Outbreaks are... Um, so... Before you head on out, you're going to get outbreaks at the, um, the guardsmen will, uh, the guardsmen at the very gate, they'll report that there's an, a, an outbreak of Pokemon in one of the areas. And there's like, uh, it's like 10, I've seen an outbreak where there's been like 15 Pokemon and that's crazy. Well, maybe 14 to be more exact. And you just get a lot more Pokemon out than usual. And their shiny odds increase as well, so, which is really cool. Uh, do the late trio after Reggie. I'm going to do Yuxi now while I'm here. And then we're going to move to Gigas. And then we'll do the other lake trios, I guess. Yuxi's here. You keep something called Outbreaks in Legend's Darkest. Uh, what are Outbreaks? Outbreaks. Oh, dang. Yuxi's here. Okay, do you get a shield, Yuxi? Or uh, I only have 27 balls of mud. I'm not exactly... The biggest fan of this? Ow, oh, that actually hurt. Music actually sounds pretty nice. Uh-oh. Didn't get it on the first go. Okay. Throw it in the back. In the back. In the tails. We got Yuxi. We got Yuxi. There are two more late Pokemon left to be caught. All right, well, that was super quick, guys. That was, um... That was super, super quick. Okay, that's fine. Redeem cards? I, I don't have any cards at the moment, David. I will be making a big order for new equipment soon. And one of the things that is going to be on the list is uh, picking up cards. So... But I haven't picked it up yet. I haven't gotten any new cards to open at the moment. So... That will be in the future, buddy. So, but yeah, I will be opening card packs again, which will be a lot of fun. Isn't, isn't there not a new Pokemon card pack set coming out, which would, could be really cool? So, uh, it took me forever to catch uh, these in Great Balls. And just in Great Balls? Just throw mud, then turn around and uh, just uh, throw a Pokeball. That's the way to go. And you're crushing them with normal ones. Yeah, it, that's just the way I go. I'm just uh, walking away easily. All right, on to one of my favorite legends, uh, Reggie Gigas, I guess. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've been all over this game, and I haven't even seen a single trace on where the other three Regis could be. Steel, Ice, and... Oh, we're actually going to get a cutscene here, okay. Knock, knock. Adamant's here. All right, let's go. Excited about it. It's probably going to have Hisuian Pokemon. I hope so. These Hisuian Pokemon have been really cool. Uh, Redeemed Draco. We had that redeem very recently, Lydia. So, want to know about the other three Reggies? I'm about to find out, Racer. Wouldn't have expected to run into you up here, Draconic. What are you up to? You're here to try and find the secrets lurking in Snowpoint Temple, aren't you? That's what my clairvoyance told me. 
you do tend to you do tend to get mixed up in all kinds of strange going draconic. Absolutely. This door here, well, they say behind it sleeps a Pokemon so great it could tow around the entirety of the continents that lie to the south. No matter what we do, this door just won't seem to open. Um Hmm. Continents to the south. No matter what we do, this door just won't seem to open. Arceus, we got plates. The stone plate, iron plate, and icicle plate. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, uh, that makes more sense. Your Karen are reacting to the door because they are the three types elements for. Okay, okay, we're good. I'm gonna do a safety save. Safety save. All right. I'm all alone. All right. Uh, Reggie Gigas. My name's Draconic. I'm a big fan of your work. Okay. Okay, do I have a... Uh... Oh, there's... Gra Why is there Gravelers down here? And a Glalie? Oh, God. Okay. Hey, what's up, guys? You're not shiny. A bronze dog? I've... Okay, sure. Three bronze songs. Uh, excuse me. Oh, I can go down there. Oh my goodness. There he is. There he is. Reggie Gigas. What in time is that thing? It's colossal. It sure seems to be a Pokemon, but let's see what my clairvoyance has to say. Yep, definitely a Pokemon. Oh, jeez, I'm glad that we established that. My clairvoyance showed me a vision of it in motion. Okay. I'm glad that we've established that it's a Pokemon, guys. Uh, fully established that. Gigas? Reggie Gigas? All right. Let's go! Alright, Brilicify is complaining about Legends. Who's Brilicify? And Hunter, Fat Camp Plays, hello and welcome. I hope you're having a good day and please enjoy your stay, buddy. Who's complaining about this game? Honestly, I've been... If people are going to complain about this game, people are entitled to their own opinions. One person cannot change the opinions of millions. It is up to the person to believe what they believe. As for me, I'm enjoying this game. It's fun. Anyway. What's up, Gigas? Oh, we're actually battling it? Okay. Alright, maybe I should have prepared a little bit for this. Level... Wait! Wait! It's got slow... What? It's got slow start as well? Why does this thing have slow starts? God damn it. I, God damn it. An outbreak final for cookies. Dragon Master, man, I haven't heard the, the name of this fight in a long time. Oh, I don't even know who they are. I'm sorry to say. I got the first place in the Noah Yugo tournament today and guess what I won. What'd you win, Godless? And well done, buddy. Very well done. I uh, can't blame whoever did it. Uh, had Drake, Draco's fog. Draco is poggers. Draco is awesome. Uh, Draco the Lizard, of course. Uh, gotta get back to studying. Have a great time. Thanks, Lydia. Hopefully, we'll see you around uh, in the future as always. But have some good studying. Uh, don't stress yourself too much about it. Okay. I guess with slow start, I'm already disappointed. But sure, whatever. I feel like this is going to be a little bit annoying. <sighs> I'm just going to go ahead and get a super strong attack. Let's go ahead, Long Rush. Ursaluna is under leveled, so this should not KO. That's good. Okay, that's just about exactly what I wanted. Giga Impact dodge the attack. Fantastic. Headlong rush. Into the red. That's perfect. That's exactly what we want. Now we just throw Pokeballs. Ursaluna did fantastic. All right. I uh, got my first shiny Legends Arceus. It's a starter. It's shiny Cynical. Nice! Nice one, buddy. Nice one. 
Can't say that we've got a starter shiny yet, but uh, we've nearly got all the Hisuian forms shiny. Plus some extra bonuses along the way, which has been fantastic, so. Alright. First try, Pokeball. Let's go! Please. Let's go. Of course not. Cause the problems is steals videos and video ideas and uh, flame other Pokemon viewers that that Oh I see, I see. Well he's got no he's got no chance of nuts. Cause I will absolutely roast them. All I need to just say guys is that games are fun. That's it. Games are made to be fun, simple as that. Reggie Gigas doesn't seem to agree with that based on that capture. Then headbutt, Basque Legion hanging on then there right now, and Reggie Gigas finally gets its act together. That's now this is where things get a little bit more Annoying. God damn. God damn. Alright. We got the Reggie Gigas. Just before it had a chance to get itself going. That's good. Ah, Archimane leveled up. Fantastic. Pokeball for the win, guys. Po Pokeball is the best Pokeball ever. We got the blank plate, which makes sense. Because Reggie Gigas is pure and all. Yeah, you know, I'm going to say this right now. I am very, very disappointed. That um, the three original golems kind of represent Reggie Gigas, uh, Steel, Ice, and Rock. And then we have Reggie Drago and Reggie Lecky, and they don't really do anything for Reggie Gigas. I was really hoping that we would get some kind of new form for Reggie Gigas where it gets either normal dragon or normal electric and gets rid of that kind of terrible slow star ability. But oh well, never mind. Never mind. Uh, Pokeball win. Pokeball for the win, buddy. Pokeball for the win. You can't get rid of Gigas uh, without Heatran. You're right, Callum. You are actually... Uh, okay. Okay. It makes sense. It makes sense why you guys wanted to go to the volcano first. Because we already had rock and we already had ice. That makes sense. Good stuff. Good stuff. Shiny Clefairy for cookies. Well done, cookies. Want to know about the three regis now? Um, I guess we're about to find out, right? What are these plates for? The plates are for Arceus. But uh, that is, of course, part of the story. The plates are for Arceus. Why are you trying to catch... Because Pokeballs, uh, it makes sense. Listen, if I'm going to take these guys into a competitive scene, I'm not going to throw them out in some Great Ball or Ultra Ball where people had to put... Uh, people are just putting easy effort in to try and get them. But I wanted the tough one. I wanted the tough runs. So I'm just using it in Pokeballs. Simple as that. There's an opportunity to get Darkrai in a Pokeball, and I would be so happy with that. Chomp, hello and welcome. Hope you're having a good day, buddy. If it was normal Dragon, that would be a, like a legendary Drampa. That's true, and I would welcome that, Chomp. Uh, Chomp. It's way bad. And if it was normal Electric, it would just be like uh, Heliolisk. Because that Heliolisk is normal Electric, so... But, yeah. That would actually be kind of cool. That would be really cool. Normal dragon and normal electric hell even normal rock normal ice and normal steel that would be really cool as well for uh, for reggie gigas so it, slow start is its worst it is the worst reggie gigas does not need that ability it doesn't it can fully operate without that ability and it can get pressure and it would be much much more better for it anyway i'm i'm ranting i'm ranting reggie gigas does not deserve slow start anyway now that was one solid Pokemon, like a giant born of the very earth. I guess this is just part of your job with the Survey Corps, huh? Oh, absolutely. What kind of Pokemon is the one you just caught, Draconic? Hmm? I can't wait to see it in the Pokedex when it's done. Yeah, I'm pretty curious to read everything Mr. Professor writes up too. See you, Draconic. We should do another chase sometime. Sounds good. Are they like uh, Silver Leaves? That's, that's exactly what it is, Godless. Um, so Valley ability, uh, its ability is a RKS system and it's Arceus system or whatever it's called. Um, it's an anagram for Arceus basically. So that's basically what it is. Light Blue Yoshi fan, how you doing buddy? And Leafy, I mean fighting. All of the OG Regis are weak to rock. That's true. Well, apart from rock. No, wait, hang on, wait, what? All of the OG Regis are weak to rock. No, they're not, Leafy, no not rock and steel are not weak to rock they're all weak to fighting if uh, if that's what you're aiming for they are all weak to the fighting type ice steel and rock are all weak to fighting so send a lucario in there and it would uh make short work 
Reggie Rock with his very high defense, I think Lucario might have to put a little effort into it. So, But you guys get the idea. Green! Uh, if I get into Shine Cynical and I was... Uh... And it was uh, in a stream I would uh, spam so hard. Dude, just just do it. Just get into streaming and, and get it. So, Do you already know the secret about Volo? Uh, I have a rough idea, but I kind of want to figure it out for myself. So, Alright guys, uh, Temple's done. So let's find out where you guys want to go right now. I think I might make a judgmental call. Um, is it just the Lake Trio? Yeah, okay. But we're doing Spirit's Home and the Lake Trio. That's what we're doing next. And then we're going to do Shaman. Wait, did we do Shaman as well? Hang on a minute. Is Shaman... Speak to Medi at the Fieldlands camp to learn more about her request. Fieldlands. Okay. We can do Shaman, Spiritome, and we can... Uh... Oh, okay. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to do Spiritome and Azelf. And then we're going to do Shame, uh, Shaman and e... Mesprit. Mesprit. Let's make sure that I know the names of all the legends, guys. That's a good compromise. Then that means we do we do a non-legend, a legend, a mythic, a legend, and then whatever the last one is. So i am looking forward to the shaman fight. It's I think it's gonna be brilliant. I, I like I, I do like shaman. Shaman's has uh, kind of grown on me a little bit. So that's kind of cool. Alright, and uh well if we get an out I guess an outbreak also decides everything as well. So if we get an outbreak in those two areas, um uh, we'll see what happens. Yuxi and Gigas. Alright. Looking good. Pokeballs are uh, paying for themselves by the looks of it. Uh, Alright, uh, BRB. Uh, I'll be uh, back though. No problem, Shuckle. No problem, buddy. Yuxi and Reggie Gigas. Okay, looking good. Looking good. Okay, let's head back. And... Uh... Yeah, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing really good. Another outbreak. Game works again. Hey, Cookie, that's good. Have I gotten a shiny? Yes, Chomp. Uh, have I gotten a shiny? Uh, I've got a lot. Uh, I said we were going to go here. Uh, I'll show you my shinies. My one. I'll show you my shiny collection just now. We are uh, we're trying to get all the two informs. We only need to get five more, I think. Just five more. And we've also gotten a couple of uh, bonuses as well, which is uh, kind of cool. So, so here's what we got so far. We've got in uh, Clevo. Uh, let me actually just go up and uh, show everything. Oops, <laughs> okay, I'm going the wrong way. Oops. Okay, so check summary. We got Ursa Luna, Sneasler, Reveri, which looks absolutely sick, Cleavor. Voltorb, which we haven't evolved into Electrode yet. Bergmite, which we need to evolve into Avalug. Quillfish, which we need to evolve into Overquill. Snowrunt. Pile of Swine. Gudra, which we did fully evolve. Alright, then we got everyone's uh, free shiny Ponyta. A male combi. Male combi, which I'm very disappointed about. Got Onyx. Hapini, that'll be a very nice Eevee like Chansey. Magikarp, the best shiny of all times. Paris. That's all I got. Krikachun with uh, the greatest uh, musical sound ever. Krogunk. That's awesome. With a nice little swagger going on there. Haunter. Okay. Haunter and Gengar was a double shiny. We got two Haunters in a single outbreak, which was crazy. Followed by that, we had Yanma. So in two outbreaks, back-to-back -back outbreaks, we had... Three shinies. Two outbreaks, three shinies, back to back. That's phenomenal. And then we had a full odds shiny alpha rye period that we caught in the Highlands, which was absolutely insane. This is this is probably the best capture that I've ever done all game. So Shiny Alpha Rye Period is the best capture all game. Full odds. And uh, it was quite a good fight. Quite a good fight to get it. And uh, looking over the highlight, I did mistake um, a mistake uh, a Chingling for a for Cherum. So that must have been absolutely funny as hell. Um, this over here. Uh, move this here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. Lake Trio, just move that one here. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, we're good. We're good. 
Okay, and uh, now, now we're going to do Spiritual. We're just going to do Spiritual very quickly. Take a little break from the Legends. And um, we'll see where it goes. And then once we've done Spiritual, we'll go ahead and get um, Azelf. Azelf sounds about right. So let's go. Funny enough, my Heroes Vipira is named Rephonic. <laughs> In Sword and Shield, the Vipirias that I've had have been ridiculously strong. The, um... Not, not as strong as... Uh, well, yeah, much more stronger than that Licky Licky anyway. Um, Sword and Shield, Dynamax, Rhyperia with weakness policy. Oh, goodness, that's uh, Alpha Ghastly that I would quite like to capture. Hopefully he doesn't see me. This is uh, this is just for uh, extra money. That's all. If we if we get it, we get it. If we don't, we don't. No, we get it. So that's some free money, which is good. Okay. So, this is going to be interesting. I also didn't save. Okay, this is uh, now officially a bit of a worry, so. Uh, funny enough, Heroes uh, Rap Hero is a name to Is it, Racer? I feel honoured. I feel very, very honoured, buddy. <laughs> My first journey was uh, when I was uh, just walking. It was a lot chill. Hey, nice. Nice. My first shiny was the cone bee that, I, that you've seen there. So Apart from the ponytail, of course. That is, uh, that I feel honoured, Racer. I should probably ask him about that one. Uh, I'm out here with uh, 39 shines. Uh, we're racking them up, Shay. We're racking them up. We're taking a break today, of course. He doesn't have as many shines as me, though. Yeah, you may have 39, but you've been playing this a lot, and I've been streaming it, so... so. Uh, anyway, I'm glad you came. Let's get started, shall we? Uh, can I just say no right now? First of all, a confession. I may have told you one teeny tiny lie about the Wisps. There are actually 108 of them. I've been holding on to the last one. Could you put it in the old keystone with the others? All right. But wait, before that, well, Draconic, what do you think of me? I don't really know you. Don't really know you. Really? Even after gathering 107 wisps? Ah, well, it's fine. We have time after all. Here it goes, the final wisp. After this, the traveller who used that strange magic will finally forgive me, right? Close your eyes for a sec, would you? She's Spiritum. She's Spiritum? Or is the rock behind us Spiritum? Well, she's gone. You gotta go, but nice talking? No problem, Sean. Take care of yourself, buddy. It was a pleasure hanging out, buddy. Hopefully, we will see you next time. Luckily, I get to save, so thank goodness for that. My, uh, my Mew never got noticed. Your Mew never got noticed, Hunter? Oh, you know my first day shiny was Mew back in that Emerald version? You got Mew in Emerald? That must have been through an event, right, Hunter? That's awesome, buddy. Sorry, there's just a lot of the chat, and I'm trying my best to read as much as I can. So I do apologize in advance if you guys say anything, and I miss anything you guys say. I'm, of course, trying to pay attention to the game and as well as what you guys are saying so apologize in advance so best in spanish it's called uh, alma that is uh, that it's so in spanish interesting what was that a reference to malik what was that a reference to buddy okay make sure our team's ready um we haven't got a fairy type that's uh kind of disturbing but we should be okay should be okay 108 wisps. The odd keystone started glowing. How big is how big is this spirit zone gonna be? The odd keystone disappeared without a trace. Making you gather all those wisps was my last bit of mischief. Thanks for playing along. Please don't forget about me. You sense the presence of a strange Pokemon. Oh, jeez, there it is. Uh, hello, Spiritum, big fan. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm gonna regret this, aren't I? Okay, 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 okay. Um, Spiritum's hanging out with those guys. Can I just hide? <laughs> Are you doing, Spiritum? It's doing the spiritual walk. Oh, that's a hell. Okay, okay. Can I just run away and just um give me a smoke screen. Give me a smoke screen. 
Okay, so now we're good. I need to catch this in a Pokeball. Once again, gotta catch this in a Pokeball. <laughs> I wonder if Spiritomb's hungry. It's got some honey for it. Does it enjoy the... Um... Oh, man. Here it goes. It's going. It's going. It's having it. Okay, so we're good. We're getting catch this now. That was not the correct catch I was looking for. Uh-oh. 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 Ah, come on! Okay. I need to catch this in a Pokeball. I would really like to get this in a Pokeball, of course, guys. Okay. Okay. Uh, I need to get some more Ball of Mud as well, so... Let's see if it does that. I know I could probably do a Heavy Ball with it, but this is fine, right? Alright. There we go. Come on. This time. This time. This time. We're going to get it eventually, guys. I promise you guys we're going to get this. Anyone have the fossils? Hey, Triber. How's it going, buddy? I have the fossils. I have the fossils. It's really unfortunate we're not we're not able to, uh, you know, Masuda method with them. Which kind of sucks, but... Hope, uh, you can get them from a time-space distortion in the Highlands. You can get both Shield On and, um, and Cranidos. Cranidos. So, Cranidos goes into Rampardos, and Shield On goes into uh, Bastiodon. So, that's how you get them, buddy. Uh, but if anyone in the chats can uh, help them out, that would be much appreciated as well. So, I can't tell what direction Spiritum is facing right now. There, oh, well, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Come on. This time, this time, this time. There we go. We got the Spiritomb, guys. Let's go. We captured Spiritomb, and uh, now my inventory's disappeared. Uh, hello? Okay, it's back. It's back. You guys seen that, right? God damn it. Spiritomb playing one last trick. That that was, uh, that was a nice little glitch. That was uh, a nice little glitch there. Gotta give Spiritomb some credit. That was an uh, interesting glitch. That was... Uh... I find it weird that... Okay, we've seen some glitches here and there. That's absolutely fine. It's down to the game. But Spiritomb, Spiritomb broke my game. Guys... That that is almost believable. I, I'm gonna. I wonder what caused that. That's. At least it fixes itself, right? At least it fixed itself. But yeah, wow. Rip the HUD. Rip the HUD, indeedy. That was so weird. Spiritomb, last little bit of mischief. <laughs> you know, I'm really, really disappointed. Spiritomb had the potential to be a legend. It really did. But it's not a legend. To me, to me personally, it's a pseudo legend. And playing one last trick with the HUD was um, was one last little um, huzzah for it. Here's Azelf. And Draco's climbing the wall. Okay. All right. Uh, I should probably start getting some snowballs now. Ah, oh, this one's just using Swift. Alright, still got his guard up, so. Okay, can we get uh, Azelf on the first go? Let's find out. Uh, you'll, uh... Oddish, hello and welcome to the stream, buddy. We just caught Azelf on the very first go. Hope you're having a good day and please enjoy your stay as well. Hope things are going good. Got one more lake Pokemon to get. Alright, guys, who wants to do Shaman? Shaman is up next. Uh, Harvey, no way. What did Harvey do? Yo, I'm just uh, walking around and I uh, found a shiny Luxio. Nice! Nice one, buddy! Full on shiny Luxio. That is um, a very nice capture. Very well done, buddy. I'm going to try and see if I can catch this. But never mind. It's uh, it's it's all over. I'm, I'm retreating, guys. I'm out of here. <laughs> no Whiskash is... Uh, no Alpha Whiskash is going to be caught here, so... Shaman is easy? Oh, that's fine, then. Still need to catch it in a Pokeball, but, um, but it should be fine.
So Shaman is... Uh, where was Shaman meant to be? Token of Gratitude. Fieldland Camp, so not here. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Let's uh, head on back. You really want a shiny Luxio? I got lots of Shinxes from the... Um, from the Gold Community Day. Oh yeah, that Alpha Ghastly that I caught. And there's Spiritome and Azelf. I don't care what anyone says. I'm putting uh, Spiritome into my Legends box. That's a one-of at best, alright? Spiritome is a one-of. I'm just wondering if it was possible to get Spiritome shiny in this game. I'm just wondering about that. No, but you'd be, you'd be trying to get it at full odds. I'd, honestly, I'd rather Masuda method it in Sword and Shield, so... That's no problem. That's no problem. Okay, but Spirit Tome, we got it. And I've already got the shiny Lake Trios, so even if they were shiny in this game, I wasn't going to hunt them anyway, so... They're all shiny look from what I've been told from you guys, so, so it's okay. Alright, and this is where we're going to go now. Right, it's uh, Shaman time. Time for Mesprit and Shaman. Spiritome is locked. So Spiritome is also shiny locked as well. Okay, so that's absolutely fine. Yeah, what, what, why is Spiritome shiny locked? That doesn't make any kind of sense now, does it? So, Talking of gratitude at that camp. That's fine. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, the legends are shiny locked, but uh, static encounter anyway. So, oh well. It's time. So, Gift of Gratitude. All right. Shaming time. You must be Draconic, right? Hello, I heard about you from Mai. Thank you for taking on my request. I'll get right to the point. Once when I was little, I got lost here in the Obsidian Fieldlands. I was wandering around in tears when I stumbled across a field of beautiful flowers. That's where I met it, a Pokemon I'd never seen before. It gave me a flower and then set off walking, as if to guide me somewhere, so I followed it. And it led me back to a place I recognised. Thanks to that Pokemon, I made it home safely. But I never got to properly thank it. I'd like to find it again and tell it how grateful I am. The only problem is I haven't been able to find that field of flowers, so I'd like you to help me. Sure. Here, this is the only clue I've got. Is it the... Yeah, the Grace Adia flower. Okay. A flower is sometimes bundled in bouquets to convey gratitude on special occasions, such as birthdays or anniversaries. Hmm. That's good. Spread to home, Shiny Lux. Pokemon has confused me once again. It is Shiny Lux, according to Shay. It's time. You caught a Shiny Lux above full odds running around? That's good, Fraser. It's really, really good, buddy. Please find the Field of Grace Idea of Flowers here in the Obsidian Fieldlands for me. Yep, no problem. Okay, uh, let's see. What was I? I was going to do inventory. That's what I was going to do. Yeah, I need to get uh, snowballs, right? Snowballs are just as good, right? Where are they? Ah, here they are. That's okay, because Snowballs is just like a ball of mud, so that's okay. Put all this um, away as well. I got my or Yeah, I've got lots of orange berries, which is good. Still got the smoke bombs, which I don't think I'm going to need too much of. Lots of inventory, which is good. Okay, uh, now I need to find the field with the flowers? Oh my god. Um, where would that be? Where would that be? Is Grueling Grove? Where would that be, guys? Where would it be? The place with all the flowers. I don't think it would be Ramanus, right? Sand Gym Flats? Lake Verity's right there, so maybe we could actually do that. Flora Gardens. That's got to be the place, right? That has to be the place. I'm just taking a random guess, though. Uh, Arby, it isn't, uh, isn't that hard. You saw your message. Was it, Harvey? You found a shiny Luxio? I did see it. I did see your message. I, I I already acknowledged the fact that you got Luxio. So that was really well done, buddy. That was absolutely well done. So very well done on that one. Like here, right? I don't even know if this... This doesn't seem like it's the right place. Maybe it is? I don't know. It doesn't really look like too much like a... Oh, it is! Huh. That's weird. Oh! These flowers are going to bloom into the Grace Idea flowers, I'm guessing. This seems to be the flower field Medi has been looking for. Is this the field from back then? Yeah. Azelf killed all the Pokemon. No, Azelf, no! <laughs> the flowers may be withered, but I remember the, these surroundings exactly. This has to be the place. 
Okay. Excuse me, can you hear me, kind Pokemon? A long time ago, I got lost out here and you guided me back. I don't know if I'd have made it home without you, so I just came to say... Thank you so much! Oh! The flowers! Okay, that looks a lot more beautiful. That's nice. They're shaming? Aww. That is one of the cutest things I think I've ever seen in a Pokemon game. Alright. Thank you very much, Draconic. I'll make sure to thank Mai for pointing me towards you as well. I suppose you'll be staying here to study that Pokemon. Well, good luck with your work. Take care. Alright. So, does it? Okay, this will be interesting. Can't shame it in the field of the grace to the of flowers. Okay, that cannot be that hard, right? Can't be that hard. Let's just save. That is, that is kind of cute. That is a really, really cute shaman right there, I have to admit. <laughs> Alright, is that a guaranteed catch for shaman? It's not. Catch it again. It's just going to hang around there in the flowers. Where are you going, shaman? Come on, shaman. Don't make this difficult, alright? Okay, it is attacking. Okay, it does attack. Okay, I was wondering what it was doing. I was wondering what it was doing. Okay, so... Come on, this is going to take a while, right? Uh, Nico Miko, hello and welcome. I uh, hope you're having a good day and uh, please enjoy your stay. hope things are going really good. We just found Shaman and we're just catching it. But it's, um, you know, a little bit, uh, just doesn't want to get caught at all. All right, there was a crit catch. That's a good crit catch. Hundred and seventy-two Pokeballs left, guys. Hundred and seventy-two. And there we go. There we got Shaman. We got Shaman. A token of gratitude. We got the mythic Shaman there. That was uh pretty easy. That was rather easy, like you guys said, so. Uh Butter, I always thought uh, the first gen is the best, but now I'm starting to, to like third gen so much. Hey Butter, how, how you doing? Welcome to the stream, buddy. Hope you're having a good day and uh please enjoy your stay, buddy. Hope things are going good. Flowers. The flowers are nice. I hope that these fields, these flowers, stay as they are, right? Because this is much more better like this. It's good for the beautiful eyes, good for the dust dogs, and it was good for shaman as well, so that's good. We got shaman, guys. We got shaman. Right. One more lake trail to go. One more to go. And that is Mesprit. So let's go get Mesprit. It's a good morning. So Darkrai and Mesprit left, right? Um... No, they're still here. They're still here. Darkrai is next, though. Darkrai is going to be next. And then we'll... F should I do Darkrai or should I do the beginning? What would you guys prefer that I do first? Darkrai or the beginning? Because I have no idea what that is. I would assume it's Garatina, but I have no idea still. Uh, Shay, what would you recommend? Would you consider a distortion shiny to be the rarest? Yes, Shay, I would. Because one, you're waiting for a time space distortion. And uh, second, it's only a limited time. And three, you're not guaranteed to get whatever you're hunting for. So I would say time space distortion is the rarest shiny that you can get. But you were about to tell me that you got one, right? Darkrai then the beginning? Darkrai. So you guys say Darkrai, Shay and Callum, you guys say Darkrai. Harvey says beginning. You don't want to say what the beginning is, but it's not very hard. Okay, beginning so we can see what it is. I'm assuming it's Darkrai. It's not Darkrai. I'm assuming it's Garatina, but we'll get there eventually. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to give you guys the vote, all right? Because I have no idea. I have no idea. I'm assuming it's Garatina. But Garatina doesn't exactly tell me the beginning of things. Because Garatina is about the reverse world. I'm going to let you guys decide. And uh, Mesprit's here. What are you doing, Mesprit? Okay, well, I tried catching it, but that didn't work. 
I guess I can try like throwing us. I can throw a snowball, right? Okay. Can we get a first try Pokeball? Please? We've only used 30 Pokeballs to catch all the legends. Mesprit is not a first time. That was a miss. That's a good crit catch in the back. Lots of stuff. I think I'm going to have to stock up at some point because that's me all out of uh, mud balls. Now it's just them snowballs. Snowballs do the same thing, right? Yeah, snowballs uh, do the same thing. I need to remember to press uh, LT and RT. That's not going to work. Where are you going, Mesprit? Where was Mesprit going there? Okay. Oh, that's a great ball. Don't want to use the great ball. Pokeball all the way, guys. Yes, we got the mess, Brett. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. Majority of you guys say Dark Rise first. All right. Just in the beginning to finish it or not. It looks like it's going to be Dark Rise. I, it says Rapidash was met in the Alabaster Icelands. What? You can't find Rapidash in the Icelands. A bar type uh, in the... Guys, we just got the Draco plate. I nearly skipped over this. First of all, Mesprit holding the Draco plate. Okay, sure, whatever. Uh, Draco plate seems good. Draco! Dude, buddy! We got the plate of Draco, guys. We got the plate of Draco. <laughs> That's the Draco plate right there, guys. That's the Draco plate. Okay, Draco plate. Draco, Draco's opened his eyes for approval. So that's good. That's good news. Poggers. Okay. The view with the power of dragons. The plate of the lakes. Okay, that's good. That's really, really good. Basin could use this hint. It seems there might be one more plate left for you to find. Okay. How many plates do we have? Okay. How many plates do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, there's three plates left. If the beginning is a plate, I'm assuming it's Garatina. Or it can just be a random plate. Sure, whatever. Garatina would be 17. And Volo's probably got the 18th plate. Simple as that. Simple as that. All right, sure. Let's just go. It's just a random plate, so that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and do Dark Cry first. Dark Cry is up next, guys. All right. Uh, you're trying to Rapidash. My Rapidash from the Icelands was from a distortion. You're oh, I guess that kind of makes sense. You're a Rapidash. That's um, that's new. That's new to me. New. That's news to me. Level seventy is pretty good. Um, should have said that. I guess, I guess it makes sense from a time space distortion. I I'm trying to remember if I've actually seen Rapidash in a time space distortion in the Icelands, but I can't remember. Oh, Shaman has its um you can change forms, I guess. It's also got seed flare. Okay, that's nice. Times you've seen it use earth power and seed flare. That's kind of cool. Okay, looks good. We got Shaman, and we also got Mesprit. Okay. Okay, let's see. Return to village. Let's go and get Darkrai. Let's go and get my favorite mythic, guys. And we're only two hours into the stream. Things are going fantastic. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. I was, I was hoping to avoid this all, uh, all throughout this Legends we got Growlithe. We have Growlithe. Oh, God. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. I've been trying to... All right, I'm going to leave this entirely up to you guys. So, do <laughs> is Darkrai going to go on a... We haven't had a shiny, okay? I, I believe. I believe. I believe. 
I believe. I believe. I believe, guys. I believe. Where is it? Okay, that actually does make kind of sense. I believe. I believe. I believe. Okay. I believe we're going to get this. I believe we're going to get this on the first go. What do you guys think? Should we do? Because it is on our list. And we're only two hours into the stream where we've got hours and hours. What do you guys prefer? Do you guys want me to go for the, the Growlithe? Or... God. I gotta go for it, right? I just have to go for it. Well, Brevary just doing a fantastic glide right there, guys. So, there you got to. Well, if I get this, it only brings me down to the last four. So, I feel like I have to, right? My only... Oh, there's a satchel. Nice. My only redeeming factor is that I get it immediately. So, I guess we'll find out. But right now, out of the gate, it doesn't look like it. So, let's um, give it a go and see. Just catching them very nice and easily, guys. God, that's not all of them. That's still not all of them. How many of these are there? Jesus, there's a lot. There's tons. I feel confident that we can get this very quickly. Have I got max research for this, uh, Growlithe? Sure hope so. Sure hope so. I don't. I don't have uh, full research for this. Um. Okay, uh, do what I couldn't have done and catch it. I'm going to let you guys decide. Okay, this this kind of sucks. It kind of sucks. It's good and it's bad. It's good and it's bad. Okay, uh, I should probably put this uh, in poke. Most of you guys said the uh, dark ride, which was fine. I'm gonna leave you. I'm gonna do this one more time. Okay, one more time. At at minimum, if you guys want more, it's gonna be part of a vote. It's gonna be part of a vote. Okay, and uh, there's the poll, guys. Poll is uh, probably up by now. Oh, okay, it's drift. <laughs> sure, okay, sure. Reset that, guys. It's moved. It moved to drift limb, so we don't need to do it anymore. Yay! Uh, you have two shiny gorillas. Oh, I'm gonna get. I'm looking forward to getting one. <laughs> right, poll is up. Growlithe, I don't even know if I've spelt it right. So you guys will decide. Four votes then, and most of you guys want to go for Growlithe. Um, yeah, like I said. Okay, now it's looking a bit more balanced. Looking a bit more balanced. Right, here's the deal, guys. Here's the deal. I'm going to try Growlithe a maximum of five times. Okay, we've done it once. We've done it once. If we don't get it in these next four attempts, I'm done. And we're just going to go right back to the Legends. Since it's 50-50, since it's 50-50 at the moment, we're going to compromise. And uh, we can always get it sometime in the future, so... Oh my god. Oh my god. Right. A maximum of five times. We've already done it once. We've only done it once. So we'll do it four more times. And if we get it, fantastic. If we don't get it, that's it. I can always get it in the future. So it's really annoying that it's popped up as Driftblim and now Peplop. Peplop. Shiny Peplop. Good joke. We'll, we'll come back to that at some point. We've had shiny Chimchar. And, well, so we've had Chimchar and Piplop hunts before, but um, I just uh, didn't bother doing them. But we'll do them sometime in the future, which should be good. Right. If it's something different this time, um, I'm done. I'm, I'm just not going for it, so. Last try, last try. Racer true. I hope uh, If it's the last try, that'll be fantastic. But we'll see. Okay, girl, this is back. That's fine. I don't even know if I'm using, um, you know, I should probably better go into the other camp now that I think about it. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? 
I'm falling apart, guys. I'm falling apart. Okay. So this is the second... This is the second attempt out of... Um, out of five tries. Second out of five attempts, guys. Second of five attempts. And uh, we will just have to wait and see what happens. Alright, place your bets. Will very make it all the way to the other side? Or will it have to change into Basque Legion? It's going to change into Basque Legion, I think. But it came close. It's pretty damn close. That's some very good climbing off the cliff. <laughs> Oops. That was some good climbing off the cliff. Okay, let's see. Uh, race or true. Uh, last try, last try. Yeah, we got four attempts. We got four more attempts, right? Four more attempts out of the five that I said. And then we'll just uh, see what happens, of course. None of these are uh, screaming shiny right now. Oh my god, and now they're already angry at me. So they do become angry. Okay, that is uh, that is unfortunate. And there's an alpha one, because of course, why the hell not? Because of course, why the hell not? God, please, God, give me strength. Okay, okay. Rings are true. Okay, sure. Um, sure. I just, I'll just knock this out. Just knock this out. Please, just please. I want to make this quick. I want to make this quick for you guys. I want to get back to the legends, all right? I want to get back to the legends. Oh, my God. This is already been a bit of a disaster. This is already a disaster, guys, and I'm so sorry. Uh, remember the first time I just spammed Ultra Balls? Alright, okay. After this growls, we should be back on track. I'm going to get a smoke bomb on the go. And we'll get back in there. Or I'm going to fall off a cliff. Smoke bomb is good. And I don't care. I'm just going to use the other one to make sure I get there. So, Okay, now we're good. Now we're good. Now we're good. Okay. It's more popping in there, which is good, but uh oh. Oh my god, I I quit. I quit. I quit. Okay, as long as it's just this one attacking we can probably make do, right? That might be the end of it, so that might just be the end of it. Yeah, that is the end. Okay, three more attempts. Three more attempts. Pokemon at Rick's are really annoying. They can be, but that one was just more annoying. That one was just uh, more annoying. We, um... The Growlits are easy to capture. Easily, 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 easily Ultra Ball them, and that's fine. Um, it was just my approach. My approach to them was really, really bad, so... I'm gonna try and avoid making that same mistake, and I already know what I'm doing about that. So, three more attempts. Three more. Three more goes. So this is a good opportunity for you guys, all right? This is a good opportunity for you guys. If any of you guys want to top up on drinks, some foods, um, bathroom breaks, this is a good chance. This is a good chance for you guys before we start getting back into the legends. So, so consider that one uh, a little bit for you guys right there. Okay. And, uh, oh, I, I quit. I quit. I, I, I just quit. Luminian is just, uh, yeah, you know. Uh, let me do that, actually. Uh, it's been uh, confirmed that uh, Laventon is from Gather. Is that confirmed, though, Shay? Well, that's kind of good. I don't know where everybody's went to, but the moment I started doing these outbreaks, I think everybody's just disappeared, right? Confirmed. Uh, outbreaks are not good for live streaming. Fully confirmed, guys. <sighs> oh, well. Give me a thumbs up on who's still here, because now are 20 viewers... I just went down to five, and uh, that is very, very heartbreaking. That really is. That is just, um, you know, that is a, that is actually just a, a like an arrow in the heart. That really is. Oh my god, I I quit. I really do. 
Why is it not popping up with Growlithe again? Now, this is the worst out set of outbreaks I think I've seen, so. Justin's still here, so that's good. Callum's still here with a thumbs up. I know Shay's still here. I know yourself, Racer, you're still here. So that's good. I'm glad that you guys are still here. Here we go. Uh, Raju Dex entry mentions uh, a Copperaja from Homeland. Interesting, Shay. Mentioned Copperaja from the Homeland. <laughs> Maybe related to Rose, if you think about it. Rose is the one that had the Copperaja. All right. If we don't get uh, Growlithe this time, I'm done. I'm not doing it again. I'm not messing around, okay? If Growlithe appears, I'll have my three more attempts. But if it's not there, I, I don't want to mess around. I don't want to mess around waiting, so... Okay, it's there. Oh, wow, Pikachu. Good joke. Uh, let's actually go with the beach sides. That's a good way to go. And Harvey. How you doing, Harvey? Hope things are going good with you. We're doing three more attempts with Growlithe. And then we're going to keep on going with the... Um, with the rest of the legends, try and catch all of them. Uh, dang, slow chance delays my chance for such a long time. <laughs> That's not good, is it? It can be really annoying if the chat's uh, just a little bit slow. You know what you mean. Try this method of approach. I don't know if this is any easier or any better, but I guess we're about to find out. So my only worry is an alpha popping up or if there's a growlith along the way that's kind of close to where the, the outbreak is uh, we'll see what happens stantlers are not shiny so no point going there Mothman's hanging out uh coffee's going to be ready in a bit oh that's good that's good we got a few attempts like i said three more attempts at these outbreaks and then i'm going back and we'll just try and get this uh, sometime in the future oh perug like just go away just go away Okay, so let's see what we get. Okay, there they are. I ain't messing around, guys. I am not messing around. I am not messing around here, guys. Oh, come on. Okay, that does it, that does it, that does it. Oh, that's an alpha. That's an alpha. Please turn your back so I can catch you. That does it. That does it. One more over there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. You guys can see how quickly I'm doing this, of course. Doing this rather quickly and rather well, wouldn't you say? Even the alpha was caught in the, uh, the Ultra Ball, which was really good. They're still popping up. Oh, there's only just three more. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Nothing left. Two more times, guys. Two more times. And then no more filling around. Back to the legends. And we'll do this again sometime in the future. My shine luck is awful today. When I do growl with outbreaks, I fly to the volcano and scale up the side with uh, Sneasler. Yeah, I thought I, I kind of did three different approaches. I did uh, the volcano in the two other camps. And um, I kind of liked that third approach. Because if you're going up the side of the cliff, you don't know what you're going to expect. But if you're going up the uh, the path, you uh, you got a good idea. Got a kind of a good idea. Tea is pleasant. Tea is um, gonna be honest, uh, kind of grown on tea a little bit. But uh, I'm still coffee. I'm more of a coffee guy to be honest. Uh, but Growlithe is okay. We got two more attempts for Growlithe. Two more attempts for Growlithe. Growlithe, you're just hanging out there. That's good. Two more attempts for Shiny Growlithe, and then we are all done. Okay, our numbers are back up, which is fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Two more attempts for Growlithe, and then I didn't save. Oops. Save. <laughs> okay, and uh, watch me start this on the on the back of a weird journey. <laughs> what the hell is this? What the... What? Wait, what? Okay, that was weird. Okay, but okay, we're back on track. Back on track. We're good to go. We're good to go. Okay, no shinies here. This is also very good to see if we can get any full odd random shinies, which would be very good still. Ice tea. I can't say that I've ever... Have I tried ice tea before? I don't think I have. I don't... Um, I think for me, tea and coffee, it needs to be nice and warm, right? It has to be nice and warm to get the, uh, the good flavor in, right? 
Uh, and yes, I see. I ever tried the coffee and the Luwak coffee? I think they're really great. You can get many types of uh, tea. There's a, there's actually some stress release uh, tea, which is um, which is rather rather interesting. Which I I I have, but I never really used. So, although that being said, I think it'd be very good to decrease my stress my stress for this live stream, or any other, or maybe any other stream, I guess. Okay, All right. No shinies uh, out there. That's fine. I think we can probably get away with just using one. I think we could. Yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay. Okay. Oh, that one escaped. Okay, so they still don't see us, which is good. So they become alert if we miss? Interesting. Yeah, they become alert if we miss? Really? Okay. Honestly, I think I'm better just using the uh, the wing balls or probably something. Okay. This one is still attacking us, but honestly, it seems to be fine. Yeah, well, it was going fine. What are these both lost now? Still nothing. Still nothing. Okay, sure, whatever. Uh, you know what? I'm probably gonna call a reset on this one. Yeah, that's it. That's it. One more attempt. That was uh, that was a little bit annoying. Uh, let's see. Uh, what is the hype with uh, bubble tea? I don't know. Uh, try to and yes, iced tea is great, especially during hot days. I would guess so. Uh, it's getting closer to uh. I would say it was getting closer to summer, but it's still looking pretty um, doom and gloom outside. Uh, boba is chewy and it suits well with uh, milk tea or any kinds of drinks. Interesting. Gonna end that poll. This is the very last Growlithe attempt, guys. And honestly, that attempt was kind of terrible. So, <laughs> last time's the charm. I sure hope so, Davin. I sure hope so, buddy. That was not the best attempt for me for that, um, for that Growlithe one right there, so... We're going to head back anyway. But I already said, we got one more, and then we're going to get back to the Legends. And because we can always pick up Growlithe sometime in the future, okay? Always pick it up in the future. And it is Growlithe. Just watch a Zora appear next time, and that's going to be funny as hell, so. What I will do is, I will not save. Instead, I will capture all the Growliths. Yeah, uh, I also went the wrong way. Sure. Okay, whatever. Um... I'm not going to capture the Growlithe. So sorry, I will capture the Growlithe, but I'm not saving. I'm not messing around. Not messing around, guys. So, we'll see how it goes, of course. Capture all the Growlithe. Knock them out. Do whatever it is I need to do. That Drapion did not do anything against me. That was uh, lucky. So, that's it. There's no going back as of now. Well, there is still a chance to go back, but I'm not going back, guys. Keep in my words, this is the uh, the last one. I've seen the sparkles and I thought that was a shiny of some kind, but I guess it's not. Snantler's hanging out, which is fine, but they're not shiny, so it's no problem. Hear the sounds, okay. Alright, got your coffee. Good stuff. Glad to hear it. You'll also be glad to hear this is the last Growlithe attempt as well. Or maybe not, I don't know. It depends on what you voted. This is the last Growlithe attempt, and I'm just going out to capture them. Uh, no shenanigans. Not doing anything else. Smoke bomb on the go. There's one Growlithe. There's two Growliths. Okay. That would just go right into the Ultra Ball territory. Oh, kind of, kind of, kind of. Okay, got that one. Got that one. God damn, stop moving! They're on. Bloody control. Oh, my. I was rushing it. I should have been taking my time. This was a me problem. What are you looking at? <laughs> Just catch you. That didn't...
I am just about to lose it. I, re I really am just about to lose it. <sighs> I want to catch these unaware. And right now, it's not exactly going so well just now, guys. Okay, please, please, for the love of everything that's Arceus, let me catch these. There we go. Okay, now we can go in and get the captures in. God damn, this is this is not going good. This is not going good at all. Making a mockery of this, guys. Catch that. Stop moving, stop moving. Okay, that one just lagged a little bit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, that one escapes. That sure, whatever. And now it's gonna attack us. Now it's gonna attack us. That's okay. You can come on over here. You can come on over here. It'd be very funny if it kind of went off the cliff. That would be hilarious. Let's see if I can catch that one and that one, which is good. Does it go off the cliff? Oh, it was kind of close. It was kind of close. It was nearly off the cliff, guys. Nearly off the cliff. That would be really upsetting as well. No, you're not the shiny one. You're not the shiny. Is that all of them? I can't even tell if that's all of them or not. So. Shiny hunt equals pain simulator. Why is it got to be the last attempt? It's the last attempt and they're just being super annoying right now. I bet you that's the last four as well. That has to be the last four, so. Okay. Okay, and we're gonna try this one more time. Okay, there we go. One last time. We've got the Ultra Balls at the ready. God damn it. Uh, I, I can still go a little bit further. trajectory there we go okay we got them and they're still spawning in oh, God, please. okay that's it none of them are shiny i'm out i've had enough i'm not even gonna bother catching them so i cannot be bothered catching them because of how annoying they are right now so okay so let's head on back may have been a little bit like this so uh, I beg you to give the coins some luck. It just they just didn't get me any luck. They stopped spawning and at that point I just I just couldn't be bothered. So I'm out. There is no more growlets, guys. There is no more growlets. I'm getting out of here and we didn't get it. The growlets were not ready to play. We're not I got 13 of these as well, so. There was a lot. There was a lot. There was a lot. I think there was Overall, I think there must have been about 13. But anyway, max research complete. So next time we visit these, I'll be much more prepared and ready to go. So when you fall, uh, fail a shine, you drown yourself in the game. <laughs> Davin, time for more legends. The legends are coming back. If Zora pops up, we're going to have one more Zora. Oh my. <laughs> you cannot be. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, really? Come on, you guys seen me. I didn't save. I didn't reset the game. Oh, do you know what it is? Do you, do you know exactly what this is, guys? Do you know exactly? This is the leftover growlets. This is the leftover growlets from before, right? So. Is it? I feel like it's the leftover growlets from before, right? So there's only realistically only going to be like, uh, I don't know, like a few of them, right? I got, I got to experiment this, guys. I'm sorry. I, I promise the legends are next. I, the legends are next. I just have to experiment. I just have to experiment. The dogs love me. What can I say? What can I say? The dogs love me. The dogs love me. Uh, did I, sorry, did I say love? Uh, I meant hate. Let's see them using all those rock slide moves against me. I've got to check and see if it's still the same, right? You are hunting into hero. I am turning. I'm turning into hero. Does he rage as much as me? It's just, it's just a Scottish thing. It, mu it must be a Scottish thing, right? We're determined. We are determined to succeed. 
That has to be the case, right? Uh, here's the, here's 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 how it works, guys. If you're Scottish, you're determined to succeed, and if you're English, she, uh, you're determined to beat Scott. That's basically it. <laughs> That's basically how it works. Uh, <laughs> I'm Scottish. All right, that's my excuse to that argument. Okay, I'm Scottish. That's that's the argument. Okay, uh, let's let's just this is a good experiment. Okay, this is a very good experiment. I'm about to see what we got. All right. So there's only three. These are the, still the same ones from before. Then okay. So the outbreak still records them. No wait, there's four. There's four. Did I miss something? Maybe there was one more left. Maybe there was one more left. Uh, I'm sorry, Grouth, but you're the one that's going to get hit by a water move, so. Uh, on Super Mario 2, it's uh, just last try, last try. <laughs> but this wasn't a last try. This is this is experiment. This was an experiment. So if you pull out halfway of an outbreak, it's still there. And it will still have the Pokemon that was there. Okay, so that makes more sense. Okay, now we know. Now we know. Why am I... Yeah, this is the walk of shame, guys. This is the... This is the flight of shame. I'm gonna fly along with the flight of shame, guys. We didn't get it. You're Yuki, too. Hey! But finally, Shiny Cypher. Time for Scizor. You're going for Scizor? That makes sense, right? Good job, buddy. Uh, you listen to there, so it's the same. Yeah, I just wanted to see it for myself. I just wanted to confirm it. You really think this guy's Leon and Hop? I don't exactly see it, but okay, sure. I do need to get the rest of the legends. Um, at least we're racking up the money again, because I did have a bit of a drought, but we're fine. Gorilla's research has been maxed out. So that's good. That is good. Yes, I wanted to go back. Return to village. Okay. Darkrai is up next. So... Based on the previous poll, we are going to do Darkrai. Darkrai is ready to go. Yeah, Mitchoke. Good good job. Yeah. Good joke, Buff Conic. <laughs> All right. Uh, screams in uh, Nipponese. What? Nipponese? What, what is that, Davin? What is uh, Nipponese, buddy? I want to see my Pokemon. I am in the right place, right? Hopefully I'm in the right place. Uh, how many? Yeah, all those growlets. Yeah, great, great joke. Great, 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 great joke right there. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, move these there. Spiritum can hang out there. We've got in the. Oops, that was a mistake. Shaman can hang out down here because it's mythical. Lake Trio. That's good. All looking good. Legends. All right. Darkrai. Let's go and get Darkrai, guys. And let's have a look and see. If I can remember to press the right buttons. Okay, so. Uh, I do not have a lot of quests left. Okay. Clamber Claw Clefts at night. So it needs to be at night. Okay, glad I read that. Nightfall. Uh, read last. What's up, Raquel? Okay. It's Japanese. Okay. That's kind of cool. You hate these legendaries? Uh, casual? Hopefully not so much. You once went to an Among Us lobby with the host called uh, British, and so I went in and said, E, you good. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow. Everyone's open to their own opinion, of course, so. Everyone's open to their own opinion, but that might be a little bit much. I don't know. Alright, shopping. Uh, we're running quite low on Pokeballs. So let's make sure that we... There we go. Top it up. Ultra Balls as well. Top up. We're good. Great ball. Just one more to top it up. There we go. Uh, need some more Feather Balls. Let's top that up as well. And I don't know why, but I'm going to have to top this up as well. Okay, we're good. We're good. Let's go and see Darkrai. Uh, Darkrai is all the way over there. Fantastic. Okay, how tough is Darkrai gonna be, guys? 
Because I have no idea right now. Shaman? Very easy. Um, Bioni and um, Manaphy? They're a little bit of a challenge. So Darkrai is either going to be a bet in the middle or way more tougher than both of them. Hmm. But we're on our way to find out. Oh, good. Shiny rocks. That's a nice little joke right there. Hmm. It's down here. This is where the Bronzors and the Bronzongs like to hang out, right? And they're not even here. Okay, interesting. Okay, you've got Darkrai. I should have saved. I should have saved before doing this. It's okay. It's okay. Darkrai's on the right. I've seen him. There he is, Darkrai! Okay. And save. Let's go. Let's go and get Darkrai. Okay, this sounds like it's going to be a little bit of a challenge. Okay, and he's... Oh, we can't get anywhere near him as well. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Snowballs. He's not a big fan of snowballs, I guess. Over there. Or not. God damn. Okay, this is going to be a bit of a challenge. Is he leading us somewhere? Where are you taking us, Darkrai? Now you're over there. Excuse me? Oh, did we just throw the Pokeball, I guess? God damn! Okay, Darkrai time. <laughs> yeah, well, he's not doing anything. So... I'm gonna stand here. Excuse me? Uh, I don't know what I do. Okay, I'm going to stay far back from him. I'm just going to stay as far back as possible now. Does this do anything? I guess so. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, what a waste... Davin, what do you mean a waste? It's not a waste. It's not a waste. This is awesome. All right, I'm confused. Uh, help has learned his ways from. <laughs> You're right. Oh, I got him. We got Darkrai in the first Pokeball. Let's go. Let's let's go. Well, that that wasn't as difficult as it looked. Uh, that was. Okay, I don't know if there was... I don't know if that glitched. I don't know if there was more to that. But we'll take Darkrai. I mean, that's Darkrai. That's absolutely fine. Astounding. Well, that's all you had to do. Wow. <laughs> now everyone will be able to rest easy. I'm going to be honest. I was hoping for a lot more than this. It was a little bit of a disappointment. Yes, now no one else will fall victim to such dark nightmares. Uh, again, Darkrai is awesome. Don't get me wrong. But I think they could have done a bit more on the story side of it. I suppose I'd better be heading back home myself now, but I won't ever forget what you did. Farewell, young one. The Dark Sun Nightmare is complete. Easy first try. And we got some experience candy, which is nice. Alright! Darkrai has been captured. I was really hoping for more. I really was hoping for more. Uh, but that's okay. But we got Darkrai. We got my favourite mythic. We got my favorite mythic of all time. At last. And in a Pokeball. No Premier Ball from Pokemon Go. No fancy Cherish Ball that you get from events. We got Darkrai. All right. It's a disappointment because you don't fight him. It's just an instant catch. Which, yeah, sure, that's cool and all. But uh, we'd really have liked to have seen more so. But oh well. I'm not going to complain because it's Darkrai. And Darkrai is awesome, so... But that's good. Now we can get on to whatever this quest is. I, um, the Plate of Prelude Beach. Okay, let's have a look and see what this is. Any more outbreaks? Yeah, Mantike. Good joke. Good joke. All right. Let's, um, all right. 
This has got to be Garatina, right? Because Garatina is the only legend that we've not seen yet. So this has to be Garatina. Wait, hang on a minute. Is it? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. It has to be, right? This, this is definitely Garatina. But it just doesn't make sense, the name of the... Oh, okay, I'm just going to go with it. I'm just going to wing it and see. You found Cyrus is satchel? Hey, what's Cyrus doing in it? Well, guys, um, I guess uh, Cyrus finally found his uh, new world. Who would have known? This was uh, the perfect world that uh, Cyrus uh, wanted. Okay. Okay. Why is he in a armor? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, sure, whatever. Let's see. Prelude Beach. Indeed a place of beginning. Now is not the time for words. Oh, is he gonna... Okay. Okay, sure. Sure. Um... I did not... Okay, I'm a little bit disappointed. Sure, let's, let's fight. Let's fight. Honestly, I didn't expect this. Commando challenges us to a battle. Let's see what this does, all right? Let's see what this does. Golem! All right, Samuel leads. That's good. He's got five. Okay, this is an easy knockout for us. Please be very low level. 65 is good. 65 is good. We can strong style here. Let's see. Let's go. Guys, if there's any spoiling going on, please don't, all right? All right? I already had a rant earlier in the stream. About people spoiling stuff. So please don't spoil, okay? Don't spoil. Heracross, we need a flying type to deal with this. Definitely need to get a flying type. Bug move incoming. Pen missile, super effect. Oh, okay. That's interesting. That is actually rather cool. Hmm. Samurai might get knocked out here. Uh, let's see what we got. Don't think we got a flying move, unfortunately. Don't think we got a flying move to deal with this. If there's any spoilers going on, uh, thanks for dealing with that, Shay. That is highly appreciated, buddy. Much, much appreciated. I think we'll just let Samuel. Uh, if he's still got that Snorlax, I'll have to save a fighting move. Um, let's go Aqua Tail. We got some damage. Strong style. Let's get this uh, one knocked out. Doesn't kill it. God damn it. Okay. Okay, that sucks. Okay, that sucks. Close combat's good, so whatever we send in, it's a guaranteed knockout, so that's fine. Okay. Oh, we could probably send in Basket Legion. That seems good. Five against four, and he's used a full restore. Sure. Yeah, this actually works. And then we can strong style whatever comes out next. Okay, Basket Legion getting a kill there. Spoiler equals timed out, guys. So if you are going to spoil anything, please don't, as you will get um, timed out. And Shay is uh, currently in charge of that. Shay, much appreciated, buddy. All right, Snorlax so doesn't have the best uh, physical in, in, this, in the world. Still takes the damage like a tank. Oh, goodness. Agile. You ever guys ever seen uh, Snorlax and Agile before? Nah, I didn't think so. Neither did I. Oh, strong. St okay, so we're going to get two or three attacks then, so that's good. At least two, right? Listen to Shay. Female Basket Legion is so ugly. I quite like it, actually. I quite like it. We don't have a... Uh, let's keep Arcanine in there for a little bit. Ursaluna is now in... We can go one headlong rush. Okay, that actually sounds good. I think I'd rather use double edge though. Yeah, let's use a uh, double edge. They're both gonna do the same damage, so. The way they sound like they uh, teamed up and uh, tried to spoil it. Yeah, don't don't spoil it, guys. Please don't. Okay. Uh, Ursula with the recoil. He's got two left. We've got four. Clefable. Calm mind. Okay, that sucks a lot. Look. I remember what else this guy has. Clefable. Yeah. 
We can probably get a very strong headlong rush in there. Because why the hell not? Let's get one strong move in there. Yep, Avalog is big, Harvey. Avalog is big. Lots of damage. That's fine. Defenses are down. That's fine. Ursula did fine. It's got Water Pulse. Okay, so I was going to send in Arcanine, but that's not going to happen. Gudra? I think we're going to bring Gudra in. Or do we just bring in Overquill? Let's bring in Overquill. Let's do Overquill. Avalog is big. Avalog is big. It's really, really big. Alright, well, I'll get some more da- The one get the most damage impossible, so let's go Poison Jab. Poison Jab for the most damage. He's down to one, and we have three. We have different types. Braviary, okay. We have the dark, we have the dark side. And Overquill, which is good. We've got a rock from the Arcanine, which is also very good. So let's get a strong Dark Pulse in there. We win. It's, it's just simple as that. We win. Avalog is tiny in the uh, overworld. <laughs> it really is. It's so weird. Anyway, battle decided. Okay. Even frightful creatures like Pokemon can become powerful allies. They sure can. That was, um... I'm not gonna lie, that was, um, actually quite a tough one. Limit, really limiting down our numbers. Okay, just reached uh, rank 9, Raquel. Nice one, buddy. Very, very, very nice. So, this is not Garatina. He's just gonna give us a play. Okay, so Garatina's gonna pop up again at some point. That's fine. You've grown even stronger since we faced one another on Mount Coronet. It's clear you do not view Pokemon as dangerous enemies, but rather as trustworthy allies. Allies with whom you can reach great heights. Perhaps you are a divine being yourself, sent to bring us gifts from above. Here, you just had this. Plate? Yes! Okay, there we go. That's fine. That's fine. The fist plate. Now, that kind of makes sense. When the very first of our galaxy expedition team, myself, Benny, and the others set foot on Prelude Beach, we found that plate. It clearly held some kind of power, and so I've kept it safe all this time. I find it fitting that it should now end up with you, who likewise arrived here on this same beach. Perhaps something is guiding us. Indeed, it must be so. You and I, Adam and Erida, it appear we are all being guided by the one called Almighty Sinnoh. It might be more appropriate to call this region the Sinnoh region. Almighty Sinnoh? The Sinnoh region? You know, it didn't actually um, click until, you know, until he actually kind of said that, but Almighty Sinnoh in the Hisui region, and they're just now going to start calling it the Sinnoh region. Okay. I know I've no right to say this, but we are truly fortunate to have been able to count you among the Survey Corps ranks. If you had not joined us, we would have fallen on Mount Coronet. We would have lost our home. We would have lost our future. Now then, carry on with your survey work. The knowledge that you collect about the well Pokemon of this region will serve to eliminate, eliminate, illuminate our path forward as we walk into the future. All right. The play of Prelude Beach. You gathered all the plates related to each of the stories Kogita told you about. All right, let's head on back. Seeking the, okay, okay. Seeking the remaining plates. Okay. All right. Good fight. Good fight, guys. That was, uh, going to be honest, that was, um, that was fine. That was absolutely fine. Uh, and how was I supposed to know it was the, the biggest spoiler? Uh, I'm not smart, but whatever. Okay, Shuckle, yep. Yeah. Can I always start it was a spoiler? It was the biggest spoiler in the game, Shuckle. Uh, yeah. No spoilers, of course. I'm going to mix up the team a little bit. I need to get some higher levels. Okay, so Garatina is going to be coming up. Garatina has got to be coming up at some point. So, Ghost and Dragon. All right, Zorak is definitely making its way in. I'll keep Gudra because of its steel typing. Overquill's got Dark, Arcanine. We can bring Arcanine back. Fighting, nope. Basket Legion. Basket Legion the Ghost. That's the last call. Ursuline is good. Nope. 
Avalog? We could probably bring Avalog in. Bring Avalog in to replace. You know what? Let's swap that. Really want to find a spot for Cleaver. Level 80. I think we need to get some more higher levels in here. So we'll bring Cleaver in to replace Ursaluna. I think that makes good sense. Because then we have Dark High Level. But just a high level in general. We get Ice. Steel and Dragon's a great combo. Normal and Ghost, so it's immune to Ghost. And Dark, Dark can also deal with the uh, the Ghost type. So this actually does work out rather well. Okay, we're good. Uh, warning, the fight coming up is they're going to make Ultra Necrozma seem like a Route 1 Pidgey. Really? Okay, I'm looking forward to that then. Okay, uh, our team is ready. I don't even know if it is Garatina. I'm assuming, I'm getting, I'm kind of getting ready for Garatina. Um, that's my assumption. That Garatina is going to be coming up. So I'm kind of basing my team off of that. But we'll see what happens. Uh, I don't want to bring Dialga or Palkia in. I don't want to include Legends. It's my own personal rule. I don't bring Legends into battle. Unless there's no other way. It's my own personal rule. And with the power that resides in me. I bring forth Volo. At some point. <laughs> Here you are again. Have you collected all the plates? And there he is. Of course, Draconic is a famed member of the Survey Corps, after all. Hopefully that Garatina... I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sure Garatina's in this game. I'm 99% sure. I have no idea where or when, but I just sense Garatina is going to pop up at some point. So what more can you tell us? We're so close now. You must know more about the plates. If there's yet more you want to know, kindly bring me wood. Three logs will do wood so you're saying wood is somehow tied to the plates well i suppose that's what we get to learn next hop to it draconic well it shames me to admit it, merchant that i am i am quite out of wood in my stores just now i've got wood in my inventory already right do i i've got three wood in my inventory right or do i actually need to go out into the sure let's find out yeah i've got, I've got loads three Three, there we go. And do, 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 do. running low on snowballs, I have to admit. Really running low on the snowballs department. Uh Volo, where where is this <laughs> Volo's never around when you really need them, is he? So Alright, well we got three bits of wood, so that's fine. Uh let's see. Cresselia sidekick doesn't do good against Ghost and Reggie Gigas normal. Um it's a 50-50. It's a double-edged sword. Or a double-edged sealed. How are you want to look at it, so? If there's yet more... You actually make a good point, Shuckle. DLC. Um, Ancestor Cynthia? Never mind, not Cynthia. Um, there's a potential. There's a potential. Uh, Volo, he definitely looks a lot more like Cynthia. Uh, Kogita here? Maybe. The black and the, the hair, potentially. We don't know yet. What's the hardest part of the store for you? Really? Wood? Have you gathered three logs? Yes, we have. I think I've gotten... I think I've got every item in this game, but me, I don't know how much of everything. So, Yes, this is certainly up to do. Now, the moment comes at last. The big reveal. What, pray tell, is the secret behind this wood? Secret? Your expectations need tempering, I fear. This wood is merely for fashioning myself new cotton boards. Cutting boards? You mean, for cooking. The plates we're after aren't dinner plates, so this is hardly the time for cooking. How you complain for one shark in his own work this very moment. Poor Jinter of the Ginkgo Guild must have his hands full with you. Shiny Scizor obtains? Nice one. Holly is here. Welcome back, Holly. You excited for this? Really excited? I feel like something's about to happen. But all this work means all this pay. Here you are, Draconic. A reward for the wood you've brought me. Is it another plate? Oh my god, sure. Pixie plate. When used on a certain Pokemon. Yeah, okay, sure. That's one of the plates we were looking for. <laughs> That's all right, we got one. <clears throat> Apologies. That's indeed one of the plates that we've been searching for. 
What do you mean? A plate? Let me see that again. This does rather look like one of the plates you've been tracking down. Well, the engravings upon it made it less than accommodating as a cutting board. Whatever ingredients crossed it certainly gained a more pleasant flavour. Perhaps that was the board's power. The plate's power, rather. Interesting. Well, no more needs saying. What do you two intend to do now? Well, we managed to collect quite a lot of plates by now, but I still don't know what we're doing with them. Exactly. It's just a hunch, but perhaps we should have a look around the Celesticuff's ruins. Those runes contain statues of both Dialga and Palkia. They might hold more secrets. I see. A fine pretext to continue shirking your mercantile duties to crawl about in old ruins as you so enjoy. On with you then. I don't need you to tell me I'm going. Alright, let, let's go. Let's go. The Celestica ruins, Draconic. I'll see you there. I'll see you there as well. Alright. Just please let me finish the game. <laughs> we're, getting, we're getting there. I'm curious myself what you'll find there. What can we... What can we who live now learn from the remains of our ancient myths and legends? It's a bit hard to pronounce, but okay, sure. Um, let me check. Let me check for a second. I've something is uh, right. Let me think. Blank flame fest ice cold metal zap splash toxic earth sky mind insect pixie iron dread Draco. And rock. Okay, so we don't have a ghost plate. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. We don't have a ghost plate. So I'm assuming Garatina, being a dragon and a ghost type, is coming up. So any other... Is this, is this all the types? Okay, sure, whatever. Uh, there's 18 types, right? 18 types. So Garatina's popping up now. Let's uh, go to the ruins. Well, first, let's go return to the village first. So, it's not that hard to uh, not spoil the game. Come on, come on, guys. I'm I'm trying to read things here, there, and every time someone mentions something about spoilers, um, I'm just I'm just really scared about rest uh, reading the rest of the chat. So, so please don't. Okay. Summit camp. Garatina's coming up. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go! <laughs> right. Lucky Shiny, please? No. No, there's a Vault Scope hanging out. Uh, oh, it's right here. Okay, <laughs> I thought we were going a bit more further down. Oh, that's fine. Have a look at this, Draconic. Uh, yep, that's a uh, statue of the Alga. Is that the Alga? This statue has been kept here far from the statues of Dialga and Palkia. Broken and shattered, and yet it remains. Wait, is it? No, wait. Do you know what it is? I think so. Of course you would. You're the greatest weeder of both when this land knows. The one who could bring low even Dialga and Palkia. That's a Garatina. That's Garatina. This Kremlin statue once was the figure of a Pokemon... One that was equal to both Dialg and Palkia, yet banished from our world. The great Pokemon. Garatina, let's go! Alright. That's what you should be asking yourself. You know what? Well, I'm not in the mood for arguing sign. Don't don't argue, guys. Garatina never existed. It's just a myth. Guys, 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 guys. Garatina exists. Look. Look closely. You can see it's... Now, I'm just going to say this right now. Um, I've been thinking a little bit about the origin forms of Palkia and Dialga. Get this? It's Garatina's six legs. Kind of feel like an origin form if you... No, maybe not. It's a little bit too far-fetched. Uh, Garatina never had the... Um... I'm going to keep on playing. It was banished for its violence. Left to dwell in a world on the reverse side of our own. It is a being that has lain in wait for the chance to bear its fangs in defiance and tear down Arceus itself. Oh. Oh. Now tell me, if this Garatina desires more than anything else to challenge almighty Arceus, where do you think it might appear? Mount Coronet, the Temple of Sinnoh. Sounds good. Stop getting your hopes set up for Garatina. Well, Palkia 
Palkia actually, um, not really a horse, but more of a centaur. Palkia resembles more of a centaur, and Dialga, whatever that is, uh, yeah, that kind of resembles a centaur as well. So, there is a, there is no Garatina. There's never been a Garatina. Garatina is just a, just a myth. All right, I'm gonna go on a limb and believe you guys, until we get to this temple. Exactly. Where one is closer to the heavens than any other place in Hisui. And where the space-time rift first opened. <laughs> oh no. Uh-oh. 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 I can feel it. We are getting closer to uncovering the secrets of this world. I dare say the excitement is loosening my lips more than it should, but... You see, ever since I was young, whenever I met with something painful or heartbreaking... I couldn't help but wonder why life was so unfair, why I was cursed to live through such things. Of course, I imagine we all go through something like that. Eventually, I chose to direct all my energy into my own natural curiosity and ambition. And what tickled my curiosity more strongly than anything were the mysteries to be found in legends, in history, in ruins. You see, I fancy that by unraveling these mysteries, I can find out how the world itself came to be. And with that knowledge, maybe even forge a new, better world. Now, if we can find the realm that exists on the reverse side of our world and meet the creator's unwanted child banished therein, perhaps then we'll be able to understand the, the nature of Almighty Sinnoh itself. Don't you want to see it with your own eyes? We must make for the Temple of Sinnoh at Mount Cornet's Peak. The Alga and Palkia both appeared from within the rift that once gapped open there, didn't they? If these plates can call anything at all, it seems likely that it's where it would appear. Why do I feel a little bit worried? I don't feel... Good, guys. I don't feel so well. They're both centaurs. Plot twist. Well, they both... Uh, centaurs have arms. Centaurs do have arms. Um, true. It's true. But they're more centaurs than they are uh, horses to me. But, yeah, well, you know. Palkia does have that kind of centaur kind of look to it, but anyway. Anyway, it's a statue of a Pokemon, but it's been broken, and for some reason, it's been left that way. You know, we've passed this statue so many times to hunt Shiny Voltorb, and none of you even dare mention that we were actually passing Garatina's broken statue. <sighs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, because there's a lost statue that we can get. No one told me that we were actually passing past an ancient statue of Garatina. I guess it's for the best, guys. I guess it's for the uh, for the best. They really kind of hit that rather well, I have to admit. So, kudos. Kudos to you guys and uh, kudos to this game. To be frank, I didn't notice. I don't think any of us would have noticed the first time around, right? Already got Electivire, so we don't need to uh, bother with that. Is that guy still there? That guy's still there. I'm going to do a safety save. Oh. This guy's still here, watching over the tunnel. Fair enough. Turns out Garantina's true form is a sneezer. It better not be. The stone portal, I've been told not letting anyone pass. Yeah, sure, whatever. Uh, we're going to go head on then. Alright. I have 196 Pokeballs. Guys, I don't think I have enough Pokeballs for this. But I guess we'll find out. Alright, let's see what we're fighting. Been a while since we've been here. Oh, and the ruins are completely destroyed because of what happened. I haven't even touched these ruins ever since uh, completing the actual story. So this is going to be very interesting. <laughs> Music's starting to kick in a little bit now. Okay. Jesus, everything is just destroyed now. The music is... Yeah, the, this is the music. <laughs> Are we going to face Volo? I really don't want to face him. I don't want to face him. I don't want to face him. The temple lies in ruins now. Columns cracked and broken. Like pillars now turned into spears. Stabbed into the heavens. No. Well, I... Well, I detect a distinct lack of Giratina. Is something bothering you? 
Uh, I do beg your pardon. I suppose I must seem to be behaving strangely. Yes, you are. I dare say you deserve to know what I'm really after by now. Ever since I became convinced that Arceus really does exist, there has been one question that consumes my thoughts. How can I meet such a being myself? It was in an attempt to answer this question that I originally sought out Giratina and had it tear open that rift in space and time. After all, Giratina wished to stand against Arceus, but that didn't do the trick. So then I had you gather the fragments of the all-encompassing deity, just as the murals of the runes directed. Eighteen plates, said to be the fragments of the all-encompassing deity. You hold in your hand seventeen of them. So you must be wondering, where is the last one? He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Why, it's right here. Knew it. Just knew it. Well, I've been wondering where I've been wondering where Garretina is. And here we are. Here we are. I thought Garretina would have it originally, but with the way Vol's been acting recently, yeah, okay. This is uh this is quite the plot twist that's happening. Alright. Excuse me? Excuse me? Now hand over the plates you gathered. I will be the one to bring them all together. Uh No. My desire to meet Arceus cannot be contained any longer. I need to know what it is. I must know what it is. If I can meet Arceus myself, then I may also be able to subjugate its power. And using that, I will attempt to create a new, better world. Of course, if I create a brand new world, then this Hisui region that will be, that we currently exist in will be undone and returned to nothing. Alright, Cyrus, sure. You, everyone you know, and all the Pokemon living here will vanish in an instant, if you'd never been. If you want to keep this world from disappearing, then face me in battle. Not that you have a choice. Even if you don't wish to battle me, I'm not above using force to take those plates from you. Okay, alright, I guess we really are battling. I prepared my team for uh, Garatina. Um... Okay, please no. Please no. Why is there a piano playing? <laughs> he has a... Sp he has a freaking spiritomb. <sighs> He's got a full Cynthia team. He has a full team of Cynthia. Okay, okay. Crank up the music. Crank it up a little bit. Let you guys enjoy it. This is a very evil sound. Okay, uh, it's a good thing that Dark Pulse is good, right? Okay, wait, it's literally just Cynthia. It is basically a Cynthia ancestor or someone who's... I don't know. I don't know. I am kind of dreading this fight. Okay. Um, good news. I've prepared for Guard Chomp if he has it. Which is good. Right. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Uh, Dark Pulse. This will be good to start. He is the ancestor of Cynthia. The Dark Pulse. Oh, sure. 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 Hey, at least my Pokemon are pretty good in levels, right? At least they're very good in levels. Gotta go Dark Pulse. Dark Pulse, there we go. Alright. One down. Oh my floppers. This is the greatest battle in the franchise. I hope so. Bringing Garchomp out right now? I guess it makes sense because I'm using a, a poison type. I just got absolutely shredded. Okay. Um Okay. Now it's alright, let's go. Avalog, your time is here now. Avalog, you've got all... Okay, Avalog, hanging in there. Avalog's hanging in there. Uh, all I've got is Ice Shard. That's not good. 
That is not good. I didn't prepare my moves, guys. Didn't prepare my moves. All right, we're just going to go for a regular ice shard. That did no damage. All right, but we can finish it off. We can finish it off. This team is amazing. This team is quite menacing. Uh, do we bring it? Right, let me think. What can he have? What can he have? Okay. I'm going to bring Samuel up. I just want to bring Samuel on and just knock out this guard shop. This might take you a second attempt. This might take me a second attempt. Um, I'm a little bit nervous. I do want to knock out this guard shop and I want to knock it out fast. Yeah, Aqua Tail. Let's just do it. Aqua Tail, get that damage in. This is for you guys' info. I am back. You needed to get a haircut. Hey, welcome back, Murray. We're at this part of the game now. Up against uh, Volo. Lucario. Oh, God, it's a fight. Okay, Bullet Punch is fine. That's good. Okay. That was a crit. Good. There's a close combat, and Samurai is down. But the good news, Lucario's defense is down. We have, we have close combat ourselves, but I want to save this if uh, he's got Togekiss. I think I'm just going to bring it out, right? I think I'm just going to bring out Cleavor. Defenses are down. We've got high levels. Let's see how it goes. Uh, you want to know the music? It's Cynthia's music that's going on right now. Cynthia's music. It's a little bit more less aggressive, if that makes any sense. Cleaver, I believe, all right? Cleaver, I believe. I want to I want to believe. I want to believe that Air Slash would do it. We're just gonna go for a regular close combat, I think. Yeah, defenses are down, it's super effective. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. Three against three. Milotic, Rose Raid, Togekiss. That's what I would assume. Arcanine! Didn't expect that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Are we fine? We are not fine. Uh, do I still have a water type? I don't think I do. Got good oh, no, I've still got water type in Gudra. Okay, Gudra's up next. Gudra is up next. Okay. Oh, hey, it's crazy. Crazy's here. Take the uh, vaccine and now you're... <laughs> that, uh, what do you mean dead inside, buddy? How you doing anyway, crazy? Hope things are going really good for you, buddy. That was heavy. So let's go water pulse. And let's hope... That didn't KO. Come on. Right. Let's go agile style water pulse. That should definitely KO it. I'm now worried about what's coming in next. What we got? There's the Toga Kiss. And it's calm mind. I need to strong style Iron Head this, right? Do I? Why is it still getting a. Okay, good for Survivor with its really good special. That is fantastic. Oh, I can beat this. I can beat this. Iron Head? Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, that was a that was a much needed critical hit. Much needed critical hit. Agile style iron heads. Is that gonna be enough? I hope it's enough. I really do hope it's enough. Come on, Gudra. Come on, Gudra. I believe. I believe, guys. I believe. Are we gonna do this first try? What's last? Rose Raid! Grass and poison against a dragon in steel. Spikes? No, a lot of damage. It's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Spikes again. Okay. It does give us a good opening. With Zorark. We can do some super damage. If Better Malice is able to get Frostbite, it's going to do super damage. So let's go Better Malice. Frostbite, please. No frostbite. I think I've got to go for Shadow Ball, right? 
Meals will leave Frost Bite. This move's power rate is doubled if the target has a status condition. Right, it doesn't have a status condition, so we got to go all out with Shadow Ball. Shadow Ball wins it. A strong style Shadow Ball wins it. Guys, is this first time? Is this first attempt? We beat him in the first go. Let's go. We haven't lost a single trainer battle at least. So that's good. That is good. We may have got destroyed during our brilliant diamond shine and pearl run. But this time, guys, I feel a little sense of redemption. This is not the true Cynthia. This is an imposter. Let's go, guys. I had faith in my team. And I hope you guys had faith in the team as well. Why? Why you? Why do you have the blessing of Arceus? What do you mean we lost Raquel? We won. I brought the team to deal with a Garatina and it ended up winning. <laughs> All right. Let's keep on going. Why? How? I devoted myself to Arceus beyond any other. I worshipped it at this... <clears throat> Narration. Let's get that back in. I worshipped it as the creator of our entire world. I bent all of my passion and interest to its study. All the time I've spent pouring over the legends, everything that I've done. You, outsider, it's almost as if you were spat out of the space-time rift just to get in my way. Yeah, absolutely. No, no, this isn't finished yet. Can't you feel it? The chill creeping through your veins? The eldritch presence ice in your heart. Uh... Is that Garatina? All right. Okay. All right. God, he's got that. Garatina, let's go. This is looking cool. How's it going, Garatina? What are you doing on that side? Garatina, strike him down. Are you serious? Are you serious? Are we fighting Garatina now? How are we still fighting? Wait, 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 wait. Why do we still, wait, excuse me? Why does he have seven? That's, that's against the rules. Garatina's filled with a terrible, excuse me, excuse me. This is clearly breaking the rules right now. This is clearly breaking the rules. You have got to be kidding me. Okay, we can still we can still pull this together. Seven. <laughs> he just broke the freaking rules. He is a goddamn cheater. All right, I believe, I believe, I believe. We brought Zorark in, so let's go agile, better malice. Hopefully, we get the frostbite. Frostbite would be fantastic. Okay, do you get frostbite? We got the frostbite. Let's go. Let's go. Fight. Strong. This is going to do base 150 damage. Base 150 damage. Do I attack? I feel like I have to attack, right? I have to attack. God damn, I can't believe you just brought Garatina in. I, I can't catch it either. I can't catch it either. Fight. Strong style. Better malice. 150 damage. Let's go. Strong style. Better malice. Base 150. I believe in you, Zorark. You gotta be kidding me. How does that that's not fair. That's just not fair. That's just not fair. Try again with a... <laughs> Shadow Ball wouldn't have done it. Shadow Ball wouldn't have done it. You're defeated in battle. Try again with a, a stronger team. Really? Are you serious? Oh, that's just a lot of crap. But you know what? I'm actually going to change my, uh, my moves. There was one move. That was... That was garbage. That was garbage. That was garbage. All right, okay. Guys, we didn't lose. We didn't lose. That, he just had to cheat. He just had to cheat to win. 
Oh, great. We can get... Good. We actually get some good moves here. Well, eh. Samuel's good on the physical side. Well, I should have done this before. Should have done this before, especially for Avalog. Uh, change moves. Uh, Mountain Gale. Holy hell, yes. Get rid of Iron Defense. Double Edge would be good. Let's give it Double Edge as well. Oop. Okay, this is a good move set. Make sure it's good for priority. If uh, if it works like that, of course. He te didn't technically speak. He spawned Garatina. He spawned Garatina and... Um... Alright, we got that set up. Gudra, what can Gudra go ahead and do? Change moves. You can learn Hydro Pump as well. You know what? Uh, let's get rid of... Um... Let's give it a Shelter. Because the rest of its moveset is... Uh, shelter's good, you know, but I think I'd rather go with the Hydro Pump. If we're faced with a scenario where I don't think Water Pulse is going to be enough, Hydro Pump could probably end up doing it. Zorok, let's uh, check out Zorok's moveset. Zorok was probably the king with its moveset. Slash is strong. Uh, I guess Extra Sentry could probably ta be taken away. Extra Sentry. Um... What is, what, is the, what is Zorak good with? What is the Zorak good with? Uh, he didn't technically speak. He spawned Garatina. He cheated. He cheated, guys. You've seen it. You've seen it. Special set is uh, probably the best. All right, I think that's fine. Change move sets for Overquill. Spikes. Poison thing. This thing can use self-destruct. Uh, yes, please. Much self-destruct. Uh, actually, its move set is pretty good already. Actually, I'm going to swap out uh, Water Pulse for Aquatil. That seems like it's good. Self the self the freaking struct. Okay, that's um. Uh, you know, it's not terrible, but we'll see. So, what's he going to lead with? He's going to lead with uh, Spiritum. Spiritum. Um. What do we what do we lead with, guys? You can do this next time. No, I'm going to keep on going. I'm going to keep on going. Zorak let me down. Zorak was, um, I should have revived. But to be fair, I would have been breaking my own rule, guys. I would have been breaking my own rule. So I'm still, I'm still refusing to use an item, even if he's a, he's a cheater. So, did I grab the, no, I didn't. Okay, I'm going to give this one more go. Uh, actually, should I just pull back and get my team stronger? I think we now know what we're doing. Uh, let's go Gudra to lead, right? Do we lead with Gudra? No, we, need, we might need uh, Gudra for Togekiss. Um, oops, wrong move. Um, yeah, Cleaver seems like it's a good start. We'll lead with that. Uh, this is the battle I've been grinding for. A hand over the plates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Sure, sure. Hey, where's Garatina? Do you want, want to bring him back out and make it um, 7 versus 6 again? <sighs> he cheated to win. I'm not taking that. I'm not taking that, guys. Yeah, screenshots of winning with a uh, level 55 Pokemon. Nice! Leading with Gudra. Leading with the Gudra. Oh, wait, hang on. We're leading with Gudra? Alright, never mind. Um... Sure. What is Gudra good with? Is it good physically or special? I never really checked its uh, stats. Special attacks uh, is good. Okay, so special sides best items. No, get away. Alright, okay. Let's go with... Um... Let's go with regular Dragon Pulse. Okay, that's good. Hypnosis. Hypnosis is fine. Okay. We may have uh, been in a little bit of trouble. Dragon Pulse, please. Oh my god, please no. Please not like this. We were much... No, I don't want a repeat of this. There we go. Gudra's in a much more difficult spot now. Lucario is now in uh, bulk up. Oh, jeez, Lucario, thanks for seeing, being such a... You know, I don't even know how to react to that. All right, sure. 
I think we just go strong style hard rip up, right? Ball cop increases the physical side. Uh, sure. Just strong style hydro pump. Does she have shiny quillfish? I think he does. That didn't even drop it to half. Bullet punch. Relax, 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 relax. Alright, bullet punch. Um, fighting and steel. Fighting and freaking steel. All right, okay. Um, Zorok. Shink Sight Break for Racer? Hey, that's good. That's good. That's absolutely brilliant. All right, let's just go... Um, let's go Strong Style Shadow Ball. And let's get him down to at least a four. There we go. Probably would have been able to do that with... Nah, but yeah, I wasn't going to take the risk, guys. Wasn't taking the risk... All right, Arcanine's now in. Crunch. Yep, yeah, sure, 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 sure. Crunch, uh, Fire and Rock. We could probably bring in Samurai. Or we could probably bring in Overquill. And this will force the Guard Shop to come out. We can bring in Avalog. Uh, thinking, 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 thinking. This will force the Guard Shop. Samurai forces the Guard Shop to come out. Let's go sign your up. You really want a shiny quillfish for your team, but I haven't found any outbreaks. You can you can find them. Oh, this is actually good for us. Agile uh Aquatil, please just please let this do it. There we go. Okay, this is four times the damage. And we have our levels. Okay, back in the driver's seat. Back in the driver's seat. Rose raid. Okay, rose raid. Um Strong style, pedal dance. I did not expect that. I did not expect it was actually Rose Raid coming out. Fixated on using pedal dance. And he used, does he use strong style? I can't remember. Uh, let's bring in Avalog. I think we need to bring in Avalog and just do some solid damage right here. Really gonna need to pray and hope that Mountain Gale does so much damage, alright? Come on, Mountain Gale. You've gotta- I quit. I really do quit. Come on. Spikes. Okay, it actually did nothing, so that's fine. And it lost its Pell Dance. Come on, come on, Mount- I... <sighs> Two Hypnosis, two- This this is this is worse than the last time, it really is. This is way worse than the last time. Avalog missed twice. Gudra couldn't use its moves twice. This is uh this is a wipe. This is a wipe. I've got nothing to deal with the guard chomp now. I got nothing to deal with the guard chomp. I think I've had enough playing around, guys. I've had enough. I'm going to go back and uh, build my team up. Wow, I'm surprised Cleaver survived that attack. And there's the Iron Heads. Yeah, I'm going to build up my team. I'm going to go back and build up my team. Because... Because I got nothing. I got nothing. Missed four attacks. Four! Four attacks! Four attacks. Made the difference. Huge difference. Four attacks made the huge difference, so... <sighs> okay. Okay, that was way worse. I'm gonna have to pull back and organize. You've been good just so you can uh, use uh, bulk up and use uh, max revives. I'm not using max revives. I do not use items in battle. Or the level 85 at guard shop. It was level... I'm not bringing any of that. I'm only bringing my team. I'm only bringing Pokemon in my team, okay? Not gonna lie, uh, Drek must go big brain to win. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to. I've got other Pokemon that I can use. I, I built my team to deal with uh, Garatina. And of course, that team has uh, advantages and disadvantages. So I'm gonna go back and uh, build my team based on how to deal with Volo. So, 
I've got a different Pokemon uh, to deal with whatever Volo brings out, which will be very, very good. I just need to build my team based on that, so that's all I need to do. Finishing uh, something I'm not uh, giving up on. Good racer, good. I ain't giving up on this fight either, so. Okay, so let's have a look. Let's have a look and see what we got. So, Samuel is staying in. Samuel is staying in no matter what. Um, so let's bring everybody else back. Okay, and I think I already have a plan in place. So first of all is the Spiritomb. Spiritomb has gotten uh, only a weakness to Fairy. And the only Pokemon in my team that has a fairy move is Ursaluna. It's got play rough. So Ursaluna is up first in that department. It's also good against, uh, it could potentially be good against Lucario. Uh, speaking of Lucario, it is steel and fighting. So we need a psychic user to deal with that. I can either use weird deer, but it is normal. So I'd rather not deal with that side of it. I'm going to bring Bavarian, but it's level 59. That kind of sucks. Basket Legion does have Psychic on board, which is actually really good. So I think Basket Legion is the way to go. Weeder's got Normal as it's, um, which is weak to fighting, and Breveri would be good. And I can always teach that Psychic move anyway, so. Uh, Togekiss, I need to get Steel or I can get Rock. Um, and there's also Rose Raid, which could be a bit of a problem. So I think Arcanine is the best bet for that one. Arcanine can deal with the Rose Raid. It can deal with the um, Rose Raid. It can deal with the Togekiss. So I think this is good. Uh, let me think for a second there. Well, so who else are we missing? Who else are we missing? Garchomp, Avalog. Avalog can easily one hit Kira. I, I believe in Avalog. Two misses. Um, I'm going to give Avalog another shot. Um, Let's see. Sadly, we don't have a fairy type ever on to kind of be immune to Giratina's. Um, what do you guys think? You can go get uh, go to uh, get moves by talking to the move trainer. That's true. But I, I feel like I'm very comfortable with most of the move sets here anyway. So we got Zorak to deal with the Giratina. What else does that deal with? It kind of also no, nah, it doesn't. It doesn't deal with the Spiritomb. All right, let's see what we think. Let me think what we got here. So we got Spiritomb. Spiritomb is good for Ursulina. So Ursulina kind of leads the charge there. Uh, then we got in the Lucario, which is good for Basket Legion. We got Arcanine to deal with the Togekiss as well as the Rose Raid. Avalog can deal with the Guardchomp, the Rose Raid, uh, the Togekiss as well. So Avalog is really, really strong for this one. Um, is there anybody else I'm missing? Guardchomp is good for Avalog as well. Um, what else am I missing, guys? Is that everyone? So these are always one shot to kill the Lucario. I guess that does kind of make sense. And Poison, I, I keep on forgetting this, but Poison does make sense against um, Togekiss, which is good. So Poison is good. What else am I missing, guys? Not going to lie. Just going to shuckle. Not going to lie uh, with what, buddy? Uh, you're losing because you don't have Sneasling. I'm going to, all right. Because, just because you said that shit, I'm not going to use Sneasling. <laughs> Electrode would be good against both Guardchomp and it's good against Togekiss. Uh, it's also level 70 as well, which is really, really good. Uh, I think this team is good still. What, what was that Basket Legion going to deal with? It was going to deal with Lucario. Arcanine can also deal with Lucario as well, which is good. Lucario, Togekiss. Um, yeah. Lucario is not weak to Psychic. Oh, because that's right. Because of its, um, because of its uh, Steel Typing. You're right. So maybe Basket Legion is not the best one to bring in. It has an Arcanine as well. He has an Arcanine. So Ursaluna counts as... Um, Ursaluna is uh, good for both Arcanine. But we've also got Samuel to deal with um, uh, with it as well. So I'm not using Caesar. How much longer are you going to stream? Mari, I don't know. I don't know. It's, uh, I think I'm going to be streaming most of the day anyway. So it is actually OP. Use Sneasler. It is actually OP. I would need to get the item for it. Which I don't think I have. I'll just double check, see if I've still got one. Nope, I don't have it. 
Sorry, Shay. <laughs> Sorry, Shay. All right. Uh, I I do believe it could be OP, but this is a Sneasel, not a Sneasler. I've real I've I've raised the level decently, but uh, Cleavor has got a wide variety of moves. It's got Rock. It's got Fighting. It's got Fighting to deal with Lucario. Rock to deal with Togekiss. You can also deal with the. I think Cleavor is a good all rounder high level. I think that would be a good one to put in. I think it would be really good to bring this in. Uh, should Spiritomb be a legend in your opinion? Yes, I truly believe that Spiritomb should be a legend. 100%. I kinda, I'm kind of missing out on Gudra. Gudra has got a good variety of attacks. Gudra, what does Gudra do good against? Gudra does good against the. Um, I don't know why I'm so worried about Togekiss so much, to be fair, so. Level 60 Avalog, but the rest are above the level, apart from Ursula, of course. Uh, use Cleaver for Togekiss, to be honest. I think that does make sense. Arcanine is good as well. High level, it can take a bit of bulk. My only worry with most of this team is... No, I think it's fine. I think most of it's fine. Avalog's got insanely high uh, physical stats and defense and attack, so we're definitely taking this. Avalog is only going to be there the moment the guard shop pops out. Uh, that's basically it. The moment guard shop comes out, uh, Avalog is there still. Uh, yeah. The item is quite easy to get. Uh, you're absolutely right. All right, let's um, save here. Let's just see what happens. I ain't messing around, guys. I ain't messing around this time. And Ursuline is leading the charge with uh, Play Rough. They could probably bring in Lucario. That forces me to go into uh, maybe Arcanine. And then if they bring in Garchomp, Avalog will be ready. Avalog at that point will be a little bit um, double-edged sword. Yeah, well, we'll, yeah we'll, see, we'll see what happens. See what happens, guys. What's your favorite Legend, Mythic, Mega, or uh, favorite Pokemon? What's my favorite um, Legend, Mythic, Mega, and favorite Pokemon? Charizard is my favorite of all time. Charizard is my favorite Pokemon, so you can probably guess... Uh, so you can probably guess um, what my favorite mega is. Um, Legend is Zygarde. Zygarde represents... Uh, for me, Zygarde is you guys. You guys are, are the embodiment of uh, Zygarde. So. And Darkrai is my favorite mythic. Just because it's a Pokemon of nightmares. And it's got a really cool lore to it. Unlike, unlike most mythics where I don't really know what their lore is. I like Darkrai because it's it actually has a good lore about it. So. Alright, let's uh, get this one a try. Alright, leading with, uh, not leading with Cleavor. Let's just make sure that I've got everything all set up. Alright. Do you know what I'm a little bit annoyed at? How, um... I'm a little bit disappointed that, um... That we don't get levels midway through the battle. And, and we only get the experience at the end, so... Yeah, but oh well, never mind. Uh, you're not Zygarde, you're Kyogre. Fair enough, Harvey. It's fair enough. Okay. So we got a fair move to deal with the Spiritomb. If we get hit by Hypnosis, that's going to be a bit of a problem. So I need to think. Do I go Agile or do I just go in for the Strong? Because Spiritomb then gets another attack immediately out of the gate. I think I'm just going to go Regular. It packs so much damage. I don't believe that will KO if I go Strong Style. So I'm going to go Play Rough, just normal. I should have went strong. I should have went strong. At least it's offense. He pulled it back? Rose Raid is in. Uh, okay. Okay. Um. I did not expect that. Okay, so Spiritomb is uh, still hanging about. Okay, um. Arcanine's coming in now. Bring in Arcanine. You like your team because when I found a shiny one in Ultramoon, my battery was dying and it was probably the most stressful three minutes. <laughs> just charge up your, um, just charge up and you wouldn't have that problem, of course. But uh, if you're going to tell me that you caught it, then very well done. Oh my goodness. I can get three moves right here. But I'm going to go strong style. I guess that's the cost for swapping out, right? Strong style, and I get another move on top of that. Just because he swapped out. 
I'm okay with this. I am actually okay with this. Lurkin, have to do some work. No problem, Racer. No problem. Uh, and there goes your answer to Spirit Zone. Lucario's in. Do I strong style this? Okay, so he's going for a bulk up. Okay, I do get the attack in there. So I can go for a Rage and Fury. I could also swap, but no, nah, I don't want to do that. Go Rage and Fury. Rage and Fury, please. I ain't filling around this time, guys. I ain't filling around. Let's go, Arcanine. Let's go. Right. Okay, Garchomp is fine. We well die to Earth Power. But Arcanine was a good boy. Good boy, Arcanine. Knocked out that Lucario. Did a... And Rose Raid. Did a fantastic job. Avalog is now coming in. Lurking. No problem. He was in the car. You were in the car. And there goes the answer to Spiritual. All right. Avalog. Listen. Avalog. Listen, buddy. Listen. I'm going to go... I'm doing strong style for you, all right? I know you missed these two Mountain Gales last time. If you miss this, I am never using you again. So you've got a lot riding on your Avalog. Thank you. Let's go. Goodbye, Garchomp. Okay. Four against three. An Avalog. Good. Good. Arcanine. Avalog might be able to take a few hits. Yep. Yeah, Rock Slide. It can take a couple of hits, which is good. And Rock Slide missed. Oh, we're in the driver's seat. Okay, it's actually using Rock Slide again. That's fine. That's fine. Avalog did brilliant. Avalog did absolutely brilliant. It did everything it needed to do. And that was phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. What are we still dealing with? We've still got to deal with an Arcanine, a Spiritomb, and a Togekiss. Spiritomb's already low in HP. Togekiss is weak to rock. I need to think about this for a second. I could bring in the Samuel right now. Cleaver can then use the uh, Stone Axe. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We can. Yeah, we'll bring in Samuel right now. Okay. Okay, we're good. Arcanine was definitely the right decision. Yep, Arcanine, definitely the better decision right there. I get two attacks, which is good. Really good. Base Aqua Tail. Okay, I thought that was going to miss for a second, but it's fine. There goes Arcanine. Three against two. Three against two. And one of them is a wounded Spiritual. Alright, Togekiss is in. We do get another attack, which is fantastic. We could Strong Style. Honestly, Strong Style seems like it could be a good way to go. What do you guys think? Strong Style, or do you guys think I should go for Normal or Agile? What do you guys think? Orlando! Welcome, Orlando. And Draco's here. Hello, both of you. Hope you're having a good day. Please enjoy your stay as well. What do you guys think? He doesn't know. Callum says, I don't know. If you're talking about Garatina, um, I'm already calling um, uh, Volo here a cheater, so. Uh, haven't you uh, teach Zorak uh, any ice moves? I didn't teach Zorak any ice moves. Um, I didn't know that I could. Or maybe I just haven't done so yet, so. Prob Agile? The thing with Togekiss is that it's got a fairy move. I think well, no matter what I do, Samurott's definitely going to take the hit, so. And then I can bring in. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go regular. I'm gonna go regular? Yeah, if it went strong style, it wouldn't have KO'd, so that's fine. Strong style Moonblast? That was a strong style Moonblast, which is good news for us. Because now we can lead in there with uh, Cleavor. And uh, they've got Spiritome, which doesn't have the best speed, of course. I can strong style this. Yeah, Stone Axe. Agile? I, I, I thought about strong, but it wouldn't have killed. Strong Axe, however. That's a whole different story, my friends. So if Spirit Tone comes in, it's not going to kill Cleaver. It wouldn't. It's on a fraction of health. And then we can get some damage into Garatine. Oh! My! You absolute hacker. God damn it. Okay. You absolute hacker. <sighs> I want Cleaver to live. Cleaver needs to live. 
You said Stone Edge. Did I? Well, Stone Axe. Oh, that was actually some really phenomenal, phenomenal cleaver. You are, um, you are phenomenal. I just want this hit to land, so still next again. Cleavor is still in, which is good. Right, so if Garatina comes out, Cleavor is going to take the damage. Then this means Zorark can come in and get itself all nice and set up. So that's good news. Seven against six. You just had to cheat, didn't you? Well, to be fair, um, he's actually not breaking the rules. I'm going to have to be completely honest with you guys. And yet you could have uh, done that the first time you sent out a spirit tone. I could have, but I didn't. Guys, can I just point out, not only is he using seven Pokemon, but you had to use a full restore as well. Who doesn't have seven Pokemon and who doesn't have to use a full restore? This guy. All right, at least we get to see this uh, Garatina animation again. So that's kind of cool, right? Yeah, we already know uh, Garatina's coming along, so. You're here, just not chatting on Palk. You're here, just not chanting up Palkia. No problem, Harvey. No problem, buddy. Did I say Stone Edge or did I say Stone Axe? You, you guys know what I meant. Okay. Alright, Garantina, I'm back. I'm back. I've, I've got a proper team this time. Proper team this time to deal with Garantina. So, if Cleaver gets sent out, then that's fine. We can probably take the hit. If it goes up to full HP, that's, that's even better, but I doubt it, so. It's sending in Zor. Oh my god, why Zora? Why Zora coming in first? I guess this is... Is this okay? Am I okay? Does this work? It's... Okay. Okay, so fight. Better Malice. Okay, this is fine. So, better Malice... Uh, we need to get the uh, we need to get that frostbite condition now. So better malice. Said Stone Age bar. I know what you meant. Yep. We need frostbite. We need to get that frostbite. No frostbite. That sucks. That sucks. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why did it do that? Why did it do that? Why did it do that? I should have done that. <sighs> I don't want to use an item. I really don't want to use an item. I'm not switching. I'm not switching if that's what you guys are thinking. <sighs> I don't want to use an item. I really I don't want to use an item and cheat out of my own ruling. Put Zorak at the bat. I should have. You're absolutely right. I should have. All the Pokemon stats are boosted. The Pokemon also takes reduced damage from stats conditions and move effects such as poison and splinters. Great, 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 great. Should have known that. Who cares if you use items? He cheated too. To be fair, he did cheat. He did cheat. All right, we're gonna use a full. Uh, we're gonna use a Max Revive. He cheated, he brought in a Garatina, he used a full restore, so we're going to cheat as well. It's time to cheat, guys. We're going to bring in our buddy, uh, we're going to bring in our buddy Samuel up. Agile style, sure. Dragon Claw, sure. Alright, we still have Cleavor, which is fine. Cleavor is going to be our backup just in case, so let's bring in Samuel, up, okay? Samuel, up, let's go. There's no way I win without... No, I could probably win without full restores. Easily. I believe I can take an attack, so... So just to counter Garatina's Agile Style, we're just going to Agile Style Ceaseless Edge. Get our free turn back. We can take one hit. Alright, that's good. Splinters. Splinters is good. Oh, you've got to be... This thing has aura... Okay, we're still alive. 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 Strong style. This thing has bloody focus. Sorry, uh, whatever that was. <sighs> so 
Samuel, sure. Samuel. Samuel, Oshawott, Dewart. Hell, it could be bloody uh, Draco Watt, and it's, you still get what I'm saying, right? It's Aura Sphere. I'm getting these bloody moves mixed up. I'm getting names mixed up. I'm getting moves. This game has hurt my mind. It really has. This game has played tricks with my mind. Sure. Sure. We've done it once. Why not do it again? We've done it once. Why not do it again? And it just goes for Agile Style. Aura Sphere. He brought a seventh. He brought a seventh. He used a full restore last time. So sure. So sure. Say I want my level 55 Pokemon. Well, that's good. Well, that's good. How am I struggling this much? How am I struggling this much? And there's Shadow Force. Oh, Cleavor, you are fantastic. You are fantastic. You are fantastic. Regular Stone X. Get some splinters in there. That's good. Shadow Force. That's uh, that's Cleaver. If this Aura Sphere crits, um, then I'm gonna start maybe using candies. <laughs> oh goodness. Come on, Sam. You're out. Listen, 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 buddy. Strong style, ceaseless edge. Just, just, just do it. Just knock this out. Oh, come on! Are you still fighting? Oh, come on! Really? What the hell was that? Come on! Eight? Eight? It's an eight birth. All right, I've had enough. I've had enough. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Hell, he can he can have Arceus. All right, I don't even care anymore. I just don't even care. He's honestly, he has uh, pushed my hand, guys. He has pushed my hand. Eight versus freaking two. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. He's forced my hand. He has officially forced my hand, guys. It's time. It's time for buff Conic. Regular Conic cannot do it. It is time to get buff. See, this is the part where you insert some inspirational gym music. Uh, but we can't do that because of copyright reasons, guys. I didn't want it to come to this, guys. I didn't want it to come to this. I wanted to just play this game with a good challenge. There's the buff Conics. Shay's redeeming that one. Guys, we're about to hit the gym. You see all these uh, candies I've been uh, saving up? Yep, we're going to grab every single one of them. All right. Let's get going, guys. Let's get going. Let's um, let's uh, start getting buff. Samurot. Let's uh, get a couple for you. And uh, you know what? Actually, Samurot, you can have all of it. You can have all of it. You are our main number one. Samuel is our main number one. All right. Avalog, let's get some for you. Zdorok, you're definitely in contention. Let's get some for you. Okay. Cleavor. Uh, Cleavor's fine. Um, Arcanine's fine. Ursaluna, I think we're really going to need you, buddy. I, I really have needs a lot of faith in you. Let's get you properly buffed up. You're all good to go. That's good. Good stuff. Good stuff. Like to see it. Like to see it. Um, who's pretty on the level? Avalog is all the level. You know what, Avalog? You can have all of this. You know, that's gonna... Okay, that's actually some really good levels, buddy. That's really, really good. And um, uh, I know I know Samuel's already got a lot of experience already, but Samuel can already have some more. There we go. Enough to get to 89. Um, who wants some rare candies? Samuel? 
Let's get you over the 90 mark. Uh, let's see. Who else needs some? Zorark, you're good. You're good. I want you to make sure that you survive some attacks. So let's get a couple for you in your direction. You know what, Samuel? I'm a, you know, you know. I, I believe in you, buddy. I believe in you. Level 95 freaking Samuel, guys. I'm just going to hold on to the rest of those candies. Guys. Guys. I've had enough. We're buffed up. We're ready to go. This is why it took me two and a half hours. Okay, he's wasting his candy. I'm wasting my candy for this fight. I am not messing around. Garatina is just... Volo just pops up and he says, Nah, I'm not done. Garatina pops in and he's like, I'm going to take a Vol Volo. You take a chill down. You take a chill pill. You sit down and rest. Once we beat Garatina, changes forms. And he's like, Haha, build you. Lift the weights, damn it. Oh, I'll be lifting those weights. Hang on a second. Let me just get there first. Let me just get there. With our new buffed up strong team, guys. Kill Alpha Blissey and Obsidian Fuel into grade. You're right, but I can't be bothered. You have 90. I've got. I've still got rare candies anyway, so it's no problem at all. Okay, I haven't saved, so don't worry. It's not a complete waste of candy. So I could have got Samuel to level 100, but we don't need it. We don't need Samuel at level 100. I believe Samuel at level 95 is uh, good enough. 95 is good, and hopefully it's enough to take the damage, alright? Plus, you never... Samuel getting some experience is also going to be good. Alright, there we go. You see this, Volo? You see this? It's time for a workout, guys. It's time. Why is Zorak leading? Why are you... Why is Zor... You know what? You know what? Sure. Sure. Um, better malice. Let's get lifting, all right? Because sure, let's just keep on lifting. Draconic needs content, <laughs> exactly. Hypnosis, dodge the attack. That's right. That's what happens when we get all buffed up, guys. You know. Let's uh, get another attack in here. Let's go for a little bit more of a stronger move, guys. Let's go for a strong shadow ball. That seems like a good move. See, all we do is just. Keep on going strong. We just flex it against our opponent. There goes the spirit zone. Good fight. Good fight. One down. No damage. It is now six against seven. There is Arcanine with probably a ghost move of some kind. Or, sorry, dark move, of course. Crunch. Zara gets knocked out. Oh, crap. Sure. Okay. But we can max revive that. We can get that back in, all right? I think that's enough, we enough weight left in for now, guys. Ursa Luna coming into the fight. Should be good. Ursa Luna is good. We don't need a strong move. We don't need a strong move. Just go with high force power. This is fine. Oh my god. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Um, I believe in high horse power. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. We're good. We're good. We're good. Uh, you could have uh, got Samuel to level. Yeah, but we're fine. Alright, Lucario's in. That's a knockout on the Ursa. Oh, well. Well. Yeah, now it is. No, it's not. Just a lie. It was just a lie, guys. Alright. No strong style. Went from I don't need items to max out his team and spam in max revives. I don't even need max revives. I don't even think I will need max revives. But I've got them on standby just in case. Standby just in case. Real Dread can... Absolutely knock out uh, Ursula. No, that's fine. Okay. Just need to think about who I'm bringing in next. Um, I think I know who I'm going to bring in. Makes sense to bring in the Arcanine. Arcanine's coming in. Uh, that's fine. Alright then, I bet my whole life savings you can't win this <laughs> with this buff team including that. You think I'm not going to win? Ah, uh, no. I believe I'm going to win. Let's go Firefang. Agile Firefang to start with, and let's see what this does. It knocked it out. Agile Firefang? That wasn't even the strongest move. Guard, yeah, there's Guard Chomp. That's fine, that's fine. Guard Chomp is in... Earth Power and Arcanine? That's okay. Volo is only beating us with quad effective critical hits. That's the only reason that they're winning. Right, so let's bring in Avalog. You do believe you can win. I think I'm going to win this time. Avalog is now in. Avalog, listen, buddy. I need you to just use your strongest, most powerful 
attack possible, all right? Well, I shot is a good start, but no, 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 no. I want it to go with um, regular Mountain Gale. And it hits. Perfect. Fighting the accuracy, and we win. Perfect. Just Togekiss is left. Three against one. Avalog might get hit hard and knocked out. Moonblast. Avalog hanging in there. Calm mind. Okay. Um, We just hit it with our strongest ice move possible. Strongest ice move possible. So one of your strongest mountain gales, please, Avalog. Let's go. Yes. Nice crit. Three against two Garatinas. Three against two Garatinas. Okay. Okay. And I've got max revives. I ain't fooling around, guys. This is buff Conic. Buff Conic is a whole alternate version. But the level's up, which is good. Okay. Come on. Come on. Bring out Garatina. Bring out Garatina. <sighs> Fill me once, shame on you. Fill me twice, shame on me. Garatina is all out of forms. We know what we're doing now. We are not losing this fight. We are not losing this fight. We're buffed up. We brought the right team. We know what we're doing now. So, let's fight it. How many of you guys believe that I'm going to win? Thumbs up. And if you've got no confidence... Thumbs down. Leave this entirely up to you guys. <sighs> I'm kind of impressed that Avalog survived all the <laughs> after all. It's uh, not that good with the special. Avalog's very yeah, it's pretty bulky, pretty good. But yeah, his special side is not that great. He has nine. He better not have nine kills because if he does, uh, I'm eating out of the stream. He has eight, and that's already more than I can handle. Cleavor is now in the fight. Taking the damage rather well. Became obscured. That's a little bit annoying. We can... We can stone next here. Probably better just using the max revive with Cleavor, but this will do fine for now. Okay, you know what? I probably should have used the max revive for Zorark. Shadow Force. Cleavor hanging in there, which is good. Yeah, I'm going to max revive. Items. Max revive. Use this on Zorark. I think that's probably the best way to go. Yeah, Zorark makes sense. Uh, his max is 8. I think it's fair to say that. Yeah, I hope so. Because he's all out of moves. All out of moves. Well, all out of types. Forms. All out of forms. That's what I'm trying to say. Garatina is becoming more and more obscured. That actually is not good. Not exactly the best in the world now. Is it? I can bring Avalog in at any time. Which is fantastic. Because I can get a lot of damage in there. Right. Better Malice. Come on, Better Malice. We need Frostbite. If we get Frostbite, we are in with a really strong shot. We got Frostbite. Okay. We beat this form. We beat this form with a much more stronger, better malice. Then its next form comes in, and then that's a new bridge that we're going to have to overcome. All right, that one's done. Good job, Zorark. Zorark is still looking good. Still needs to take some hits as well. Okay. Okay, here we go. This is it. It's music is also playing Agile style Dragon Claw. Okay, this is fine. Right, now I need to think. Now I need to think. Now I need to think. We bring in our level 95 Samurott. Alright. And we'll figure out exactly what Avlog's gonna do when we get there, so. Right, we can ceaseless edge this first time. And then we can go for um strong style. That's already doing some really good damage. Fight. Strong style, ceaseless edge. We win. That's it. I ain't filling around, guys. Yes! And with a critical hit, you better stay down. 
good. We finally beat Garatina. Holy hell, may have overdone it a bit, but we beat Garatina. Buff Cornic for the win. Let's go. He has a Zygarde. He if he has a Zygarde, uh, I'm just deleting my YouTube channel. You did it. GG, you did it. Good. Was that really worth it? Uh, probably. If it was not live streaming, definitely. Snarko, y'all who want to trade, you got a shiny sneezer. I got one already, buddy. But welcome, welcome. Hope you're having a good day, buddy. Uh, also, question, why would you want to trade a shiny sneezler? Where did you get it from? Did you just get it from a trade that someone randomly gave to you? Or did you hunt it yourself? Oh, crud, you have to give you <laughs> pocket savings now. I did pretty well. I didn't even need uh, to bring Avalog in at the end, which was good. 95 Samurot did it. All right, let's enjoy this next part then, guys. I swear, if he brings in a ninth Pokemon or a ninth form or whatever, um, he better not. Turn and tail in running from this puny human? Pathetic. I was the one to feed you the power you needed so that you could take on Arceus. I was the one who gave you the chance to claw open that space-time rift, driving the deity of space and the deity of times mad so that you could drag the creator out from hiding. This guy was behind everything? How? How could this happen? Almighty Arceus, if you have any heart within you, then tell me. The blood of the ancient Sinnoh people flows in my veins, does it not? What is it then that you find so lacking in me? Do you mean to tell me that this world doesn't need to be remade? I can't live with such questions. I can't bear not satisfying this ache to know. Answer me then, Draconic. Do you have some dream that propels you, as I've had? Um, uh, yeah, I got a dream. Yeah, if you want to show it to uh, Shay in the chat, Shay can have a look at it. You probably could have just uh, sold your team. I probably could. I probably could, Shuckle. You're, you're right. So you do. Doubtless that dream of yours would never leave room for the dreams of one like me. I am the great weeder of Pokemon, and you, you battle alongside your Pokemon. In the end, I was alone, but not you. You will fight together with your Pokemon to seize whatever dreams you have. Here, take it. Take the plate that started me on the path, the plate I once received from Garatina. My journey is over. My story ended when I lost to you. Okay, we got the spooky plate. Alright, so interesting. Did Volo really start everything? Just so Garatina can settle a grudge with Arceus? Eh, I could probably see that happening. We now have all 18 plates. Seeking the remaining plates and we're all done. I suppose now you've gathered all the plates said to exist in this land of Asui. Ah, oh, the flute! Oh! The Celestica Flute transformed into the Azure Flute. So that's, that's it. The Azure Flute, <laughs> it comes to you. So Arceus wishes to meet you. Of all people, you have to be the one. Is that why you are brought to this world? I've no desire to watch from the sidelines as Arceus comes to you. And I absolutely cannot accept a world in which you would ever manage to defeat Arceus. Someday... I'll solve every riddle in the Legends of a Series Pokemon. And on that day, I'll stand before Arceus at last. No, I will conquer it. No matter how many years, how many decades, how many centuries it takes me. Alright, see you, Volo. You can have uh, Volos uh, here as an effort. Oh, sweet, can you? That's, uh, that's cool, but I probably won't go for it. The Defied Pokemon. Alright. Seems like it's uh, it. That's why he uh, waited so into this. Do you. Wait, what's going on, Shuggle? Yes, you did. Uh, you can have all here, sir. That's what I'm using. That's what you're using, Shay? Nice. Seems like it. Uh, that's why he was a sword to the mass. I guess so. Well, he's away now, anyway, so. Seek out all the Pokemon there are to meet, then play your flute upon the dice in the Temple of Sinnoh. So I've got a question. I got a question. We didn't exactly capture. Garatina. We didn't capture Garatina, so where is it?
You have obtained the Azure Flute, which is said to be the key to meeting Arceus, the Pokemon spoken of in ancient myths. What will happen when you play it? Hmm. Well, there's Garatina. Oh, they're, they're Darkrai. Nice. Hmm. Guess we may as well just investigate. You decided to play the Azure Flute. Okay. Go talk to the professor. It's a request. Well, that's kind of cool. But nothing happened. So we do need Garatina. A message appeared on your arc phone. Seek out all the Pokemon. Arceus is still texting us, so we still need to get Garatina. God, and our team's absolutely destroyed. Well, apart from Samuel and Avalok hanging on in there. It's in the game crazy. It's a request. Garatina might be DLC. No idea. Wouldn't Garatina not be a quest? Well, okay, I'm going to say this right now. There is one place on this map where I think Garatina could have went to. Out of everything that's going on here, there is one cave here that has nothing in it. So let's go and check it out. But of course I'm going to go back. If, if it's a quest, I may as well just go back, right? It's not DLC. What, what do you mean? Turn back cave. Arceus text you. <laughs> it's going to, do you want to know where it is? Let's figure it out. Let me figure it out, okay? So, Yeah. Turn back, uh, he knows. Bro, please. He knows. She says I know, so I'm on to it, right? I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> All right. Weird sound, but okay. Okay, um, sure. Yeah. That's some good recording. That's some good research. Wow, 620? So nice 420 points right there as well for research task complete. Uh, return to village. Let's have a look. God literally has us sent your direct message. Yeah, God sent us text messages, guys. He sent us text messages, uh, satellite navigation, uh, a to-do list. He's also got his own Uber app. Would you believe that as well? Arceus uh, with an Uber app. Draconic. Hey, Draconic. Have you heard? There's been reports that a huge shadow appeared in the Cobalt Coastlands. And then just vanished without a trace. Draconic, my boy, you must tell me. You went to the Temple of Sinnoh with Vol, correct? What exactly happened? You sure he's related to Hop and uh, Leon? I see. In that case, the shadow in the Cobalt Coastlands may be none other than Garatina. The Pokemon said to have once been banished to the reverse side of our world. You know, I'm going to be a little bit dis I'm kind of a little bit disappointed. I was kind of hoping that this game would be the game where Garatina gets banished. That would have been such a good, uh, that would have been such a good story, but oh well. Game Freak uh, must have uh, heard her wish. I do believe this calls for a survey. The Cobalt Coastlands are pretty vast. I hope you have some idea where to look. Oh, don't worry, I do. On the trail of Garatina. Let's see what outbreaks we have. Uh, we have none. Okay, that's fine. That's the Highlands, and um, we've got in uh, on the trail of Giratina. Find out the truth behind the huge shadow. Wait, it's um... all right. I guess we're heading here, right? Cool, Flint. Go into the Galaxy Building. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll, I'll, I'll head back. Actually, I'll head back. Uh, you're so famous that Arceus has... <laughs> slides into the DS. I know. Arceus is um. Arceus is uh, just uh, looking out for us. We can see your screen reflecting uh, on the lizard cam. Can you? Oh, that's kind of cool. You guys know uh, what else you can see? Okay. You guys might see the coffee from this morning. <laughs> uh, what you need, Arceus? There's a cool research task which you need, uh, Arceus. Wait, what? Which you need for Arceus. Uh... 
Okay, there is a cutscene. Okay. Okay. Uh, I get about trying to find this crawfish right, Rick. Firex, I'm waiting for you. I hope you find it, buddy. I've just been told of the foul plan Bolo had concocted. Well, think no more on that scoundrel. Just another tale of passion burning too bright and consuming its bearer. That is what happens if you allow it to. Do you know what would be really cool, guys? And I'm just going to... Do, you know, do you know how cool it would be? I'm just thinking this right now. Do you know how cool it could be if um, if most of us YouTubers got together? So myself, Al, Tommy, um, you know, the whole squad. The whole squad. If we all got together and among one of us, there was one evil YouTuber among us who had a very evil plan to basically ban or just uh, delete the YouTube channels of all of us. I think that could be very, very interesting. <laughs> You guys get what I'm trying to say. I, I guess that could be a very cool thing. It might be a way to like, I don't know. Maybe you guys can help solve the riddle. You guys have to go from channel to channel to figure it out. I don't know. It's just a dumb idea from me, but. Among Us. Like, yeah, exactly. Among Us. Among Us. The YouTuber version. Find out who's sus. Only on channels near you. I think that could be very interesting. But what of you? Are you making progress with your, what do you call your studies of Pokemon? surveying was it it's going all right it's going rather well actually really really well indeed well his suey still holds more fascinating pokemon shall i speak to you of one of them which pokemon would you hear about what 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 are the okay what are these three doing in this game what is tornadoes thunderous and luck What are these three doing in this game? They're Gen 5. They shouldn't exist in the... They shouldn't ex... Okay, sure. Whatever. Whatever. What are, what are they doing here? The Pokemon of Disasters. Tornadoes. Thunderstorms. And Earthquakes. What are they doing here? <sighs> Tornadoes. Tornadoes, in every direction it flies, stirring up tremendous storms as it goes. When the blizzard batters the Alablaster Iceland, Tornadoes may be about. Thunderous? The Thunderous, as it flies around, it fires bolts of lightning every which way. When a rainstorm lashes the Cobalt Coastlands, well, I guess we're going there at last, Thunderous may be about. And Landorus, Sidian Fuelands? Landorus, the Pokemon hailed as the Guardian of the Fields. It seems it can be glimpsed in the Obsidian Fieldlands. Perhaps you'd be so good as to catch it for me. Shall I speak to you of one of them? Which, uh... Nah, I'm done, thanks. Oh, we're all good. There is a Gen 8 Weezing. There's a Gen 8 Weezing um, on the building, but not in this game. That's right, Harvey. Okay, is that so? Hmm. I don't know why these three have chosen to show themselves. Perhaps the cause lies with the space-time rift, or simply with their own whims. I suppose they're stirring up storms and casting bolts of lightning baby trouble you aplenty. But nature has need of such things. If you wish to know more, you'd best study the Pokemon for yourself. When you've completed entries in your Pokedex for Landorus, Tornadus, and Thunderous, come and speak with me. Why are they even here? Incarnate forces of his suit. Yep, yeah, okay, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Garatina can wait. Garatina can wait, guys. I'm gonna go and meet some disaster Pokemon. There's Gen 8 Weezing. He should know. I'm letting him find out for himself. I've, I, yeah, the, the fact that there's eight... Uh, what? The fact that there's the, the Disaster Trio? Sure. Sure. Um, I'm going to fix my team up. They're all flying types. I need to be very careful about um, Landorus. But I'm going to fix up my team a little bit. going to sort out... Yeah, Samurott can come along. Um... Yeah, th all right, Electro, this is your time time to shine, buddy. I know you've got grass typing, but that electric might come in handy. Uh, Cleaver's going to come along. Arcanine's in, and um, you know what? I think um, I think Gudra could be good. Well, yeah, let's go Gudra. Let's go Gudra. That steel typing will definitely help out. Let's go. Uh, well, shiny Alpha Gabite. Hey, got to go. Be back for the Arceus battle. Racer, we'll see you later, buddy. Hopefully, um, hopefully Arceus, yeah, sounds like Arceus is going to be a little while away. Okay, so, actually, you know what, I'm, I'm just going to, Hippowdon, um, 
Bub, bub, bub. Yeah, you know what? Let's actually do it. Let's do it. Let's just do a quick Hipparadon one, guys. Uh, let's just try our luck. It's been a while. We might or might not get a shiny. Just gonna do a random one. So, does someone have a shiny Quillfish? They would be willing to trade for one of my shinies. Uh, that honestly sounds like a legit trade coming from yourself, Pyrex. So, I think there's um, I think if any of you guys, if any of you guys want to uh, trade for that, you're more than welcome to. Let's see if uh, Rhyperia is uh, shiny again, guys. I doubt it. Nope, it's just hanging out though. It's just hanging out and being awesome. In the skies of money. Oh, there's a bank that's just hanging out. Alright, let's just see what, what's happening with the power done. Alright, just a one off, just a one off. No shiny high powered on out of the gates, that's absolutely fine. Powdon should be um what is shiny high powered on? It's like is it green? Is that what it looks like? Is that what shiny high powdon looks like? It looks green. Oh, that one's definitely caught to our presence. Why, uh, why are the rest not spawning in? Alright, now they're spawning. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't think so. Doesn't. Oh, well, there's actually still some more spawning in, which is fine. Oh, that one just took the bullet for that one. Nah, I think we're just going to head on out of here. Right, so let's just do this last one. Because three of them are on the attack now. Oh, god damn it! Right, there we go. It wasn't an outbreak breaker, by the way. Your one wasn't an outbreak, that's awesome. That is actually really cool. That is really, really cool. God damn, this Hippowdon just doesn't want to be caught. These ones are just, um... Okay. Another one's just potting in. That one just refuses to be caught. I'm just wasting all these feather balls. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Feather balls. Feather balls. Wait, that just... That definitely does start to explain quite a lot why these are not catching. So that's kind of cool. Okay, but I don't think they're here. I'm tending to take it to a level 100. Just do it. Just do it. Okay, there's no shiny. No shiny, guys. No shiny there. All right, let's get back on the track. Let's get back on the track of these um, disaster trio. Or genies, whatever you guys want to call them. So, A shiny of it would be perfect in your collection. That would... Oh, uh, in your collect... What the... We got 11, which is kind of cool. 11 of these uh, hippos. I am very, very happy with that. Yeah. And uh, I'm going to like, I've seen why uh, the disaster is true here. Yeah, it's Relit and Oshvar. <laughs> or else it's here. Relit. That's true. That's true. But to be fair, this is a Sinnoh region. Sinnoh region. The professor brought a lot. Well, yeah, I guess. Uh, the fact but it's so weird. It's so weird. The, the fact that those three specifically are here. So, send back to the village. It's weird that those three specifically are here, so. Also, give me a thumbs up. Who's still kicking around, guys? Thumbs up. Who's still here? Magmar, Gumi. All right, that's fine. We don't need to do any of these, but. Not going to do any of these. Heights camp. Um, well, I'm not going to tell you uh, why they're here. I'm assuming it's the space-time distortion anyway, so. Right, now I need to figure out exactly where Landorus resides. This is the place for Landorus. I'm going to assume it's got to be here or here. could also be up here. Let's see. Divide. Uh, the completed Pokedex entries? Oh, God. I need to complete them. Investigate them to bring your Pokedex closer to completion. Okay. That's all it gives me. Uh, 
this part you guys could probably help me with. I'm, ass I'm assuming that they're down there. I'm assuming that it's this way. And it's either going to be on that island. Or those planes over there. Or where the uh, the Rapidash is. So I may as well get these two out of the way still. I call them disasters. Because earthquakes, tornadoes and thunderstorms are disasters. Alright. Uh, if that was uh, the case. No one would uh, live in Unova. <laughs> yeah. Astrodon. Chimchar's hanging out. Wait. That's dumb. That's Landorus. That's Landorus. Okay. Well, that's lucky. Right. Okay. Uh, Landorus. Landorus. Huh. Right by a freaking Infernape. Oh, God. Drifling. Please don't. Not in the mood. Uh, Tornadoes and Thurgers then need specific weather by it. They do? Oh, God. That's, um... Uh, Blizzard, I'm gonna assume for Tornadus, because it's in the Alablaster. And I'm gonna assume we need rain in the coastlands. That kind of does make a bit of sense. We need to get this bloody Inferno out of the way. I don't care if I need to battle it, to be fair. I'm gonna fight it. Because uh, Landris, is, uh, Landris has got shield. Don't forget and uh, throw Pokemon in front of all at it three times, then start the battle. Jesus Christ. Alright, well, there goes Arcan. Honestly, um, Arcan getting knocked out is fine. Arcan getting knocked out is fine. Uh, still spray it and throw it, uh, throw Pokemon in a Feather Ball at it. Uh, well, I guess I'll throw those Feather Balls three times. Well, I need to catch it in a Pokeball. Oh, God. Oh, God. I need to catch these things in Pokeballs. That's going to be so annoying. Right, goodbye, Inferno. I'm not even going to bother catching you. Uh, did you beat up Arceus yet? Not yet, but we're getting there. We are getting there. This thing moves fast. The music playing. Wonder if it likes Norenberry. Hmm. It's a good thing I've got snowballs, right? I guess I'm just gonna save here first. Okay. Don't want you getting in the way, Chimchar. Exactly there now, was it? Okay, how's it going, Landorus? You move incredibly fast. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay. Okay, this is gonna be this is gonna be a fight and a half now, isn't it? Do I just need to creep up on you? Is that what I'm doing? Okay, so I need to equip up. Uh, then the best to a Pokemon asset. You need to hit it with uh, mud or a Pokemon uh, on the front. Gotcha. It looks like it's... Is that a weather? What's going on? Alright, I'm going to throw a Pokeball anyway, so... Really? Really? Okay, I guess I am throwing a Pokemon asset. Okay. This thing just loves to run, though, doesn't it? Come on! Come on! God damn! This is so infuriating right now. Okay, okay. I've got a good shot at it here, though. Got a good shot at right here. Okay. We're fighting. We're fighting. Level 70. Okay, sure. Um, energy bow. Strong style. Okay. Shiny Piplup for Firex. That's good news, buddy. Good news. Alright. Into the yellow is good. Defense stats are down. That's good. 
Sandsteer Storm? That's new. Jesus. Okay, and it was Barnes. Okay, that is uh, officially broken for Landorus now. If that makes it into Gen 9, um, yeah, that is, uh, that's pretty damn strong. That is pretty damn strong, guys. Because it already gets Intimidate, and a chance to burn is pretty damn strong. So, yeah, that, that's pretty strong. Alright, let's catch it. The shiny's gone. No, I can't get it back. Farts, try and get it back. Can you not reload the save? Is that what you can do? It's going to be a bit of a problem, but we'll give it a go. Then you're out taking the damage. That's fine. Shay says the catch rate. Shay, are the catch rates still low? Oh yeah, all the new genies have sick moves. Yeah, and uh, I'm assuming that their catch rate is uh, just bumped back up to high right now. Then you're out just hanging in there. Defensive stats are returned back to normal. Okay, now a Pokeball. Going good. Uh, when I reload the outbreak, I fully disappeared. That's not good. Landris is now growing enraged. Mm, and sends to your storm. Yeah, I think we're going to go for Tornadus next. Because I need to stock up on those snowballs. <laughs> uh, let's go Zorok in there now. Uh, Bleak Wind Storm, Wind Bolt Storm, and whatever Landris is. Yeah, that's uh, just a bloody sand tornado. Trying to think of where it could reside in the snow area. No. Well, actually, I think I've got a good idea where. As for the coast, actually, I think I do know. Well, do I? I don't know. We'll find out. Now, the coast could be on a 9 of Zorox. Just hit the bullet right there. I'm going to have to run, maybe. Gimme. Gudra. You think you'll be okay. Sands to your storm. Got that, uh, it's got that burn chance. Intimidate and a chance to burn with that move. That's pretty damn strong. It's really, really strong. We got the Landorus. Let's go. One down. One down. Landorus is caught. Fantastic. We got the Landorus. Right, let's head on back. One down, two to go. But we've also got Garatina to get as well, so... Oh, we got two Pokemon. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. I need, I need to get some more space in my boxes, guys. Uh, I did not prepare for the weather trio. Disaster trio. The genie trio. Whatever. The flying trio. Did you... Uh, yeah, interesting, guys. Did you guys know that uh, between Landorus, Tornadus, and Thunderous, they all have flying types, uh, just like the birds? The bird trio, Moltres, Zatos, and Articuno. So, um... Yeah, kudos to uh, a lot of uh, flying legendaries. Um, yeah, Lugia is also flying and psychic. Is there more flying legendaries out there than any other? I don't even know. I don't know. Derp. Uh, it looks like they're making Tornadus uh, more of an ice type. That would make sense. Do we have a flying ice type yet? I, I, I don't. It's not an ice type though. But Shinx. How you doing, Shinx? Right. I, need, I do need to get snowballs, just as a precaution, so. Wow, no way. There's a lot. There's a lot. Is there an ice flying type? I think there is, or is there not? I don't know. You guys might be the, the better judges of that. Uh, let's do some shopping. I had a real dent in my Pokeballs, guys. Pick this up. Oh, we need one Ultra Ball, guys. And Fatter Balls. Let's buff this up a little bit. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Uh, get some more smoke bombs. Hit a Pokemon with a one may stun the Pokemon crane. Oh, this actually looks very good. I'm going to grab some of these. 50? Sure. Sticky glob. Sure. Uh, never going to buy any more of that, so that's fine. We have Articuno. That's Ice Fight. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. I should have known. I should have known. Who would win? A Zapdos or Thunderous? Uh, good question, because they are, um, they're both, uh, flying electric. Yeah, flying electric legends. Right, okay, so does the weather need to be, uh, a snowstorm? Or a blizzard? 
okay. Let's say, if you guys say that it needs to be a blizzard, then that's fine. So, we have Articuno that's uh, fine. Delibird is also... De Delibird doesn't count. That's, um... That's a Pokemon in a league of its own, so... Right. Where would I assume that this thing hangs out? So, I'm going to assume it could probably hang out around here, where we encounter Rios in the past. Avalanche Slopes. Here's a good spot. Um, It's not going to be here. It won't be here. Hearts. Let's see if we could also have it. Avalon's Legacy would also be a good place to have it. Bone Chill Wastes. Um, where would you say? That isn't a blizzard. Look at the top left for the weather. <laughs> I never even noticed that. That's awesome. I never even noticed that. <laughs> oh, I've got a funny story for you guys. i got a very funny story for you guys. It's the, the Bone Chill. Bone Chill Wastes? Okay. Okay, now it's, uh, now it's, the bone shell wastes are uh, all the way over here, right? Yeah, all the way over there. Yeah, that kind of makes sense, right? Does it? I don't know. But at least I got the stuff to, uh, to deal with it. Snow runs here. It says snow, but I don't know if it means, like, blizzard, right? The bone shell wastes. It is snowing. There's a shiny glaily, guys. There's a shiny glaily right there. It's not here. There's gonna. There's a lot of glailies hanging out. I not, do not like that at all. Earth, uh, thunderous, and Zapdos. The Imolga would win. Imolga. Yeah, Imolga exists. Hey, got that lost satchel back to Sephiroth. Is it Blizzard in enough? I don't think so. No, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Yo. Alpha uh, Frostless right there. It says Frost, but it doesn't really look like it's got the... Um, look at this. Uh, it doesn't have that... Um, that kind of blizzard-looking symbol. You guys know what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, have a look. What's up? Uh, true, true. True, 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 true. Four and a half hours into the stream. Been going really good so far. It's been going good. Uh, yeah, it doesn't have that kind of blizzard-like symbol. So let's try this again. It's only eight ball. The Blizzard symbol has got the, the Frost symbol, but it's also got some wind in there as well, so we'll see. It's snowy, but, um, hang on. I'm just going to save just in case that I'm being dumb. It is snowy, but it's not like, it, it wasn't exactly a blizzard. We needed a blizzard, and um, I have seen this place in a blizzard, so. It's snowy, not blizzard, yep, and we need a blizzard. And now it's sunny. Until nightfall. Yeah, the weather covered the whole map. And I'm kind of glad about that, to be fair. It's snowy, not a blizzard. Yeah, so that's fine. Parallel! How you doing, Parallel? Welcome. I hope you're having a good day. And uh, please enjoy your stay, buddy. Hope things are going good with you. You're not, Shuckle. You're Shay, Jessica, and uh, Parallel are here. You're all here. You're all awesome. It was snowing, but not a blizzard. Please give us a blizzard. Please give us a blizzard. It's cloudy. Sure. Whatever. Uh, does it need to be uh, like a blizzard, or can it just be windy? I think windy would kind of make sense, right? This sounds blizzard-like. Yep, yeah, there we go. This is what we want. This is the weather that we want, guys. Isaac is back. Welcome back, Isaac. All right. We've got blizzard-like weather now. Sneasel, Alpha Sneasel is still there. All right. Team's healed up. And uh, we're good to go. We're good to go. Just got a couple of extra snowballs just in case. See if we can find this. Could we just catch this without engaging it in battle? Uh, there it is! Uh, it's just by all these bloody glalies. God damn it. Alright, but at least we got it, so that's good. Glalie is such a fun Pokemon, guys. It really is. It really is. 
Oh, go away, go away, go away, go away. Oh, that's gonna be so annoying. Oh, God, it's about like three gl well, potentially three glillies after me. Right, decrease that shield. Right, the shield is gone, that's good. Right, do me a favor and lure me away from these glillies and I'll be more than happy about that, alright? If it takes me away from these glalies, then that's good. That's, it's bloody evident here. Alpha Zuba, where are your eyes? Yeah. <laughs> I've seen that before as well. Oh, that's uh, that's damage. That is damage. I am freezing right now. Everything is here. I need to clear this, all right? I need to clear this. God damn. All right, sure. Let's fight Glalie. And if you have... Alright, Agile Style's fine. If you need a shiny Quillfish, Farrix? Hopefully you get it really soon, buddy. Good, just hanging in there, which is good. Do I, can I attack twice, please? No, I don't get to attack twice. You're the only... Sure. Strong Style on ahead. Okay, I think I can catch this. So that's good. Gudra is down for the count. Let me tell you something. So I found an outbreak, but you forgot to turn off autosave. So I wasted all my materials. So now I have to get them back. You found an outbreak, but you forgot to turn off autosave. That's that's uh, that's rough. That is uh, that is a rough one, buddy. Hopefully you can get your materials back rather quickly. I'm catching this clearly, guys. That is, uh, that Glalie is, uh, money that I'm gonna need. We got it. Alpha Glalie. This was definitely our biggest threat. <laughs> I get candy. That's good. Catch this, because I'm not bothering with you right now. There is no cover at all in dealing with this. There is no cover at all. I'm just gonna creep up to it. Please, 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 please. <laughs> well this works I hope uh oh please 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 well that was uh, that was worked for a little bit didn't it oh my god you found alpha roton but no shiny that's a little bit rough a little bit rough there buddy Can you please, just, please? This is some, this is starting to get into that element of Bomb Center now. Kind of getting there, which is good. Okay. Glalie, get off our tail. Please get off our tail. Please get off our tail. Please, why are you being such a pain? Okay, wait a second. Hang on a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's actually pretty good. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. This is all of a sudden starting to get a bit more easier now. Okay. Kind of know what I'm doing. Kind of know what I'm doing now. Okay. Feather balls are the way to go. I see. I see. Okay. Glalies, please. Please leave me alone, Glalie. Please leave me alone. There we go. Crit shot. Crit shot. 
Don't battle, don't battle. Oh my goodness, you just love to be a big bad boss, don't you? You just love to be a boss. Okay. At least the feather balls are doing the trick. Okay, this I'm gonna be honest, I quite I'm quite enjoying this. This is a really good boss fight. Dodging all the glalies and trying to get to Tornadus. And there's a space-time distortion for me. Cause of course there is! Cause of course there is. Alright, we got that. Oh, I missed your client suffering from against Bolo. And I'm a bit don't worry. I'm a bit to suffer here, and it's uh still staggering. Still staggering. I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run. Just gotta get my health back. I'm just gonna grab my health. Hey, at least it shields down are kind of are permanently down, right? No, I take that back. I take that back. But how you doing anyway, pancakes? Don't worry. Yeah, I did suffer. I did suffer, so you can relax. I did suffer, unfortunately, because it was a bloody eight against six. That was not fun at all. But it's okay, because I'm suffering against the tornadoes right now. I'm trying to capture it in a Pokeball. Damn, the music's kind of cool, though, at least. Please drop those shields. Yeah, it's just... It just wants to be a boss. That's why it keeps his arms crossed. Oh my god, you really are annoying. You really are annoying. So it's three times. Okay, three times. Hey, if there's an opportunity to make the Glalies go away, I'll take it. We got the Tornadoes! Let's go! Let's get out of here! Yes, we got it. We're good. We're good. Out of the way, Glaley. I like how uh, when we got the tornadoes, the blizzard is now gone. What's up, have a look. The blizzard is now gone. All right, we got two. We just need one more. Uh, make, uh, make the right choice. If you break the reveal glass, then Lando T will never be able to dominate competitive things again. Um. Well, here's the here's the thing. You can act. Well, hmm. Now here's the question, pancakes. What do you mean, Lando Therian form? So. This new move that Landers had, it applies burn. That's crazy, right? That's crazy. Uh, so I guess it can only have that move if it's uh, in its uh, other form, right? You can either have, you're going to have the Intimidate or you have the Burn Chance. And it's uh, one, uh, take your choice of what form you want. So you still haven't to admit the special guest. Yeah, you mean uh, Garatina. Yeah, I've dealt with that, so. We got uh, Tornadus. That's good. Okay, so we only just need a Thunderous, Garatina, Arceus, and then we are done. Well, if you break it in the past, then I'll never exist in the future. Uh, That's true. That's true. So the Reveal Glass does exist. Okay, that's fine. So we'll probably get the Reveal Glass from Thing So, Wait, what's your calling doing? I'm, uh, I'm hunting down the Disaster Trio. I refuse to call them genies. I refuse to call them whatever they are. They're the disaster trio to me, all right? Because they bring about disaster. Tornadoes, thunderstorms, earthquakes, you name it. Okay, let's see. Okay, reports. Uh, <sighs> Riolu. All right, you know what? All right, so what do I need for it to be uh, for rainy? So you completed, completely maxed out that uh, disc of eight? Nice one, nice one. Shiny Luxio, that's also good. Wait, what is Draconic doing? I'm doing the I'm doing the, the weather trio right now. Right, so where is uh Thunderous? I'm assuming it's gonna need to be raining, so time to rest. Okay. I could have done Riolo. I could have done it. And Malik is back. Welcome back, Malik. We just need to get one more disaster trio. And we're just waiting for I'm assuming that we we're better waiting for rain, right? We need the rain. We need the rain. I guess for Landris we need it to be uh, to, to be day, uh, which kind of well, mm, just a clear. S Did we? I don't know. I don't know. It makes sense for tornadoes. It makes sense for um, for thunderous. I just wasted a little while. That was nothing. How many legends do we have? Do I have? I've got a lot. I got a lot, buddy. I need to properly reorganize my box. Um, 
I've gotten all the Gen 4 Legends and Mythics, apart from Garatina and Arceus. But we are getting there. We are getting there. There's a special guest Pokemon you'll see soon. Right. Okay. What? Is there going to be... Is there going to be one from another generation? Okay. Okay. What could... Wait. If... Okay. We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. So, I'm assuming... Well, considering these guys are Gen 5. Alright. Let me figure out exactly where this thing could be. Um... Honestly, around, uh, honestly, it wouldn't be, where could it be? Honestly, around here sounds like, where, where would it be? Where, where is, um, hey, Shiny. <laughs> oh, hey, Malik. Uh, where would, um, where would Thunderous be? Where would a Thunderous hang out? Honestly, Thunderous hanging around here. Oh, that's a drift one. I don't want to be involved in that. Uh, Thunderous is not here. That's uh, believable. How do you get to the camp there? Uh, you need to do a quest, uh, Holly. I can't remember what quest it is, but the more quests you do, the more it's a Dusknor. You're not a Thunderous. You are not the Thunderous we're looking for. You're not a shiny Duskull. The lightning, the light, the light, the lightning was uh, playing tricks on me, guys. It's, it's very lightning right now, so it's a Dust Ducks. Side Ducks, Gold Ducks. Uh, Thunderous is at the Seagate. Seagate? What? Is he? Is he? What? Is he all the way over there? Are you serious? Is it going to be a battle in the sea? AKA the Big Horns. The one for, uh, for Manaphy? Really? I guess that, that doesn't make sense. But sure, whatever. I mean, okay. I would never, I would never look there. Because that's where we get Manaphy, so... You're almost ready to put down the game. You only have like 30 minutes, said, uh, 30 more dex entries to get to rank 10. And I've done basically every side quest. That's that's awesome, buddy. Have you enjoyed the game? Have you enjoyed the game? Is the question. I know you've been enjoying it because you won't stop talking about it. Where is it? Because I hear the music. Oh, there you are. And Thunderous. Okay. Just hanging out with the Gyarados as I see. Okay. Uh, oh my god. And that's an Alpha Gyarados as well. I do not want to mess with you. Jeez. You are... Um... How the hell do I even reach this? Okay. It's going to have to be... Full on rage. Oh, Gyarados. Could you just go away? Why does Thunders have to be so annoying? And uh, guys, it's an electrode on a raft. You've now seen it all. Electrode on a raft, everybody. Electrode on a raft. Give it up for electrode on a raft, everybody. It's a ball on a raft. Electrode on a raft, guys. You have enjoyed the game. The game has been fun. The game has been super awesome. I couldn't tell if that was the alpha one or not, but I, I, I gotta get rid of these Gyaradoses. I think that was the alpha Gyarados, because this one's a bit lower level, so. Sam hasn't got the, the Shiny Charm yet. Sam hasn't got the Shiny Charm, but she has. I haven't uh, made an attempt to go for it. <clears throat> I haven't made the, the biggest attempt to go for it, but, you know. Glad I've been doing these outbreaks. Can I just uh, throw it high? definitely gonna miss this guy just loves to imitate sonic he really does sonic on water guys sonic on water they got him okay they got him creeping up to this guy with pokeballs is gonna be super annoying god damn okay sure that doesn't even reach uh okay sure Mind your own business. Oh, cute! Come on! Really? Okay, you're done. You're done. You're done. Yeah, that's right. Just stay stunned. 
Okay, you do get some really good time to do this, so that's fine. Why are you here, Gyarados? Why are you seriously here? Okay, uh, I gotta deal with this, Gyarados. God damn, the Gyarados are annoying, so no chance yet. Once I get it, I'll probably just finish all the side quests. Maybe hunt a few Pokemon, then put the game down until home. Yeah, this game's been really fun, and the outbreaks have been crazy, you probably guess so. You're grinding with Rose Raid right now. Good luck with that one. Good luck with that one. Alright. Now, let's get back to our adventures with uh, Thun. Oh my God. I don't want to use the uh, the wing balls. I really don't. This. How do you even approach this? How do you... Do you just have to approach it from behind? Because right now it's just been a bit of a pain in doing that, so... Alright, there we go. We got shields hurt, which is good. Just, please... Just, if it was on land, it would have been... Oh, wait, hang on a minute. I've got smoke bombs. What am I doing? I can approach with bloody smoke bombs. Oh, goodness. Smoke bombs are going to have to be the way to go. And whose crazy idea was to catch this thing in a Pokeball? Oh, yeah. It was mine, guys. It was mine. Um, smoke bombs. This thing moves. Good. You didn't move. Okay. Good. 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 Far away, because of course you did. Because of course you did, because you're a bloody hacker. <laughs> you're a breeding bloody hacker, thunderous guys. That okay, okay, that did it. That did it. Come on, come on, come on. We got thunderous. Yes, yes. I'm not prepared to do that anymore. Smoke bombs, uh, or the jumper and catch on that Pokemon. Yeah. Uh, or the jumper and catch of that Pokemon. Well, the smoke bombs did it. The smoke bombs sure did it. Drifloon, you're not ruining this moment for me, buddy. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Let's report them back. GG's. We got the three. We got the full disaster trio. Okay. Technically, I could go for Garatina right now, but I'll come back here. I'll come back. Okay, we're all done. Okay, you, uh, you, one way to meet. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Okay. One way to meet in the guest. One way to meet in the guest. Oh, okay. Now you get level 10 research on them all and you get a surprise. What? So I need to get level... I need to get level 10 research on them. Alright, sure. Uh, what's the best way of doing that? What's the best way to do that? Just send them out into battle? I better go back and get most of the legends. Are you guys serious? I need to get them to level 10 research. You aren't joking, right? I, I need to get them to level 10 research. Okay, wrong place, wrong place. <sighs> oh, still need to get dark right. Oh no, wait, dark. Yeah, I uh, yeah, I need to get dark right. No spars. Right. Okay. Right. Where did I put dark right? Where is dark right? Where did I put dark right? Right. If you guys see dark right, just let me know. But I think I lost dark right. Uh, how did I lose Darkrai? I've got Darkrai. So, where is it? Did I put it in the wrong box? Um, where did I put Darkrai? <laughs> where, where is it? Where, where's where's Darkrai? I'm, I'm kind of worried. Darkrai is gone. Darkrai is gone. I do not know where Darkrai is. Are you serious? I don't have Darkrai? Where is it?
How did Darkrai just disappear like that? It's got to be much more further up, right? It's got to be much more further up, right? It's got to be... It's right, it's got, it's got to be after this bit. It's definitely after that bit. Those are Mothums, that's Glalies. Right, I'm 100% certain it's after this part. There it is, there it is. We got it, we got it, we got it. <laughs> Darkrai is uh, being quite an annoying shadow figure, so... Uh, how does anyone have uh, Alpha Zora? Angel! Does anyone have Alpha Zora? I can't see that I do, so use the search function. Uh, it's really easy to get these levels of 10. It's pretty much just use a strong agile of their signature moves. Gotcha. Oh, well, they've already got that anyway, so we'll put Dark Rite up with the rest of the group. So that's fine. We'll just put these three into the party then. Wait, wrong one. I guess I guess it's a good way to do a level ten research anyway, so this is kind of cool. Right, put them there. Let's bring out um. Let's bring these three out because they're easily the highest levels we got. So just max their research to level ten by using their signature moves. Gotcha. Okay, simple enough. Should be simple enough. Uh, let's go thunderous on this drift limb. Sounds like a plan. Sir, use the search function. The search function? Wild Bolt Storm. Okay. Well, that's really cool. <laughs> Messed the last one. What's up? You missing. Uh, I'm back. My phone died. No! You're back, but that's good. Jessica said something. You missed, missed it? Missed what? What did we miss? Level 10 research on all of them. Okay. So we'll do that uh, two times, two more times. It might leave it with a paralysis. Wow. So this is this is to get rid of. Well, I guess prankster thunderous that kind of still exists. So with the, with this kind of form. Check the research pages first. Oh, okay, I'm with you. I'm with you. So Pokedex. Okay, so let's see. So thunderous. Number caught one. Time just use seen it use extra. Oh, extra sensory, and agile. Extra sensory and agile. Okay, that's fine. Extra sensory and agile. That is no problem at all for thunderous. Did you play Arcus, Justin? Not yet, but we're getting closer and closer. We need just need to do. Oh, did it, did it see Agile Style? I, I'm so sorry, guys. Agile Style. <laughs> Needed to be Agile Style. I should have done Agile against a, a Pokemon like Drifling, so... It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. Uh, oh, let's uh, fight a Chat Talk, guys. Chat Talk should be fine. Keeping its guard up. Oh, my God. Please. Please. Not like this. Oh, there's a Star Raptor, which is good. I hope it's good. Okay, thank goodness. Extra sensory. Let's go. Haven't fought Arcus, but we're getting closer. We are really close. I need to get level 10 research on these. Uh, fight Garatina. And then that's it. No, well, someone, someone tells me that there's a special guest from another generation or whatever it is. I don't know yet, but we're going to see. Right, that's fine. That's all that research done. Strong and agile. That's fine. Tornadus? Extra sen I guess they all need extra sensory. Well, I'm going to research that. It's kind of cool. Strong style and agile style. Strong uh, strong and agile. Extra sensory. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, we'll send Tornadus into Star Raptor. Strong style, extra sensory. This is fine. I don't think the clinic knows how to effectively get level 10 research. No, because I don't bother doing it, Shay. I don't bother doing it too well, because I just uh, leave it to... Um, that's what I've been... I've been relying on the outbreaks to do that, so... The outbreaks are the, is the method I've been using, so... Oh my god, these chattels love running away. Have you found any of the unknown? I found most of the... Un oh, I still need to get the bloody unknown. Uh, we'll do the unknown another time. Wait, Beautifly is... Oh, it's Bug and Fly, I'm sure. It's Bug and Fly. 
Okay, so... That was strong style, so this is agile style. This may also leave the target with frostbite. Interesting. I guess that kind of makes sense. Frostbite is a very interesting condition. All right, there we go. That's uh, that's that one. Have you started shiny hunting? I have. I have. I've been doing some shiny hunting. And I haven't really been taking it too seriously, but I will. Um, I mean, I will soon. I will soon. Uh, I guess we can see it use extra sensory and wild ball again. I guess that wouldn't be too bad. All right, let's get Landorus in there now. We need Landorus in there. That'll be good. Oh, sure. Let's go. And, you know what? I, I don't even trust these Togepies. These Togepies probably end up running away. And there's so much Star Arabia's around. He has. Uh, I have started doing it. I've started doing it. And it's been really good. Been really good and uh, really awesome. We've got in almost all the Hisuian forms, which is good. And uh, we're not too far away from uh, completing it all. Oh, come on. Oh, well, this is okay. This is okay. Heh. <laughs> Mud bomb's got no effect. <laughs> okay, Landris' uh, new strongest attack is uh, missed. Leaves the target with a burn. That's interesting. Good to know. And Apom is out of here. Is that enough for level 10 research, Shay? Or do I need to go ahead and have another run at it? Let's see. Let's see what the professor says. You gotta be kid. Alright, okay. But at least these two are nearly done, right? Bleak Wind Storm and um, Wild Bolt Storm. Okay, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. At least I'm not fighting the uh, the ground at uh, flying type, so that's fine. So Thunderous just uses its strongest, uh, new strongest move once, and Tornadus just uses it twice. That's fine. That is no problem. There is no Pokemon when. The Why did I get off basket? All right. All right, Mountain, you're uh, a water and flying type. Uh, you'll be perfect. And then we're done. Then Tornadus will pop up. Uh, yeah, so Thunderous is now officially done. Tornadus. Tornadus we can get in there. Use its uh, strongest attack twice. And we're good. As it's been taking our time, guys. I don't understand why they needed to be max research, but sure, okay. Uh, can me and you do a shiny race? I want to organize, like, not really a shiny race, but, um, may well, maybe, yeah, a shiny race to an extent. Who can get the, um, who can get the most shinies in a certain amount of time, which could be kind of cool. I don't know if I need this Burmy or not, so I'm going to go ahead and catch it. I can't remember. I'm going to fight the Star Raptor. Uh... I, there, there's Burmese for a quest, and I can't remember if I've got uh, the right ones or not, so I'm just going to catch it just in case. Um, yeah, sure, let's fight the Staraptor. should be okay. Oh, my God. It's, it's just the tiny details are annoying me now. I kind of want to keep on going, so. Last message from Shane. Uh, once your connect fixes this problem where uh, BC people uh, literally be heard on stream, I'd be down to Shiny Race. That would be awesome. That would be fantastic. Windstorm. Uh, yeah. Who do you want to do it? I think we could probably get more than one, right? I feel like we could probably get multiple people to do it. And the way that we can confirm whether uh, we have a winners or losers, or sorry, winners or cheaters, is um, we can confirm the shinies by date, correct? We may or may not have time. I'm down for doing some... Um, I'm going to be doing some uh, shiny um, hunting later on. Of course, the, the legends are nearly done, and we're getting closer and closer, so. Okay. Hey, they're done. They're level 10. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, return to the village. Righto, let's go. Let's go. 
You want to do... We can be... If we've got the time, we can do it. But this game just keeps on spamming legends in our direction. Hence the game Legends Arceus. Legends Arceus, guys. Ah, oh, pseudo widow. Uh, nah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Okay, what? Who? All right. Gen 5. I'm just trying to think Gen 5 right now. Are we going to get... Are we going to get the Swords of Justice next? And is it a chance to get Keldeo? Am I even going to the right place? I don't even know. Okay. Uh, I don't even know if I went to the right... Oh, I think I know where I need to go. I went to the wrong place. I think Shiny Races should be restricted to streamers as there will be proof of uh, no stream. Well, to be fair, we could have uh, both a YouTuber exclusive one and we can have a viewers and YouTubers one as well. So that could be cool. How you get uh, Heatran if the Mud Balls uh, doesn't uh, spawn again? You need to buy some more <laughs> buy some more uh, Mud Balls, I guess. Just like uh, me right now, I've kind of ran out of Mud Balls. And I've just started using um, uh, Feather Balls, so... Ancient Retreat. All right, are you just going to give us the, the mirror? You've arrived. Yes, I have. I have arrived. Hey, Racer. How's it going, buddy? Any other tips for Shiny Clinton? Um, the Outbreaks are the best one. Hands down, the Outbreaks are the best one. Uh, my suggestion is um, try to understand the Pokemon that you're battling. Some of them will run away. Some of them will battle you. Um, some of them well not even react you just need to figure out what you're fighting and then just plan from there use grass for cover uh wing balls are the best pokeball for it but they're quite expensive as i'm starting to slowly find out so so let's see I'm grinding for the volo battle uh, i've done the volo battle i did the volo battle he brought eight against six and i'm not very happy about that eight versus six you now know much about Landorus, Tornadus, and even Thunderous. Well done. I'm more In more normal times, I would bid you let those three fly free as is their nature. But we are yet fresh from the tearing of the space-time rift until its after-effects fade entirely. Perhaps it's better to keep our trio contained. Seems like a plan. And now it is time to tell you the rest. Okay, so... Swords of Justice, Flying Birds, um, Groudon, Kyogre, Rayquaza, hopefully. That would be fantastic. There is one more of that cohort. Wait, are we getting a new... What? 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 What the hell is that? What is that? Um, okay. Okay, a new, all right, you guys are saying genie. Uh, I'm still, I have no idea what this is. Um, I see Valentine's Day has come early for this one, considering the hearts. Is this a fairy or a psychic type? What's with that snake? God damn. It's like a love legend, I think. A what? You came back. Chomp is back. All right. This is Enamorus, a Pokemon hailed as the Herald of Spring. Enamorous hmm? is not particularly given to ill behavior, but I imagine you'd like to document her for your Pokedex, wouldn't you? Catch her, and if you like, she always flits about in the Crimson Marlins. What? What? Okay. You think it's fairy fighting? Fairy fighting may be a bit weird. It's, it's definitely flying, right? Has to be flying. It's probably psychic. 
It looks very psychic like. But it I think it's more psychic. Flying and psychic. God, we've had another flying psychic? Sure. I think theory and something else. Flying and theory? You think it's a enamorous. Enamorous. I'm gonna I guess we'll figure out if it's if it's psychic, I think I can like its design. If it's fairy, uh, I guess we'll find out. Enamorous is not particularly given to ill behavior, but I imagine you like to document her. Yeah, already read that bit. Crimson Mar I guess we better stock up. We better stock up. All right, a new, f a new Pokemon to fight. This game gave us a new legend. Wow. Okay, I'm down. I'm down. Fairy flying or psychic flying. It's got to be one of those two. It's just based on its design, right? In the... Marlins? So is there any specific weather that we need for this? Or, uh, or I don't know. Have you fought Volo? I have fought Volo, Ed Shop. He was... Um, he was uh, unfair. Just very, very unfair. Eight against six. Beat him the first time. Call forth Garantina. And, um, yeah, at that point, he was just, just, he just started cheating. Beat him the second time. Um, he, including the Garatina, he then cheated again and called forth Garatina's new form. That was just not fair at all. Alright, I gotta put the weather, tri the disaster trio back in. Disaster trio, weather trio, whatever you want to call them. Honestly, I'd rather sit on the weather trio. But now what are we gonna call this? The fantastic, <laughs> the fantastic four, guys, fantastic four. We now have the Fantastic Four now. God, I'm going to need to make space for these guys. The Fantastic Four Legendaries. I think it works. What about you guys? The Fantastic Four. <laughs> that Garantina was uh, absolutely. Here's your cash. Hey, the theory form is uh, not that bad. The animal in real life looks cute. Let's have a... Oh, yeah. That's right. It's going to have a new form as well. So that'll be interesting. All right. Here they are. So... I think this team's fine. I think this team's fine. Uh, I will need supplies. <laughs> Let's do some shopping. Uh, a platypus? That Garatina was... Uh, Kesha, what's the animal? I'll tell you now that, it, uh, that it's their form is disgusting. Is it? Alright, I guess we'll find out. Let's uh, make sure we got enough... Uh, you know, we actually got plenty. I need more of these. A lot more of these. Okay, and... Um, Still good for the future. God. Okay. Uh, so where is it? Where would it go to? So it looks very psychic or fairy-like. If I was to take a guess, it would hang out up here, right? That would be my guess. I'm going to leave so I can at least to get close to finishing the main story. No problem at all, buddy. No problem at all. So it's got to be up here. Or... Um... It is foggy. Is fog going to be a part of it? I mean, there's the road raid, sure. Shane, you want to tell me where it is? Uh, it looks like a flash. That's the special guest. That's the special guest. I don't know if I like it yet. I don't know if I like it. I think I'll need to um, find it and uh, find out. One shot road raid. <laughs> Finally, I one shot the road raid. Nice. You caught Heatran. Good job, buddy. Good job. Good job. The best, best way to catch it, just throw mud at it. Decrease its shield and then throw a Pokeball behind it. Behind it, behind it, behind it. That's very important. Really brand spank new Pokemon that isn't a regional variant or evo. Yeah. Indeedy. We've had new forms. We've had new regional variants. And now we get a new region. Well, is it a regional? I don't know to call it regional. Um, it's definitely a new Pokemon, that's for sure. So You got Typhlosion, which is good. Right. Right, Breveri, search from the skies. Where could this thing be? Do you want to know where it is? I would love to know where it is. Holly got the Typhlosion, and that's fantastic. Uh, do you know how to get the other two starters? Uh, yes. When you complete uh, the story, not the post game, but the story, when the credits rolled, speak with the professor, and he will give you the uh, the other two. So, hmm, how'd you get it? I don't know how to. Oh, because you know, right. So it's not up there. Can it be? I'm looking out for uh, a kind of whirlwind, but nothing seems to be coming to sight. Down here, maybe?
Hmm. Uh, I think they got seven new Pokemon in this game. Um, eleven. The new Assyrian forms. Eleven. Fourteen. And if you want to include the origin forms, then sixteen at least. There might be one or two that I'm forgetting, but sixteen. Brand new sixteen. Nineteen. If you want to include the uh, the new starters, fully evolved forms as well. So. Uh, Scarlet Bogs, I think. Scarlet Bogs. Oh, right here. Okay. I was way off track. I didn't expect it would be there, so. Scarlet Bog, huh? Okay. I did not expect it to actually be there. Okay, that's fine. I guess it's wide open space. Hey, what's up, Onyx? Wide open space. Let's see if we can find it from the sky. Let's see if we can find this. I guess this area does make sense now. It does kind of make sense. A lot, well, it does make sense a little bit more than Ursula just trying to navigate the way through the stop. Yeah, there it is. There it is. All right. Uh, it's hanging out with an alpha skunk tank. <laughs> this is quite a good sight. What was this Pokemon's name again? Yeah, I'll figure out when I catch it. Skunk tank seems to be interested though. Someone got a minigun on this Breviary. That would be fantastic. Alright. And find a good place to land. You know, this isn't the best place, but this will do it. Sure, whatever. Don't mind us. How did we... Ugh, never mind. Okay, I guess we're throwing the... Um... Yeah, we didn't exactly go too far, did we? So... In a freaking swamp. Where's Shrek when you need him? Shrek is never around when you need him. This thing is... Okay, this thing is easily aware of our presence. A lot more so. Oh my god. I'm gonna murder the skunk tank. At least I had it. Gonna murder everything in the swamp, guys. Okay, so there's a head. What is this type? I'm interested to know. Very interested to know. I need to catch this in a Pokeball as well. Alright, there's another nice little hit there, which is good. What are you doing in my swamp? Where's Shrek when you need it? Oh, at least the, the mist is cleared up. That, I, honestly, I'm really glad the mist is cleared up. The mist is giving us more problems. So, okay. Now we can hide. Behind the rocks. Behind Dwayne. Hiding behind Dwayne, guys. Hiding behind Dwayne. If this is a psychic type, it can sense us coming, guys. Oh, turn around. If I catch this thing, I figure out that it gets a new type. The love type. I um, I think I'm quitting this franchise altogether. So I better not have that. looking right at us. Please just turn around, alright? Please just turn around. Has he got his eye on us? I can't tell. Hmm. Okay. Also, don't spoil the typing. Don't spoil the typing. Oh, no. Alright, hang on. I'm a ninja. Alright. Alright, is that it? Okay, shields are down. Pokeball, come on. Right in the back! Oh, come on. Don't do this to us. Alright, okay, that's fine. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Krogunk, no. Krogunk, no. Okay. Okay, that time didn't go well for us. Yes, I'm trying to capture it in a Pokeball, guys, for your information. This Pokeball has to be the way to go. Okay. <laughs> Just threw out the bloody stunk. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, love type. The love type. Yeah, if it is, like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm quitting the franchise altogether. It better not be. It's all the way over there. Can I just... Let's make it all 
basically there. That was a fail of a Pokeball throw there, wasn't it? Perfect. Got the range. One more hit, and that's fine for us. Read last Harvey. Uh, love type, bro. Uh, read last comment. Uh, Shannon Rose, no rudeness, rudes, no taunting. It's uh, ballers. Uh, this might be pinned. This is already pinned, yep. Yeah. It's already pinned, buddy. But yeah, thanks for the kind words as always, buddy. As always. Every time I get close to it, it just knows and runs away. Okay, that's it. Run up, run up, run up, run up. Okay, get into position. Oh, we got it! Enemers. Enamorous. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Fairy and... F okay, it's a toga kiss. It's a toga kiss. You know, I think I'm okay with this. I think I'm okay with this. We got it. We got it. If it's love type. Well, okay. Thankfully, it's not a love type. I think if they were going to introduce a love type, they would have done it at the very beginning. Uh, okay. In a Morris. That's good. Okay. Well, let's um, let's escape before I die. Okay. And uh, do I need to max research this? I hope not. I do hope not. Although I'm quite interested in what his signature move is. I guess I'll figure that out in just a second. Let's uh let's get out of here. Uh nah Morris. <laughs> Among us. <laughs> let's have a look. Do you know what it is? I also think it's a female as well. Because all of the other uh, the other trio are all male. So this kind of does make sense a little bit. Uh I like the words uh Enamore because it spreads the love. Oh god. Enamore. Anymore. Yep, and it is a female, as expected. Okay. Okay. Spring Tide Storm. That's the name of its move. Spring Tide Storm. Okay, okay. She is female. Yes, that makes sense, because all the disaster trio is um is male. And now it's the Fantastic Four, guys. We now have Fantastic Four, so let's go. All right, now we can finally get um, now we can finally get uh, Silverus and then Galactus. <laughs> hey, that works! Silverus and then into Galactus. We got the Fantastic Four guys, and uh, oh, that Yan Mega is nice. Yan Mega is real nice. Change form. Uh, I will do that if I'm getting the if I'm getting Revealing Glass here. Then yeah, I'm definitely gonna do that, and we'll find out what it looks like. Inamoris is not particularly given to ill behavior, but I imagine you'd like to document her for your Pokedex, wouldn't you? Catch her then if you like. She... I already got her! Oh, hang on. Do I need to... I'm going to the wrong place. Do I need to rank 10 again? Oh... Okay, sure, whatever. Okay, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Sure, sure. sure. Fantastic Four. You look tired. It's, uh, I'm getting there, Godless. I'm getting there. I'm still going to keep on going, though. I'm not finished, but I'm really glad. Hey, Gliscor's there. <laughs> this is this is funny. How's it going, uh, Tornadus? How's it going, Tornadus? Just sleeping away, I see. This, uh, this is not... That's not right. Tornadus stuck behind the fence is just not right. It just doesn't look right at all. Okay, maybe put it in the party. I'm going to put it in the party. So I, get, I was going to put it in the party anyway, so this actually works out. Okay. Well, let's uh, put it back up. God, I need to find space for everything. Um, There's no space for Garatina. God, there's, there's, there's just no space at all. No space left at all. I can make space. Okay, we're fine. Last message from Shane. Uh, let's see. You have to get it to level 10 for that reveal glass. I see. Technically, I can just get Garatina and that's it, right? I can just get Garatina and go and see Arceus because I do have them all, right? 
Uh, sure. Let's go and uh, use it to uh, beat up Bidoofs. Sure, because why the hell not? Uh, actually, guys, <laughs> I'm not going to beat up Bidoofs. Uh, I'm going to be right back, all right? I'm going to be right back. It's going to take a little bit of uh, time away from the screen. And then when I come back, we'll get that level 10 research. We'll do Garatina. And then we'll do Arceus. Providing that there's no more surprises, okay? Uh, I do not know what else we're going to get, so. Anyway, I'll just be back in about uh, two minutes. Shouldn't be too long, guys. Okay, everybody, that's me back and good, back and good to continue. Okay, so where were we? Uh, have I missed anything, guys? Godless is not dead, and that is good news. Good news. Uh, the chat, the chats cannot be dead. The chats cannot be dead. Uh, I'm not saying uh, dead chat because uh, not talking. So nobody was talking. You guys were waiting for me. Hey, guys, gotta remember, all right? We're a super strong community, all right? This whole channel is. Um, it's not just about me. It's about you guys, and it's a little bit to maybe you guys trying to hang out with each other, maybe make some new friends amongst yourselves as well, so don't always assume that the channel and streaming is all about me, because it's about you guys, so spend the time to get to know each other, all right? I don't care if you have uh, an argument about whichever is best between Palkia and Dialga, or if you like this new, um, uh, whatever this new, um, whatever Anomorous is. So, I'm going to leave it entirely up to yourselves, guys. So, uh, Mari, hello. Welcome back, Mari. Uh, Jack, what do you think a numerous uh, Therian form will look like? I think it's going to look something very similar to the snake that's here. It's going to have a very... I think it's going to have a serpent-like design to it. So, I'm kind of interested to see what it will look like. Oh, yeah, I didn't notice that. But, um, yeah, all of the... Um, 
all of the forms have um all of the forms have their kind of uh, tails so i'm assuming that she's gonna have a serpentine look to it so we'll see extra sensory uh extra sensory and we'll do uh spring type three type that's fine that's fine agile and strong perfect that's a good chance to find a shiny um stantler guys hey stantlers you want to be some training partners <laughs> yeah me too uh, Drac, what do you think it enamors it? Yeah, I, I read that one already. Like I said, I think it's going to have a serpent-like design to it, but we'll see, of course. Oh, yeah, I didn't even check what condition this attack does. I guess we'll have a look, because Stantler's not surviving that. Hmm. Let's see what that attack does. Yeah, we're actually getting some research on Stantler, which is good, so it'll be good for later. What should I spend my £80 uh, prize on for on your Yu-Gi-Oh! tournament? Ran away, really? Um, it depends on what you want to spend it on, buddy. Depends on what you would uh, want to spend it on. Oh my god, these Stantlers just love to run! Come on, please fight. Please fight, or I'm going to have to go for somebody else. That's it. I I've had enough of these Stantlers. I'm just going to go and fight something else. None of them want to fight. Hell, none of them will even want to be shiny, so... Shinx! You're always up for a nice little battle, Shinx. So let's fight. Okay. I mean, Landris is a lion, Tornadus is a bird, and um, Thunderous is an enemy character. Oh, please don't tell me. Please don't tell me. I still need to look up the... Con I, I keep forgetting to look at the condition of this move. It's... Does it cause... A is it attraction? Is that what it is? Attraction is a condition that I've not seen yet in this game. Yes, it is a condition. Maybe confusion? Confusion also is a possibility. The move's additional effects depend on the user's form. What? That doesn't tell me... That doesn't tell us anything. Agile extra sensory stuff. So it makes sense that Anamorous is a snake. It does, it does. It would make sense for it to be a snake, but I'm basing that just based off of the detail, which does have that kind of snake-like uh, look to it, so. But I might be wrong, I might be wrong. It's very serpent-like, which kind of tells me that, so. All right, so let's go. Sherry outbreak? Is there? Good one, Shay. I've got to admit, the sound effect is kind of cool for that. It's kind of cool. We've done everything that we need to do for this. Um, we can see it use a strong and agile one more time. I just want to... Um, I just want to make sure that I'm safe. That's it. That's it. Can you find my Magmarizer at Summit Camp? Harvey, I can try. What about you guys? Can you guys help find uh, Harvey's um, Magmarizer? What's your in-game name, Harvey, in the game? If it's, um, some, at Summit Camp. Oh, at the Summit Camp. Oh, I know what you're talking about. It's not popping up. Daniel? Merv? It's not popping up, buddy. What do I still need to do? Oh, Agile. That's fine. Okay, Agile and then we're done. Harv that pro okay. <laughs> uh, don't, don't go around saying stuff like that, buddy. Oh, no, wait. Hang on. That is your name. That is your name. That is your name. I don't want uh, any of the mods to uh, look at that and think, oh, that's another bot that we need to uh, get rid of. So I guess that kind of does... Yeah. You, you, you can see where I'm, where I'm going from with that, so... Ah, you're fine anyway. Um... I actually haven't seen one like that, so it's uh, close to Deer Track Heights in uh, User is a G Hell. Marvin's Bre Brexon? Brexon lost their set? I got. Hey, look, I gotta recover Brexon's, alright? I'm gonna quickly recover Brexon's. Brexon will. Um, Brexon will appreciate that. I know Brexon will appreciate that.
Right, Brixton. Um, we're gonna find Marvin's as well. Merv's. I don't know who Merv is. Um, who's 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 Merv? Who is Merv in the chat, guys? I would quite like to get a good idea. If uh, if any of you guys are Merv, of course, just let me know. Okay. It's around here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Perfect. Okay, I will head back. We'll head back. That was just quick. Quick. So, oh wow, you have chosens. Nice. Does it depend on the friends we quit? Uh, friends list? I don't know. I don't know. Hey, Max Research for Geodude and Enamorous. 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 Still getting used to that name. <laughs> Still getting used to that game. Uh, that name, guys. Uh, you have uh, chosen, which is good. No spoilers. Yeah, no spoilers, guys. Is there a free shiny giveaway here? Orlando. Hello and welcome. There is potential ones. Oh, Gumi, nice. There is potential free giveaways, but I'm not at that stage yet. I've got lots of shinies, and um, if I ever get a repeat shiny, then I will be giving it away live on stream. So, but at the moment, I'm doing all the legends. So I want to get this out of the way. But in future, yeah, we'll see. Team Char Outbreak, that's good. Good stuff. Aha, uh -huh, you've caught Enamorous as well, and you know much about her. Enamorous arrives in the suite once winter has passed. Hence the epithet Herald of Spring. Her company, when I have the pleasure, is of great help. She ferries me hither and yon across his suite. But I'll leave her in your care for now, I suppose. <coughs> for now? Indeed. Even you can hardly expect to live for all time. Surely. But she will be in your care for now. Here. This is the reveal glass. If you use it on Enamorous and her brethren, they will assume different forms. All right. All right. New form, guys. A looking glass that reveals the truth. It's a mysterious mirror that returns certain Pokemon to their true shape. You, Enamorous, and her brethren have something in common. You all tend to stir the pot of life. Do not mistake me. I mean this positively. If everything were straightforward, what meaning would there be in living as long as we do? Once there was a god of field, and once there was a god of spring. Upon the Sui's winds it wheeled, brought life to every grown thing. Was that how that old verse went? I have passed on to you all there is to pass. Where history goes from here, I leave to you, and your companions to see through. Alright. So is that all of them? Alright, let's see this form. The reveal glass. Use it on Enamorous. Alright, am I going to like this or am I going to hate this? Let's see Therian Enamorous. Okay. Okay. Um, hmm. It's got a really big nose, guys. Let's not judge it by its nose. Uh, but it's, it's got a heart on its nose. So, okay. Gotta remember, it's a fairy type. A heart on its big nose. Right. Let's see what it looks like. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me think. Let me think. Alright, I take it back. I take it back. Now it makes sense. Now it makes sense. Okay. I like the snake. I think the snake on the top is the... Probably one of the cutest things ever. Uh, okay, but it, it's got flippers. It's a snake on a frog. It's a snake on a frog. Or a turtle. Or a turtle. A snake on a turtle. Because the cloud kind of has like that shell type of design to it. Which is kind of cool. Um, I think... I think I like it. I think I like it. It's the turtle. I, I like it. I like it. I think, yeah, the turtle, it does it. It does it. I like it. I like it. It's good. I think I prefer this to the um, incarnate form. Is that the name of it? It's not a turtle. Hey, look, Harvey, 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 Harvey. To me, it looks like a turtle. <laughs> if it's not a turtle, then what is it, guys? Well, a turtle is... I mean, the, what's the... I mean, like, listen... It can either look like this and look like a turtle, or it can be like 
Froki. It can be a late care Froki. They have Froki's evolution line in follow the frog path, so take your pick. Turtle or frog? Turtle or frog? Imposter Shay. Imposter Shay, it's been a it's a turtle. We have two Shays. We have Shay TRD and we have Shay. I'm gonna have to start dressing Shay as a TRD now, so. Here is your cash. Andrew Clint, let's see all their Therian forms together. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's bring it back. Let's see all the Therian forms and then we're going after Garatina. Garatina is up next. And then providing that there's no more surprises, is there any more? I don't know. I don't know. Alright, give me a second. Let's go ahead and see all their forms, guys. And what world is that a frog? What do you mean in what world is that a frog? Right, let's get them all out. Okay. Okay, so there we go. We're good, we're good. I'm going to do one thing first before I do any of that. Um, it's a big man time. Uh, let me just do something real quick, all right? Okay, let's bring them all out. Let's bring them all out in their incarnate forms. Landorus. Thunderous. Tornadus. And now. Enamorous. <laughs> all right, we got them all. We got them all. We've got them all. Hmm. They all look good. They all look good, guys. They all look really, really good. All right. Let's bring them all back. And let's put the Therian forms on all of them. Landorus. Thunderous. Tornadus? What? What do you mean now's not the time for that? Is Tornadus not back in the ball yet? Alright, let's um, head out then. Okay, now it's back in. Okay, now we can use it. Okay, there we go. There's iPhone and Manaphy. iPhone and Manaphy. Because that was helpful and uh, did stuff in chat. Okay, let's see what they've got. So once again, let's call forth them one last time. Landorus, Thunderous, Tornadus, and Enamorous. They're all here, guys. They're all here. All varying forms of the Disaster Trio. Well, I can't exactly call them a Disaster Trio anymore. I, um... The Quads. I don't know. What, what do we call them now? Because they're no longer the Trio. It's now a Quads, right? So... So what do we call them? What do we call them? You know what I'm very interested in? I'm actually very interested in something, guys. Give me a second. No, I'm actually not going to look it up. I'm not going to look it up just now. Uh, not just now. Okay. 241 seen, 240 caught. There's only one more that I need to find, guys. Only one more. And then we're done. Who's still here, guys? Whoever's still here, go ahead and... Uh, oops. That's a mistake. Whoever's still here, guys, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. That was a big mistake right there. Who's still here? Give me the thumbs up and uh, just let me know, of course. The Weather Squad. The Weather Squad. Yeah. Guys, we're going to start calling them the, the Power Rangers at some point. If we get one more, they are definitely the Power Rangers. Okay. Godless remained, redeemed a channel shout out. Oh! A channel shout out for Godless. This is a new one, guys. This is a new one, alright? This is, um. This is a channel. This is a, a shout out for Godless. So, let me go ahead and do that right now. So, Godless, this is the first time that you're getting this. So, of course, um. Forgive me if I uh, do not know the, the best way to approach this, but Godless, let's go ahead and get you up. So guys, I'm going to go ahead and do this right now. 
So Godless is um, likes to do a bunch of uh, live streaming. They desert. They do some Apex Legends. They also do some Yu-Gi-Oh uh, live streaming as well. So if any of you guys are into that, they also do Among Us very recently, about a couple of weeks ago, but they still do Among Us as well, which is absolutely awesome. So guys, I think it would mean a lot, especially for that redemption right there. If you guys go ahead and click this link, right click, open new tab or whatever it is. If you click this link, you'll be able to uh, see my fellow buddy Godless and their YouTube channel. And if you hit that subscribe button for them, that would really help them out. But like I said, they do Apex Legends, some Yu-Gi-Oh! So if you guys are interested in any of that, then you are more than welcome to go ahead and check them out. So, how much did that redeem for, Godless? How much did I set that for? Give me a second. Items. Uh, channel shoutout was uh, that much. Okay. Um, that's absolutely fine. Uh, I might actually make that a bit more cheaper, so... I haven't redeemed it on my side just yet, Godless, but uh, I'll, um, I'll I'll adjust that on my side. Um, but yeah, that's all there is to really say about that one. So guys, like I said, if you want to check out Godless and their content, uh, there's the link right there for you guys. Mm -mm. Okay. Now we're moving on to Garatina. Now we need to move on to... Oops, that was a mistake. Now we need to move on to uh, Garatina. So Garatina... Absolutely destroyed us uh, last time. So let's make sure that we're good and prepared for this one. So Electro can come along. I think Electro come along is going to be good. Are you hunted for Spiritomb or Garatina? We're doing Garatina. We've already got Spiritomb. Spiritomb is good. I just realized this... Um, Enamorous' speed is really low. It's really low. Wow. That's really, really low. Hang on, hang on. Yeah, even with the nature uh, being decreased, that's still really low. That's really, really low. That's actually really interesting. That is rather interesting, guys. It's rather interesting that the speed on that is 93 speed. And then when you compare the other uh, the other trio, they're up as high as uh, 173 is the lowest. So I don't know. Enamorous could be. Um, it's very bulky, very very bulky. Some really good uh, offensive stats. I'm getting a trick room vibe from this. It's all, its defensive stats are really strong as well. So I don't know why. I don't know why, but maybe some trick room shenanigans you could pull off with this. Does Enamorous get prankster as an ability? That's. Um, that's gonna be that's gonna be a decision for another day, I think. That's gonna be interesting to find out. So, very very interesting. Anyway, uh, after uh, after Tina, it's uh, is it Arceus. Yes, Harvey. Arceus is coming up. Arceus will be coming up after uh, Gary Tina, providing that there's no more surprises. So, just need to wait and see, I guess. We'll bring Overquill. Overquill's got a dark type to it, so that's fine. Yep, this is fine. We can uh, make this work. Okay, and uh, and away we go. Let's uh, let's go and pay Garatina a visit. I think I know exactly where it's uh, going to be residing. So let's go. Let's go. Okay, who's ready for Garatina? And uh, who thinks I'm going to get absolutely destroyed by it? It's already destroyed me once before because it had to cheat, but this time we don't have Volo kicking around to provide any cheating shenanigans. It's going to be a fair fight. A fair, fair fight. So let's see what happens. Okay, destroy. You think I'm going to get destroyed? Honestly, it wouldn't surprise me. Now, my, my team is good, but we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Stantler, hanging about. Okay. I pray and I hope that this goes really well. It's got, I need to remember, it's got two forms. Two forms. Oops. Okay, Basque Legion all the way. Leap into the cave. <laughs> Leap into the cave, Basque Legion. I probably should have uh, saved before going in here, but... 
All right, let's see what we're dealing with. Okay. Sup, Garatina? How you doing, buddy? Now we can save, which is good. Okay. Um, Pokeballs at the ready. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're stocked. Okay. Looks kind of cool, to be honest. Okay, just cue the music. Oh, we're battling it. Okay. Yes, we're battling it. Level 70, that's fine. Good thing I saved. Music's good. Music's good. Good as always. Crunch. Okay, if Arcanine survives, we can get one. Never mind. Oh, Arcanine did survive, so... Yeah, no, it's dead. <sighs> okay, but we got it down to yellow, which is good. That was a crunch. kind of don't want to bring this in. Uh, we could try and paralyze it with electrodes. That sounds like a good place to go. So Garatina, let's um Yeah, let's Agile Style Spark. We can get a couple of these on board. If we get the paralysis, that would be fantastic. Not a lot of damage. We could probably go for a stronger one, so. Strong style spark. Might put it into the red. That's what we, that would be perfect. Not quite there yet. Probably would have been better with a stronger move. Shadow Force? Electro dodge the attack, yeah, beauty. All right. We'll just a regular spark this time. It's in the red, that's fine. We can just start throwing Pokeballs. No paralysis. The luck wasn't on our side. Electro is hanging on in there, fantastic. All right, maybe just start throwing the Pokeballs. Of course we don't get it in the first go. No, 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 no. Don't want to fight. Don't want to fight. I could probably do one more spark. Oops. This is a serious battle. Running is not an option. I'm going to go agile spark. I'm going to try that paralysis one more time. I think it'll be okay. Paralysis? No paralysis. That's fine. Electro is knocked out, so... If anything, we got his HP down a little bit further. Fine. Right, thumbs up. Who's enjoying the fight? Who's still kicking around? Just give me a thumbs up and let me know who's still kicking around here, guys. Uh, Raquel, Draconic, have you gotten the genie trio? Yes, I have. I have, Raquel. We've done the trio, we got the new one, and it's just down to Giratina. Which we can't seem to get right now, so we're trying. Yeah, another shot at that, which is fantastic. Good stuff. Okay, Racer with the E still kicking around, which is good. Strong style. Earth power. Okay. Okay. We'll bring in... Oh, man. We've got, I've got good options. I think Goodwill might have been the better option, but this is fine. Thumbs up from Justin. Good stuff. Uh, true form and Amorous made me laugh at just <laughs> for solid 10 minutes. Did it? I thought Amorous was, um, I think Amorous is uh, kind of cool, to be honest. Zorok's just hanging in there. Garatina is no longer obscured. That's fine. Garatina is not giving in to the power of the Pokeball. This time? All right. All right. Dragon Claw's gonna do it. I need to think here. This thing's got focus blind. Oh, let's just send this. Just give me a second. Uh, Sam, you're up. Sure. Sam, you're up. Highest level. So happy. 
Shiny real tone finally. Hey, that's awesome. That is fantastic. Enjoy your shiny real tone, Jessica. <laughs> it's a turtle. It's a turtle. It looks awesome. Maybe use dark right to put it to sleep. It's not the worst idea. It's not the worst idea, but I mean, go against my rule of using legends. Ah. <sighs> Then again, Volo had to cheat uh, using Garatina twice. But we're fine. We don't need to cheat. Agile style's fine. Is it fine? Dragon Pulse, that's... Okay, yeah, that's worrying now. We're still in this. I did save before this. This is fine, so... Darkrai putting this thing would be a good idea. Uh, but Garatina just refuses to be caught. Can we just appreciate the battle style and how cool it is? So. Gudra is now in. We are in the end game now. It's all up to Gudra in these Pokeballs. Not using a Great Ball, not using an Ultra Ball, not using anything else. Because a Pokeball is the way to go, guys. Pokeball is the best Pokeball. Good job, Gudra. Get that experience. We got Giratina. You found something shiny where Giratina was. The Grecious Core. Okay. When used in Giratina, this large glowing gem wells with power and allows the Pokemon to change form. Fantastic. All right. We got Giratina, guys. We're all done. We are all done. Let's have a look at our Pokedex. Caught 241. Seen 241. It looks like we got the seal of approval from all of the areas. So now there's only one last thing to do. Only one more thing to do, guys. Do you guys know what that is? Of course you all know what that is. Not Professor. Paul eventually returned and told me more about what happened at the Temple of Seno. He said that Garatina... That it chose to protect the land of Asui after discovering it was no match for you. He said that we should study it and add it to the Pokedex. He wandered off after that, saying that this was probably the last time we would meet. But I can't help feel but but I can't help but feel he's far more invested in our completion of the Pokedex than he would have us know. On the trail of Garatina, it is complete. It's time. It's time. Yep, we caught one more. Garatina has now been added. Garatina was only worth 980 poke. Sure, whatever, whatever. We got alphas, which were more expensive than that. Garatina loses its legs upon changing it to this form. I believe this Pokemon must hail from a world where the heavens and the earth are as one, though I have no way of proving it. Interesting. We've seen it use a lot of stuff, and that was enough to get rank 10. <laughs> Alright. I completed Pokedex at last. Though, in a way, you could almost call this a Draconic Dex. Hey, Welcome back, Shay. The Draconic Dex is complete. And, of course, you had your directive, didn't you? I recall the message you received when you first fell down to this land. Seek out all Pokemon, was it not? It seems you've finally achieved that goal. So where must you go now? Mount Coronet, the Temple of Sinnoh. You'll find nowhere else in all of Isui closer to the heavens. You're practically among the stars up there, as if one with the very universe, all creation. What will happen there, I wonder? My scientific curiosity is positively roiling. But, well, this isn't my tale of adventure. It's yours. This is for you and you alone to go and find out. Okay. It's Garatina. We got Garatina. It's all done. We each have our separate duties. Yours is to go to the Temple of Sinnoh and mine is to give this Pokedex a jolly thorough read through. Alright. Turn to the village. Let's go. It's time. It's time. To meet Arceus. I'm, um, I'm kind of looking forward to this, guys. I'm not lying. I can't find the words. I just can't find the words, guys. 
This is going to be so awesome. I'm looking forward to this. I really think this is going to be so cool. Everything we've worked towards, I just hope the hype lives up. Just hope the hype lives up. Right, let's make my team. Let's build up the team, guys. Uh, just going to get a... I'm just putting everything in here. Just put everything. Honestly, I think this is the team. I think this is it. Yeah, we're rolling with that. We're rolling with that. <laughs> Let's go. Get Volo close. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. We're, we're going to... Well, I guess we could probably get Volo close. But at the same time, we're sticking with this for now. We're sticking with this style. If that Electivire was shiny, uh, that would have been the greatest thing ever. So, We have 162 Pokeballs. We've not even went below the 100 limit in getting these shinies, which is fine. And they stock up. But even then, we didn't even come close to going as low as 100. So that's absolutely fine. Okay. Who's ready? Who's ready for this? I know I am. I can't find the words, guys. I can't find the words at all. I'm just really looking forward to this. Huh. Alright, here we go. This is it. Time for Arceus. I don't know if this is the fight that you guys were t uh, telling me about, which was going to be the hardest, or if it was, um, or if it was going to be for Volo. But whatever happens, um, let's go and create the, let's go and make, meet the creator. Let's go and meet God. Let's play the flute. Yeah, you caught Origin Palkia, wait, end of game, and I see credits. Oh, that's good, Harvey. That's good. It's not the end of the game, as you probably already know, Harvey, so. But good luck with your post game. That shun is just giving me goosebumps right now. Oh my Arceus, a glowing stairway appeared. So this is just like Diamond Pearl Platinum, right? This is just like how you were get the event Arceus. That's such a good tune. That's such a good feeling right there. Oh, this is this is gonna be a fight. Okay. This is gonna be a fight. Arceus, you here? Just to clarify, this is shiny locks, right? We can't get shiny Arceus. Good. <laughs> Just realized, so the power on the floor is like in the shape of a triangle, so... Just gonna spawn right behind us. That is creepy and awesome. Arceus. There are no words. There are no words. All right, let's go and battle God. <laughs> it's the Illum it's not the Illuminati. Get that out of here, Shay. It's time to fight God himself. We battled space. We battled time. We, we battled reality itself. Home. Okay. Out. Okay. 
Okay, this is already... <laughs> Jesus! Ow, god damn it! Arcanine, go! Okay. Oh god, I pressed the wrong button. God damn, this is gonna be it. I knew I was gonna get knocked on the forest girl. I knew it. Didn't even knock down a quarter of its HP. Okay. I'm dead. <sighs> okay. Well, this is something. This is harder than Palkia. It already is. It already is. Yes, we're going to restart the battle. You know, there's there is a couple of items I could probably grab before this fight, but I kind of don't want to do that. Oh, boy. Here we go. So how many of you guys uh, have uh, beaten Arceus? Mysterious bomb. I am missing them all. I am just missing every shot. It's a long process, but I think just doing it a little bit slow is the best way to go, right? Ow, come on. Looks so majestic as well in that. Oh god, how did I miss that? That's good. Okay, now it's gone red. Uh oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Where have you gone? Where have you gone? Where have you gone? Come on! Really? Okay, that sucks. I'm gonna die again. I'm going to die again. Can't even send anything else out, can I? God damn it, I can't send anything out. Alright, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage that we were good to see. Excuse me? What? Okay, I have no idea what to do here. I have no idea what to do here. I don't know what any of this is. Oh my goodness. Am I just dead at that? What did I do it by? Oh wait, I'm still alive. Oh my goodness. I'm not even half its health. God damn. How do I use the origin? <laughs> wish I knew, wish I knew, wish I knew. Excuse me, but I dodged that. Jesus. <sighs> oh wait, it says continue battle. What does continue? I never did continue battle. What does continue battle do? That just continue the battle. Makes sense. A fifteen-year-old beating a and catching the most powerful Pokemon. Yep, definitely Malik. Definitely. This is definitely quite the challenge, anyway. So. I think I've got a good rhythm going.
How? I just press the button, it just doesn't go. All right. Okay, that's a down, that's a down, that's a down, right? Okay, now where's it going? Oh, it's all the way over there, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, now where are you going? Okay. Right, where have you gone? Where have you gone? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Wrong one. God damn it. A little bit annoying, but okay. All right, now we battle it. Sweet. Okay, now we're battling it. Okay, I can finally take a break. Here's your chance. Arceus Calm Mind. Calm Mind. Okay. Continue battle allows you to continue where you last. Uh, where you last were on the, the lifeline. Like a checkpoint, I see. I think I can beat Arceus um, from start to end. I truly do. So, I can't, I need to just knock out his HP, that's why I can do that. First you have to beat uh, Erida and uh, Adamant, yep. Yeah. Uh, Water? Wait, it's... Oh... And... <laughs> oh, God. Okay, okay. It's got all the plates, and it can change its type. That, all right, this is this is proper boss fight territory now. All right, so if it's a water type, electrodes. So this is good to send in Pokemon that I've got in type advantage then. All right, Thunderbolt, strong style. Let's go. Get that one a shot. Paralysis would be fantastic, but I doubt that's going to happen. And now it changes to fire? Okay, and we can bring a water type any later. Judgment, fire, electrodes, gone. Okay, okay. Arc is like, uh, so you've chosen death. Yep. We've chosen death, guys. We have uh, indeed chosen death. I am now a little bit worried about sending Sanyurot in, because that's my best. I think I want to send in... I'm going to send in Gudra. Gudra can get some damage in there. Gudra can... Come on, Hydro Pump hit. It missed! It missed when I really needed it. It missed when I really needed it the most. And it's going to change the ground type. Judgment. It just uses judgment over and over again. That just one hit kills everything. Stats are back to normal at least. Alright, can I just send it? So ground. Yeah, sure. Samurai. Samurai's just gonna have to do it. Samurai's in. Like, Samurai just Aqua Tail and knock it out, alright? No defense. Aqua Tail. And there we go. We got it. Okay, Arceus Light Scar died, now is my chance.
Oh, I thought that was the last one. Oops. Oh, I've thrown it away. What am I doing? I'm throwing it away. Guys, I really have to run away. That was a mess and a half. Okay. Oh goodness, I'm getting greedy, I'm getting greedy. Oh wait, I did beat it! Yes! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! I beat it! Oh, I got so greedy at the end. It paid off. Yes, we did it. No checkpoints from start to end. We beat Arceus. Good game, Arceus. Good game, Malik. Arceus likes so you've chosen death. No, we've chosen victory. We chose victory. We went from start to end. Whew. Okay, that is uh that was a tough fight. That was a tough boss fight. Let's go. Thou has done well to seek out all Pokemon. Unflagging devotion to a goal shalt see it through. So hast thou proven by fine actions. Much as that ancient hero once did, he and the Pokemon that walked beside him. To see such truths proven anew, beyond the bounds of time and space, bringeth joy to me. I am glad that I chose thee to call to this world. If thou walkest onward upon thine own path. Upon thee and upon this creation wilt thou now dwellest. I bestow my blessing. And I bestow upon thee a part of myself. And I would walk this world together with thee. Show me how it approacheth in thy eyes. <sighs> we received the legend plate from Arceus. Legends Arceus. Let's go. Arceus speak like ancient English people. Well, we are playing in English. Oh my goodness. A stone tablet imbued with the essence of all creation. When used on a certain Pokemon, it allows that Pokemon to gain the power of every type there is. What? So this is used to give Arceus to any type. The Defied. The deified Pokemon is now complete. We did it. We did it. Full Pokedex. We got Arceus. And that's it. The OP plate. How OP could it be? But it was all a dream. <laughs> or was it? Hmm. Legend plate is still broken. Use the legend plate. Well, we got Arceus. Times you've seen. All right, we've seen Electro use a strong style. That's that's fantastic. All missions complete. There's nothing else for us to do. Well, let's use that plate. The uh, legend plate is still broken. Use the legend plate. How broken could it be? The legend plate. Well, we can't use it on anybody right now. When used on a certain Pokemon, it allows that Pokemon to gain the power. All right, well, let's head on back. Yes, you may find the research. Most eliminated. We got Arceus. Research level perfect? What? Oh, received a part of Arceus. Research level's perfect, guys. Hey. 
God. All right, and we're only halfway there uh, for level 10 completion as well, so. Well, we've seen three of its forms. It is the heavenly fount form which pours the light that shines across the sea. Its luminance guides and protects all Pokemon. Hisuian mythology states that Arceus is the creator of all things. Well, Arceus is the creator of all things. Uh, Legend play is still broken. Uh, it makes it so Arceus is always good against its opponent. Well, that's good. You got to head off, Racer. Pleasure as always, buddy. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time, all right? Doesn't even give us max research. And back to the village we go. Legend plate still broken. Ah, yes, the OP plate. Arceus, speak like ancient. Yep. <laughs> Let's go and check out Arceus, guys. Let's go and check him out. Be funny if Arceus was just hanging out in the behind the fence right there. I think we gotta get the other ones out as well, right? I think it would be really cool. We got Garatina and Arceus. Let's bring them over. After a long time, legal catchable Arceus. Legal catchable Arceus. What did we catch this in? Just a regular Pokeball. Okay, that actually um solves a lot of problems. Wait, pasture 32? Oh sweet. Sweet. So it's a guaranteed capture. Guaranteed capture. Lead pasture 32 is uh now unlocked, guys. Alright, let's bring them over. Let's bring all of them over. Let's bring all of them over. Oops, there we go. That's them all. Okay. Get some space for this one, I think. Palkia. Dialga. Garatina. And now, at last, Arceus. They're all here! All four of them. The creation trio, along with the creator itself. It's truly all over. It's truly all over, guys. Use that saw. We'll bring Arceus back and we'll use it. You guys see it's uh, compatible with Arceus. Use this, and let's see how OP it is. Wait, what did it do? Arceus transformed? Arceus transformed into what? Uh, how did Arceus transform? Oh wait, hang on a minute, I think I know what this is. Wait, do I know what this is? How did Arceus transform? Okay, I'm confused. What does this do to Arceus? It's still normal? Am I forgetting something, guys? What does that plate do? Because it's still a normal type, right? Oh, so I need to check judgment. The user releases countless shots of light at the target. Oh, I, I now know what that attack was. He got a different type. It's still normal. It's just normal. Unless... Unless... Now is not the time for that. Okay. I'm, I'm confused. I'm really uh, confused right now. Oh, because it's out. Okay, give me a second. So, Arceus now turns into Dragon. So, now it gets the Dragon type. Arceus is a Dragon now. That's awesome. It activates during battle. Have you got the <laughs> redeem done? Not yet, goddess. Not not quite yet. And Derek, welcome, welcome. So he's got a different type. I guess. Um... But that doesn't make any sense because there's this plate, the legend plate. But if he becomes normal, what's the point on the blank plate then? I'm confused. I am really confused by that. So what's the difference? Only if you uh, use it in a battle with the legend plate. Okay. Recover, extrasensory, judgment, and high fear. I guess it does something to judgment, right? Well, let's send it out into battle and see. It would be funny if Arceus had changed form, changes to shiny Arceus. That would be... 
That would be super awesome. Okay. Let's uh, let's bring Arceus along with us then. And there's an outbreak. Oh, oh, let's go. A basculine outbreak. Oh, Arceus, thank you. We have a bar basculine outbreak so we can um, get them shiny, which is good. Let's um, save here just so that we're good and ready to do this basculine outbreak whenever we need to do it. So that's fantastic. So Arceus, battle against um let's not do a battle against the ghost type all right let's find someone else okay i know exactly where to go we're gonna go up here anyway so we've been targeted never mind okay go battle eridet and adamant with arceus with arceus is there um is there something different that happens in that battle or um uh she uh just read last i just explained it Dread Battle, when Arceus uses Judgment, it would change to the best possible type against... Oh! Factoring in weaknesses and resistances? Really? So, up against Magmar? Oops, give me a second. So, let's send Arceus in against uh, Magmar here. Yeah, Arceus against Magmar. Okay, so fight... So, Judgment. Oh, I see. So, it changes to Rock. And it uses the Rock play on... Oh, my goodness. So, Arceus remains... Wait, it's a, it's, it's a Rock type now. So, Arceus is now a Rock type, right? Oh, my goodness. That is broken and awesome. This should never ex all right listen this should never exist in VGC Oh my god it's going to change the grass now Changes to grass And then oh that is quad damage against graveler That is so strong That is super super strong I haven't got the card yet godless so it's not available yet but that is super strong. So it already had the the Legends play in our battle, which actually does make kind of sense, to be honest. So, you know, I'm just thinking. Um, every Pokemon in the game has got a weakness, depending on it, because it doesn't matter now anymore, because I would be very interested if you could use Judgment on, um, on Spiritomb before Fairy-types existed. That would have been rather interesting, though, wouldn't it? So is where they're at that would be rather rather interesting though wouldn't it be so <laughs> rip graveler rip the graveler it's um it uh, just uh, couldn't compete with arceus guys it just couldn't compete i hope we get back to the first goal because that would be super awesome now nah, it doesn't look like we're gonna get it that is super op that is super broken All right. Uh, yeah, it changed to grass because grass and water have evolved four times. That's correct. It's, they are. But grass has a resistance to one of Graveler's, uh, Graveler's types. Grass has a resistance to one of Graveler's types, so Arceus becomes the best possible type for every opponent. Where do you find Volo when you uh, caught all legends? Um, I don't know. Apparently, Volo has now uh, disappeared from the game, so that's um, rather interesting. I see now why he, um, I see now why we were his number one customer then, so. And that, my friends, is Legends Arceus. That is Legends Arceus. Huh, just broke a rock. Can we just some specific sense out? There we go. Why are they not being sent out? That doesn't make any kind of sense, does it? There we go. They're all out. They're all out. <sighs> Over here, Arceus.
Isn't this not just perfect, guys? Isn't this just not perfect? Volo's at Mount Coronet. Yeah, Volo's uh, last appearance is at Mount uh, Coronet. So. Mount Coronet right at the very top, so. Yeah, that's, well. Now I need to find out what the future is for this game. Alright, guys. What time are we at just now? It is half past seven. I can't believe this whole post-game shenanigans took us over six hours. That was, that's incredible. That is a fantastic post-game. That was really enjoyable. That was absolutely fantastic. That was, that was probably everything I could have hoped for, uh, which was brilliant. We also got Shaman, Darkrai, Heatran, Cresselia, Disaster Trio, and another, a fourth one now, which is fantastic. Um... Dialga Palkia. Still need to get the the uh, the orb for um for Palkia's form. Garatina's hanging out with us, which is awesome. This game's been fantastic. This game has been phenomenal. This game has been amazing. So I don't know how I don't know. Part of me thinks that it could end right here, right now. That would be the perfect ending to the um to the stream. But where do we go from here, guys? So, what do you guys think about the uh, the le uh, the future of Legends Arceus? Because we've got nothing else to do apart from apart from Outbreak Shiny Hunting. Would you guys? Oh, great! A space time just Dialga, Palkia. Are you guys forming time space distortions again, or was it you, Garatina? I'm sure it was Garatina. Uh, what would you guys like? Would you guys like uh, streams where we do shiny hunting outbreaks every Tuesday afternoon, evening? Could be good. Get the shiny charm. Callum, we are working on the shiny charm. You're right. But shiny charm is a kind of work in progress, which I probably will do over time. So so I can do that. Got no problem with that. But we're talking about the in general. What would you guys like to see? So very good game, but not game of the year good. You think so? Well, there's still a lot of games ahead of us, Godless, so... You can still fight again the uh, three Thief girls. Uh, they are hiding in different zones. So, yeah, but their story is over and done with. If they had any more story, then they would have done it. So, what about the battle with uh, Adam? At least it's very cool. I did the battle with uh, Adam, and we got the one for Dialga. There's still the one for um, uh, Erida, and she has the one for um, for Palkia. So we could end up doing that. So, you'd watch Shiny Hunting. What about the rest of you guys? Would you guys like some shiny hunting uh, outbreaks? Don't worry, multiplayer games are starting to are going to be coming back. Multiplayer games are going to be coming back, but shiny hunting would be very cool. I would really like to do some shiny hunting and try and see if we can get some new shinies, and then when we get some home support available, sword and shield transfer everything we get from Legends Arceus into uh, sword and shield, and then. Maybe in the future, um, the Hisuian forms you can transfer all of them into Gen 9 when that's available. So, just some options, of course. Just some options. Um, half past seven right now. Just trying to think about... What, do you, what would you guys prefer me to do? Uh, I don't have any plans to live stream tomorrow, but I have a lot of stuff that I'm going to be doing, so... I will not be live streaming tomorrow, but I will be back in action on Monday, which is good. Erida is at uh, uh, Lulligan's Trial, and Adamant is behind a lake entrance. Uh, yeah, we've already done Adamant, uh, Rishikesh. But uh, yeah, makes sense that we go ahead and do um, uh, Erida. Makes sense. I can do Erida next time. I can always, uh, unless you guys would prefer to do it right now. What would you guys like? It means that we lose out on the Baskill and Shiny Hunt, so I'm gonna <laughs> gonna go ahead and let you guys decide, of course. So, shall we Shiny Hunt for Baskillin right now? Keep on going, or um, or would you guys uh, prefer a good end to this live stream, and then we'll be good and good, ready to go by Monday? So, because uh, apart from apart from Shiny Baskillin, trying to get that, I don't know what else we could do right now. So, and any other shinies that decide to pop up, so. All to yourselves. Callum says Shine Hunt. I'm up for that. Uh, I think the moment the stream starts to get a little bit more quiet, uh, the more inclined I am to maybe um, wrap it up. But um, 
But it's no problem. It's no problem at all, guys. I also need to get Arceus for my second profile. <laughs> I, mean, I need to... Uh, oh, that's that's going to be a little bit annoying. But we'll see. It's a pain to catch. They're uh, so fast. Malik, I, I know the best process on how to um, on how to get Basculin. So it's no problem, buddy. Uh, we keep on going. Keep on going. Guys, it's spoiler free now. You can go ahead and spoil as much as you want now. We are outside of the spoiler territory. We beat the game. We've done everything that we need to do. Apart from the unknown. Yeah, unknown. We should probably do the unknowns at some point, but there's nothing really. No, we don't need to do that just now, so. We'll do unknowns at some kind of uh, random time. But in the meantime, we're going to keep on going. Unknowns. That would be a really. Can you get unknown outbreaks? Actually, I'm so sure. Can you get unknown outbreaks? So, spoiler, everybody dies. Well, everybody was about to die twice. Uh, the first time with uh, Dialga or Palkia, depending on who you decide. And then um, and then with Volo, with uh, Giratina. Well, I'm kind of tired now. So, yeah, yeah. Imagine if you redeemed a Yu Gi Oh! battle in a Pokemon stream. No, that would not happen. I would uh, not allow that to happen, Godless. I'm sorry to say, but um, I'll tell you what, Godless. Uh, when my stream ends, uh, send a message and we'll have a game or two. And we'll see what you got as a, as a teaser for what's going to come up tomorrow. So, yeah, tomorrow I'm doing Master Duel Game Night. But I'm not streaming it. I'll be doing it on Discord. So, if you find it unknown, you can find a Ruins, Shiny Unknowns and Alpha Unknowns. Al Alpha Unknowns? I think I'll do the um, oh, Golbat. I would really like to go get Golbat. I think I'm going to do the unknowns uh, at a certain time. So, No, there's one of each, I think. One of each. That would be crazy if there was like 26 separate outbreaks for unknowns. Uh, no, thank you. No, thank you. Today or tomorrow? Uh, tomorrow is game night, uh, godless. It's tomorrow's game night. But uh, we could probably duel once or twice tonight. It depends on how I'm feeling and um, how late the stream's going to go. But we'll see. We'll see what happens, of course. Okay. I just can't believe this game is done. And uh, it's been absolutely fantastic. I have absolutely enjoyed it. It has been one of my favorite games to pop up. So, oh, That's an alpha one. That is uh, that's a little bit annoying. It shouldn't be a big problem, though. Just waiting for the um, the shiny symbol to pop up and uh, just confirm that we got it. So we just need to wait and see what happens, of course. We get that shiny symbol. We are good. So I think we get one more wave of Basculins because there's an alpha there. Uh, no shiny. No shiny in that run. Well, Basculins are a very easy one because they run away. Uh, this is not going to be a long one. <laughs> uh, I shouldn't technically be here. Ah, oh, you're fine. You're fine. Unknown outbreak be like uh, A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Yeah, is shiny hunting unknowns in this game good? Does it give you the letters that you want rather than uh, just getting one at random? Never had a shiny unknown, and uh, not exactly looking forward to hunting them if it needs to be one of every letter. So. I bet you there's only so few people out there that have every unknown shiny. And, um, you know, I would quite like to be on that collection. I would quite like to be one of those few people. So, you like how now we got uh, uh, Arceus, uh, the title, uh, nine streams cap. We got Arceus, the title, uh, nine. Wait, Harvey, what's going on there? What's going on? I I'm, I'm lost in what you're saying there. Oh, Gashadon's a kind of good one. Is there an unknown outbreak though, I wonder? I haven't seen one, but then again, I haven't completed all the unknowns anyway, so. I might do the unknowns in my spare time. I think that could be a very fun uh, time. And then once I've done all the unknowns, uh, apart from one, apart from one, uh, maybe um, share that with you guys. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. How many Arceus live streams do we have? I know we've got six, seven, eight, nine. Do we have ten Arceus live streams? 10 Arceus, uh, Legends Arceus live streams. That's like a whole series, guys. You could probably skip out the um, all the midway shiny hunting, but um, but we've got we've got like seven live streams of story. Seven, 
Yeah, seven live streams where it's all based on the story, which is absolutely brilliant, so. Seven live streams based on the story. That's crazy. Then three bonus ones where it's uh, Shiny Hunting and Pokedex Completion. Well, I guess the Pokedex Completion is like, um... Pokedex Completion is like, um... <laughs> it's like uh, a feller arc or something like that. It's like a feller series. You find a guard of war right, Rick? Nice. Now you can remove the pinned comment. That's true. That's true. Sorry, Holly. Uh, unpinned message. God damn. There's a lot to talk about. I would love to play this game again on my second profile. My second Switch. I'm probably not going to be in a rush to play it again on uh, my second Switch. I'm just going to let the hype die down a bit. I don't even know if I'll be playing it again this year. So I need to think about that. Uh, for me, four days of story. Four days of story. It's been a whole week of story for me. A whole week. It's been crazy. It's been crazy, guys. Uh, return to village. Oh, God. Someone's reaching 200 days, and that's incredible. That is absolutely incredible. All right. Oh, sp Yeah, I've already got Spiel, but oh god, I got I gotta do a Spiel one one day. I'll do a Spiel one one day. Uh, light goal fifty. Let's try and get to that fifty light goal, guys. We are twenty, just under twenty away. Uh, four days light goal. Pin that goal. <laughs> All right, let's pin that one, uh, Harvey. I'll give you that one. Let's try and get to fifty likes. That would be good. I have to admit, I'm starting to get a very light headache. Um. I think it's just because of uh, the amount of streaming that I've done for this game, so. But it'll be very good to just um, do nothing. I don't even want to touch Legends Arceus tomorrow. Um, and then I'm going to try and see if I can force myself not to play it on Monday. And then we'll get back to it on Tuesday, so. I think that's my plan. I think tomorrow, uh, this morning I've been doing a few things. Tomorrow, I'm going to be doing some more things. Uh, we'll have our game night, and then Monday... Monday might be Minecraft. I haven't decided yet. I don't know how many of you guys are still playing this. I need to find out, all right? I need to find out. Maybe an egg lock? I think I would welcome a Nuzlocke. If we can make a Nuzlocke work with this game, uh, that would be great. Good. I would absolutely welcome it. Uh, we need to find a way of making that work because it's impossible to fully complete this game. By capturing only one Pokemon per route. So that's um, that's a rule that might need to be looked into. So maybe one Pokemon of that specific um, type in general. So so I don't know. It's going to be tough to figure out a way to do a Nuzlocke. So. But if there is a way to do it, I would welcome it. I think it would be good. Like the one life shenanigans definitely um, should still exist. That would really rack up the difficulty because... God damn. Yeah, nothing there. Nothing there. I'm not even gonna. Uh, game night, uh, not UK friendly. <laughs> what do you mean, not UK friendly? You can't find Volo on the mount where uh, Dialga and Palkia were. Um, Depends on the quest, Malik. Have a look at your uh, your quest and let me know where it says. Locally or worldwide, but you need but you need internet locally or worldwide. Uh, for what, Jessica? You can trade. Uh, worldwide. Worldwide. If you want to trade, you do it uh, worldwide. Locally is if you're uh, standing right beside uh, someone else who wants to trade. Whereas worldwide is um, people over the world. But of course, you need to put in the code if you want to do that. I think Nintendo is um, starting to um, look at a positive note with people that, um, that live stream. <laughs> you know, I really hope that in Generation 9, they introduce um, spectating. I think spectating um, over uh, over the internet would be one of the best things. They have to do it. They have to do it considering the pandemic that we went through. So, you forgot about Reggie Gigas? Never mind. Yeah, there is Reggie Gigas. Reggie Gigas is awesome. Okay. Okay. So save this. Reggie Gigas. I'm a little bit disappointed, but maybe I'm not too disappointed. The other three Reggies didn't make their way into this game. Regice, Rock, and Steel. However, it was um, kind of a nice little touch on what they did about it. 
by having the plates needed to open the door you needed to have heat tran of all things you needed heat tran to open the door that was um that was interesting that was rather interesting actually okay mass outbreak those basculins are not shiny what about the next batch I swear, we've done this hunt one too many times. And we've abandoned this hunt uh, a good few times as well. Uh, I'm not stopping this Basculin hunt until we guarantee get this. Because it's... Um, we've got it locked in. So, yeah, this is uh, this is the next hunt. I'm not doing anything else in the game until we've done Basculin. So, it's, uh, it's uh, night for us. Uh, it's uh, 4 a.m. It's 4 a.m. for you right now. Wow. It's um, 10 minutes to 8 p.m right now so there is a uh, no routes in this game there's no routes there's no routes what i meant was um there's no routes but there's areas you get different types of uh, areas um but you couldn't make that work you couldn't make that work and uh oh i mean that's just an idea it's just an interesting idea but you could probably only use pokemon from outbreaks uh i don't even know if that would work or not um or you, as soon as you go towards, uh, I don't know, I don't know. It's rather interesting, but here's an idea that could work. Um, as soon as you leave the village and go to the zone, you cannot leave that zone until you've done everything you need to do, and you cannot return to that zone until. You are meant to go there as part of the main story. So the main story is your... Um, yeah, uh, that'd be interesting. You cannot go to any other zone. You must be locked into the zone as per the story. So, redeem shout-out. Harvey wants a shout-out. Okay, you got the points. Cost 1,000. It costs 1,000 right now, so... How many more hours uh, for you to be night for me? It says 120. It's, uh, it's 10 minutes to 8. 10 to 8. So, four hours and ten minutes. Ten minutes. That might be a little bit high, Harvey. It's I, I really said that, but I might be uh, bringing it down quite a big bit. Maybe down to 500 because um, it's quite a lot. So, it's still quite a lot. It's still quite a lot. Also, even the buff conic, I could probably bring that rate down a little bit. So, oh god, please don't. <laughs> I need to keep my mouth shut. Just keep my mouth shut, because I have a feeling that's going to happen. I know. I know. It's set high because I didn't uh, I didn't know how many people are going to do it. And it, it's set high because... Um, I don't know. I don't even know if it's a good thing or not, but... It's something, right? It's something. We've got... Um, right. Basculin's here. That's fine. Shiny print plot? Violet Shit, how long have you been hunting for that? Have you only just got your print plot? What else have you been doing all day? You finally got it. Well done. Uh, no basketball in there, guys. Uh, like, Harvey, what, what do you do? Do you uh, do videos? Do you live stream? What do you do? What do you do, Harvey? What does the Harvey do? What does Harvey and Harvey's uh, dog Mario do? Bro, gamble only 40. If gambling is only set at 40, I don't want you guys setting too high where you can lose everything or too much where it's going to just rob the bank of Draco. So, uh, my favorite evolution design wise is Sylveon. How about you all? I like Umbreon and I like Sylveon if it's shiny. Um, I like I like all of them. There, there's only, there's only, uh, the only one that doesn't do me justice is, uh, is Jolteon. Jolteon's shiny I don't like because it goes into a very disgusting green colour. Viporium is good. Flareon is actually... I mean, you hardly know it's Flareon, but at least it's better than looking like Jolteon's shiny. Wait. Oh. My. Arceus. We have an outbreak in every single zone. Down the bottom, we have Beautify. On the far right, we got Machoke. At the bottom right, we have Turtwig. In the middle, we have Gummy. And at the very top, we have Snover. Um, I do like Espeon, though. I, I, I like Espeon. Espeon's got a cool look to it. Um, I'm going to go... Damn it, I already have Snover. 
Machoke. Turtwig. Gumi. I have a shiny of all of these. I have a shiny of every single one of these. Whether it's from Pokemon Go. Actually, they're all from Pokemon Go, actually. <laughs> Apart from Gumi, which we already have. So, Judgmental Call. Um, judgmental Call. They're going to go and uh, do a basket one. Uh, only two shinies for you today. That's pretty low. Did they do an update? I doubt it, but you never know. You're very small, YouTube. Well, it's my job to help you grow. How many videos or streams do you do every week, Harvey? Do you do one or two videos a week? Or um, or do you do more than that, less than that? You make vids. You needed a shout tonight. You only have uh, 10 subs. I can help with that. I can do that. Oh, you resetted. I resetted. I thought about doing Turtwig, but then I should have done Turtwig. I feel bad about that. Well, let's uh, let's see if Turtwig is still, still there. Got Shiny Pichu. Nice one, Sleeping Moon Lunar. Well done. Well done on your Shiny Pichu. I don't know what Shiny Pichu looks like. I would assume it's uh, kind of orange as well. Oh. <laughs> all right. All right. Okay. Okay. Since Turtwig decided to make a reappearance, uh, we're going to do Turtwig just once. Just once. Usually a week, it's uh, mostly random. I get you. I get you. Now let's uh, let's see if Turtwig decides to be shiny or not. Turtwig gets a little bit of redemption. Turtwig gets the awesome starter redemption award. Well, Turtwig be shiny. Let's find out, guys. It's not shiny out at the gate. Okay, okay. Let's um get into position. Let's see if uh Turtwig is uh, gonna be shiny or not. Now we're in cover. Oh my goodness, it's running away. Hmm. You also haven't had the shiny all day now that you mentioned it, so. Look at the Turtwig's move. I think that's really cool. Okay. Ah, I don't think so. We tried, guys. We tried. We tried. No Turtwig. No Turtwig. This print club is two feet. <laughs> is it? <laughs> that's so funny. Yay, when I want something to be done, it's it stays there for a while. That's good, Horatio Cash. That's good. All right. Well, uh, Turtwig came back for you, buddy. Turtwig came back, and it said it's a lose. All right. Let's see what you got. You don't have 12 subscribers. Let's see. Uh, you don't have anything, buddy. That's all I can say. Don't have anything there, buddy. I'm looking at the right one. There's some videos. There's some videos. You're the sil uh, the shiny uh, Sylveon, right? London Fireworks. Best in Europe. Comment on this. Can I ask you actually? Uh, look at this one. Okay. So, the thing is, Harvey. Uh, the thing with um, content creators is uh, they need to be fully active. They need to be fully active uh, with their channel. So... They don't need to be... Oh my god. I, I'm starting to hate this game a lot more now. The Outbreak's just never want to come. Well, to be fair, the Baskin one, one did come back. So, that is yourself, Harvey, which is good. Your trainer is the same height as the Sepulion. <laughs> nice. So, yeah, Harvey. Um, what we're looking for in terms of um, uh, shout-out and support is... Um, I'm only going to... I'm only going to help and support people that um, have content that people are going to watch and content that people want to keep on coming back for i'm just looking at your channel but and this is no hate this is no hate um 
before you, you don't have anything that stands out and that's going to bring uh, people back so but at the same time if you do want to get into youtubing and live streaming and you have questions about what to do and how to do it that's what i'm here for that is exactly what i'm here for if you need help and advice and trying to get into it i am live streaming and youtubing myself and i've got all the answers to your questions or at least most of your questions so so if you have anything that you want to uh, ask me i'm right here so making shorts feels like uh, cheating to me it's uh it depends on the shorts i think she i think it really just depends on the shorts to be honest there's some people out there that make uh, really cool shorts well that was uh pixel perfect there's some people out there that make some really good shorts, to be fair, but uh, I can see what you mean by that. I can see what you mean by that. Okay, off you go, Basculant. Nothing popping up. And one more attempt. Uh, you're new to YouTube. I'm with you now. I'm with you. But like I said, I would shout you out if you have some more content on there, buddy. If you have more content and you're a lot more active, then yes, I would be more than happy to help you out on that one. Got 10 research on your munchlax, finally. Lunar, well done. Very well done to you. Did you talk to them about uh, DM stuff uh, since we're on the topic? Uh, she's still here. Godless, um, Shay. Content creator role for Godless, Shay. What do you think? I've looked at their channel. They seem fairly active, so what do you think? You're staying on 10 subs. Uh, wait, uh, watch one of my shorts. Um, so, Harvey, one sh uh, one video, one short is not enough to convince me to shout you out. Let me, let me put it into perspective for you, buddy. Let me put it into per perspective. And I just want to see before we go any further, Harvey, okay? There is no personal hate. There is um, no discrimination. There's nothing about that going on. All I'm trying to say is if you're putting time and effort into it, and I think you're an awesome individual to shout out in terms of YouTube standards, then yes, you fully deserve to be shouted out. But I'm not seeing that you're active. I haven't seen a video, so I don't know how good the quality is. I don't know how good they are. But what I'm trying to say is if I try to recommend your channel to people who don't see that you're active, you're instantly going to end up losing those subscribers. Uh, as cruel as it sounds... I want to make sure that you get yourself into a good position, so. Um, I'm so small, though. I know. So, but this is why I want to see commitment uh, be put into it. If you have the time and the effort to do it, just do it. Just do it. Even if you make a, even if you make a video for, and you only get like five views, as long as I see that consistency... Uh, or quality, consistency and quality, two different factors. They do balance themselves out. But if I find that right amount of consistency and quality, then yes, that's what I would be looking out for. So, consistency, try and upload. You don't need to upload stuff like every single minute of every single day. Like once once a day, twice, um, once every two days, like that type of thing. So, that's the type of stuff that people would be looking out for, right? consistency and then you've got to try and see if you can find some quality in the stuff you're uploading so quality is a little bit difficult especially for new youtubers but in that scenario i think i'd rather just see uh quality over um sorry so i'd rather see quantity over quality but that's just maybe just maybe my personal opinion but you might take it rid of it uh, if uh if my content's uh, trash now no content is trash so no content is trash at all what I'm trying to say is um, I've got no problem shouting at your channel if I see um, a lot more content on there. More consistency. That's what we're trying to say. And uh, Handsome Al is here. How you doing, Al? How you doing on this fine and awesome day, buddy? We have completed the game uh, just less than an hour ago. We had uh, a sweet conversation with Arceus. So you don't have your capture card. But that's that's part of the thing. So mass outbreaks they help me so much. Mass outbreaks are just an, are awesome. So hey, maybe Al can give us um, his trainer. Al can probably give us the luck for trying to get that fish. Last message. And there's a not really a content schedule. No, really. Again, no hate, but Godless it doesn't even have uh, thumbnails or good titles to be honest. 
I think... I think we might need to look into like stuff like that. So you know how non-creative I am. Remember, everyone starts small. Everybody starts small, all right? Arcus slid into Draconics and DMs. <laughs> yeah, you're absolutely right. <laughs> need to... That is so meme-worthy. That is meme-worthy right there. Need to switch up your Pokemon or buy items? Come on, buy. Why does it only pop up when Arceus is there? He's asking Arceus if he needs to switch up his Pokemon. Arceus a Pokemon trainer confirmed, guys. Arceus is a confirmed Pokemon trainer. Who would have thunk it? Alright. You got a shiny Gibble yesterday. You got a shiny Gibble? Nice. Fantastic. Evolve that into Guard Chomp and uh, you will not see the diff. Well, okay. Maybe there's a, maybe it's a little bit no more noticeable these days, but... But nice one, buddy. Awesome. You have to start small. You have to work yourself up. I'm going to get... Uh, I'm going to say this right now, guys. But when I started, I never had the support of any other big YouTuber. It was myself and uh, my team. And uh, we had to start, start small. And we just had to uh, work our way up. So everyone starts small. I consider that a type of uh, like learning perspective. Like, what do you want to do on YouTube? And what do you want to achieve and accomplish? So and, like, when you figure out what you want to do, and if you think YouTube is for you, I think at that point, you can... Go out there and it's just um yeah if you know what you're doing and you you want if you know what you're doing and you and you know what you want to try and get out of youtube then that's good i've got no problem trying to help you that's it of course you're going to get uh, the the girl arceus what, what do you mean i get the girl arceus wait what do you mean lunar is uh arceus a she what what do you mean lunar am i missing something Am I missing something, Lunar? Engage! How you doing, Gage? Hope things are going good, buddy. Uh, what if I get uh, 1,000 points? Then do I not get still? Harvey, if you get 1,000 points, I will do it. I will do it. Because it is within the redemptions. It's one of the things that you can uh, redeem with the points. So, yes. If you do get 1,000 points, then yes. I would have no problem shouting you out. Many follow only trends and do nothing else. You have to be you. That's it. There's a, I've not seen the movie, but there was a trailer for a wrestling movie and it featured uh, The Rock. I can't remember how the phrase goes, but um, The Rock... Uh... Oh. Oh. You know what? I'm going to check this one out. Uh, the Rock had uh, a phrase. Uh, Don't focus on being the next me. Focus on being the next you. Or something like that. Just be yourself. Just be yourself. It's not that difficult, guys. Not that difficult. Just be yourself. I can't believe we got two Basco in uh, at Great Food School. How many needs that female Kobe? You just caught one. Right. You said something about Arceus. Arceus uh, doesn't have a gender. <laughs> so. And it just uh, got some berries, which is nice. Okay, uh, I don't know if this Basculin spawn is uh, better or not, but I guess we're about to find out Basculin spawning in this area, I guess. Uh, it does have commands. Not too many of them, but it does have commands. It does have commands, buddy. Oh, they're all here, okay. They're all here. I don't know if this is any better or worse, to be fair. It's definitely one less step, but um, not seeing the shiny. It's also quite tough to see the Basculins in this weather, so I'm going to report back and do the other one. It's one extra step, but um, it's not. But the other one, it's noticeable. So, uh, yes, it does have commands. You do me, which you do you, which is you go in Apex. Yep. Uh, if anyone needs a female combi, you just got one. Nice, Malik. I mean. I've still got the male one, and I don't exactly have a need for a female one, so. Uh, what commands? There is, um, there's my friend codes for both Switch, Xbox, and Pokemon Go. There's commands for buff conic. If you have a look at the description gauge, uh, you can see all the commands there. But all of the, com some of the commands may require something called Dracoins. And you can get Dracoins by watching the live stream. Also, I think I'm going to bring back... You guys, uh, 
gifting drag coins. I think that I'm going to start doing that. I'm going to start gifting out uh, drag coins to you guys again. I think that's a really cool thing that I did before, and I think I'm open to do that again. So, hype is here. What you doing? Oh, we're just hanging out with Arceus, Dialga, Palkia, Garatina, uh, while trying to hunt down a shiny fish. No joke. That is exactly what we're doing. We're hunting the fish. Which is Basculin right now. Basculin Shiny has evaded us so many times. Uh, so we're going to try and see if we can get it. Well, to be fair, we haven't exactly hunted for this. But whenever we, we get this popping up, it, it just keeps on eluding us. We just never seem to get it. Which is um, which is a little bit, you know, it's a little bit tedious. But, uh, but we'll get it eventually. We just need to do... We just need to commit. We just need to get some good commitment in there, so... And then we'll get it. This time? No, not that time. Not that time. Okay. I got the gods. I got the gods. What? Uh, yes, I, I got I got the gods. Already? Uh, it was actually kind of quick. It was kind of quick hype. I will say, the final battle was... Um, absolutely awesome. I quite enjoyed it. Uh, you got 300 points. Yay! Gage, good job, buddy. Gage has got in 413 drag coins. So that's not 300. That's more, more, more. Uh, gamble all? Wait. You can only you can only gamble 20. You can only gamble 20. 20 is the maximum. But you, you, get, you get coins. You get coins. Wait. Oh, no, you, you lost coins that time. Oh, that's unfortunate. But still, you got 400 plus. So that's still good, right? You guys gambling away, gambling away your drag coins. You have 4,531 drag coins. What do you think of the new type of Pokemon game? I love it. I think it's a really awesome mechanic. There's a lot of experimentation with this game. And that's just an experimentation. Um, I think they released this game as an ex experiment, of course. And it feels... I don't feel... Unfinished is not the word I would use. It's more experimental, like I've said. Um, they've really tested out quite a lot of stuff. The open world RPG-like style to it has been phenomenal. If this is the future of what Pokemon games could look like, then I am ready. So, But, uh, of course, we um, need to wait uh, a little bit. Give Game Freak a bit of time to uh, create more of them. And I think that will look uh, super awesome. So... So yeah, we'll give Game Freak time, maybe not for Generation 9, but Generation 10. I think that would look absolutely phenomenal. RPG style, and just going around a region, and you've got no, or nearly no restriction on where and what you do. That would look so good. Um, it's going to be very interesting using, um, yeah, the shoutouts gauge, but they cost 1,000. 1,000 is the cost for shoutouts. Because if everybody got hold of them, um, oh, excuse me, if everybody got a hold of them, they would just start spamming them. Shout me out, shout me out, shout me out, so. But I'm only going to do a shout out to those that I um, believe should get it. So, that's basically it. I think I'm almost tempted to bring the, uh, it costs 1,000, but I'm almost tempted to just bring the number down a little bit. 1,000 seems too high. And uh, Godless, I know you uh, paid 1000 for that, so I'll look into that and adjust that accordingly. I I'll need to reassess it, so I might do that tomorrow. We'll see. You're in reports. Oh, Hapini. That would be... Yeah, I've already got it, but um, that would be good still. Uh, what about the rest of you guys? Uh, what do you think? Uh... I think it's brilliant. Okay. What's that? Draco Appreciation. Draco's been really quiet all stream, guys. Draco has been quiet all stream, so um, let's see if uh, Draco would like a snack. Tasty snack, guys. Oh, there he is. Come on, buddy. Okay. Let's see if Draco wants a snack, guys. Okay, there you go. Oh, oh, you might go for it. He's going for it. Thinking about it. Come on, come on. You nearly got it, Draco. You nearly got it. 
There we go, we got it, we got it, we got it. Hmm. Oh, you okay, Draco? You good? He's fine, he's fine. Just uh, take it over just a little bit. See if he wants to uh, have another one. Appreciate the true, true Draco. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> he's kind of choking a little bit there. He's actually done that twice uh, recently. These aren't too big as well. These are not big. Um, his uh, food stock, so. Doesn't have the biggest food stock in the world, of course, so. Uh, don't shout out my channel, but I made the pick different for channel. It's me with uh, Avatar Arrow. Check it out. Uh, I'm active. Okay, Gage. Give me a second. I'm going to come back to that comment, buddy. There you go, Draco. Draco has reached level 101. Do, 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 do. He's got some rare candy right there, so. There we go. Okay. A thousand is quite a lot, buddy. It is a lot, which is why I might be uh, bringing it down a little bit. But all this stuff about channel um, shout outs, guys, it's. Um, I'm going to say this right now. You need to ask yourselves the question, all right? You need to ask yourselves the question. Is my content good to be shouted out? Or is it going to be a waste of time? Um, you, just, you guys just have to ask the question, all right? Because if I look at a channel and I look at it and I'm thinking, okay, they've redeemed shout out, but they don't upload. They're not consistent. The quality of their content is not good, but if they're keen to get into YouTube, then yes, then the um, then the shout out would definitely be very cool. But if not, then it's just kind of a waste, right? It would just be a waste of your drag coins and that you can spend on other things. So just ask yourselves the question, guys. Just ask yourself the question if a shout out is uh, really worth it. If it's really worth the drag coins. So, urge of doubts rising. Nah, you're, you're fine. You're fine. So, like, if I look at your channel right now, Gage, I, I can stream on YouTube. I'm streaming daily and uploading. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Let's uh, have a look, all right? Let's have a look and see what you got. Because I think at some point what I will want to do is... Uh, oh, my goodness. Am I... Um, No. Uh, wait. Huh? Am I getting mixed up? Am I getting mixed up with something? Hang on a minute. That's so weird. Hang on a minute. Um, why can I not do that? Let's have a look. Am I forgetting something? Give me a second. Give me a second. All right, okay, I was looking at the wrong channel. Okay, that's um, interesting. Um, okay, that's fine. Uh, no, I was I was getting you mixed up with another Gage Perez. So I had a quick look. Give me a second, because to be fair, I actually didn't have a proper look. Give me a second. I was getting mixed up with a few things. You have avatar proof. No, no, I, I can just go to your channel based on what we got here. Uh, let's see. Videos. Wait. 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 Harvey, is this you? This is the exact same channel. This is the exact same channel as uh, Harvey. This is the exact same channel. No, dang it. Okay, am I, um, am I missing something? Dang it, lol. What, okay, so, were you trying to fool me, Harvey? Were you trying to fool me? So, just looking at that, that's not something that I would shout out. So, <sighs> okay. 
Dang it. What do you mean, dang it? I tried. I tried. Okay. Elicate. That's nice. Well, you tried. You tried. You tried. Gage, I'm not mad, all right? You can stream on YouTube and you're streaming daily and uploading. Gage. 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 Oh, my goodness. Listen, Gage or Harvey, if I right click on your name, I have the option called go to channel. I went to your channel and it has the exact same video uploads as Harvey. So if you've changed your name, it's not exactly cool. It's not exactly cool now, is it? So the shows get pinned because you can click on it to subscribe to them. I think that would be a kind of a really cool thing to do, right? I think a pinned message for an hour of shout out. I think that would be a really cool thing to do, so. Yeah, um. Do you want proof? Uh, I can always take a screenshot of it, so. Alright. Basculin, not shiny out of the gates. That's fine. We get uh, seven more. Seven more. Seven more rolls for this. There's an alpha that's popped up. Alpha Basculin. Alright, so we get three here. Nothing. I think we'll get one more if the numbers are. No, that, that might be it. That's probably it. Yeah, that was that was it, definitely. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so Gage, you may as well just come clean, alright? It's funny that someone so kind like Cynthia has a evil ancestor and someone so evil like uh, hello <laughs> like hello, a good ancestor. You know, they um they had us, uh, they already had us, so. You already got one? Uh, Redeem Draco's already been done, Gage. It's already been done, buddy. Is there a new way of shiny hunting in this game? Uh, hype! There's the shiny outbreaks, which we're kind of doing right now, so. Apart from that, um, this is probably the best method uh, to shiny hunt with. And it's really good. It's really, really good, buddy. If you're aware of outbreaks, um, there's no need to explain it. But if you don't know how it works, uh, I, c I can show you. You already got one? Are you in Team Rocket? You got Basculin? Here's the question. Did you steal it or did you catch it yourself? <laughs> Team Rocket blasting off at the speed of light. Uh, there's a new way to get free shinies. Uh, free, as in just trade or just put effort in. What's the, uh, what's the method? What is the method? You stole it. That's the right thing to do, Team Rocket. <laughs> That's the right thing to do, buddy. Right, guys. My head is starting to get a little bit more sore now. So I'm going to keep on going for another 10 minutes. Um, 10 more minutes. And then I'm just going to go ahead and call it quits. Because my head is starting to hurt quite a good fair bit. So I don't know if it's de dehydration or, um, or if I've been streaming for way too much. but um, Or it could be food. could also be food that I need to get. But we'll see. Anyway. Uh, like I'm limited. Glitch. Yeah, we actually came across a glitch. To, oh, it's a glitch. Um, I'm not going to use it. I'd rather do it the right way. I'm going to try and get them the right way. And Malik is here. How you doing, Malik? Hope things are going good. Gage, you're still here. I hope you're still here, buddy. I don't hate you, okay? I'm just disappointed that you would change your name expecting um, uh, a shout-out. So. so, I don't hate you. I'm just disappointed. But... Um, like I, like I said, I don't hate you. Just, um... I don't hate you. What, what else do you want me to say? I don't hate you, okay? Just disappointed with your uh, method to try and get attention, so... You should YouTube and live stream for fun. YouTube and live stream is a hobby for fun to enjoy. And bring people together, okay? Jesus Christ, there's Alpha Basket again, sure. Uh, hello, fellow Malik. What? What's going on? Hey, what's going on? So, we got a few more Basculins pop up. Yeah, this Basculin is uh, being a little bit annoying now. I think we'll get one more Basculin, then that's a reset. And, uh, no, it's not shiny. What are the odds of this? The odds of this are pretty high. So, the way shinies work um, is that you get your 1 in 4,000 chance. Outbreaks are uh, something like, uh, like you get 25 out of 4,000. So that 1 in 4,000 is going to stay. Uh, is going to stay. But whenever you try to roll and get a shiny. Um, you actually get like 25 attempts at that one Pokemon being shiny. That's what it does. It's the same story with the um, 
with a shiny charm as well. Similar story, anyway. Uh, oh, you should uh, look at it in daytime. It is kind of daytime right now, so... At least it's not a blizzard. Uh, Gage changed the name to Malik. Did Gage change the name to Malik? Oh, Gage, please don't. I don't want to ban you. I really don't want to ban you, okay? If you change, please change your name back to... Oh, you know exactly what it was. You know exactly what it was. Oh, my God. Harvey, Harvey, you are, um, you're kind of acting, you're acting like the type of person I don't want to shout out anymore, okay? So please, please stop, stop with the immature jokes or I'm going to have to ban you, okay? Because it's not fair on Malik as well, so, so please don't, I know it's you. All I need to do is just look up the name of your channel and that's it, so... Watch the basket only be shiny here, and that's going to be an awesome highlight, guys. Can't wait for that. It's going to be an awesome highlight. It would be crazy if it was a shiny basket and highlight. That would be crazy. My name's... Well, there's the alpha one. The alpha ones just love to be popped in. So don't copy other people's names. Change it back to Harvey. Exactly. Well, change it back to what it was before, okay? Because I can easily look at your channel. You're honestly, you're acting just like some another individual. So, uh, hey, Stone Family, how you doing, buddy? There is a name that I'm very familiar with. How you doing, buddy? Uh, hope things are going really good. And uh, if you've been playing this game as well, hopefully you've been enjoying it as well. Okay, I says hi. Okay. Okay. I know it's you, Harvey. You're not fooling me, all right? You're not fooling anyone. So this is your last chance. Uh, this is your name. Then. That's your name now. So it's I. Okay. AI. What's the A stand for? <laughs> Drifling and Driftblim outbreaks. Sure. Okay, keep it like that. That. That's it. No more changes. No more changes. No more changes. That's it. That's it. Well, I can't stop you from changing your name, but um, please don't try to imitate somebody else. That's all I'm saying. Nobody likes the ditto on YouTube. Okay, how are we doing for time? I did say that I would be wrapping up in 10 minutes, so. Okay. Why so trainers, uh, Pokemons uh, can attack twice? That's so unfair. Uh, the thing with that, Malik, it depends on their style and uh, on their speed as well. I guess it's a new thing that they're trying to... I don't like the battle system change too much. I guess there's some good and bad things out of it. It's something new that they tried and it's kind of cool for the single player experience. Oh my god, uh, sure. Just a one-time Stantler. If we get Shiny Stantler, then that's good. That's fine. If we get Shiny Stantler, good. Um, we'll try and get Basculin in another time. This is a one-time Stantler attempt, guys. Uh, we can always get Stantler another time. And honestly, Basculin is just a lot more easier to get. So, so this is a one-time Stantler one. Because Stantler could give us some problems uh, in the future. But if we get it Shiny, then fantastic. Let's have a look and see. You dudes are hanging out. There's our Stantlers. None of them are shiny out of the gate. Oh, why are they attacking? Come on. At least they're easy to catch, right? So that's good. Still right behind. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, we actually did Stantler before as well, and uh, because the Drifflins were in the way, this is actually kind of better. This is already feeling a bit more better, so. But no Stantlers are appearing shiny, which is fine. Nothing there, guys. Nothing there. 
All right, no Stentler, uh, unfortunately. Okay, let's see. We can make it tiny. I'm not uh, imitation. Is this good? Harvey's name is so good, he's never changing. <laughs> that will do, Harvey. That will do, okay? That will do. Question, did you complete the story? I completed the story, Team Rocket, but uh, I'm not spoiling anything else. I'm not going to be spoiling anything else. Uh, oh, there's there. Harvey, your name's back. That's good. That's good. Harvey's name is not changing, and that's fine. That's absolutely fine, buddy. All right. Uh... All right, my, um, I'm not angry. I was disappointed. I'm no longer disappointed in you, all right? You have went ahead and chosen the correct path, buddy. So that's good. Like the story story. I've completed the full story and I've done post game. And um, yeah, it's been good. I've enjoyed it. It's um, been good. So now I'm um, just casually shining from 10 minute now. So there's only, there's nothing else to do. I mean, I can always try and get the shiny charm, which is no problem. It's no problem at all. I'm probably going to try and get the Shiny Charm in my free time. Uh, I think that makes a bit more sense, guys. All the emotes for Harvey's? That's fine. I can see that. I can see that, buddy. It's starting to get a little bit tired. And hungry. It's been a long day. It's been a long day. It's been a long Saturday. A very long Saturday. Um, luckily, tomorrow is... Uh, oh, that's the wrong button. Luckily, tomorrow is uh, Sunday. I'm not live streaming. I'll be taking it nice and easy. And uh, we'll see how it goes. Right. No shiny basketball in that time. Let's uh, re-roll. <gasps> shiny basketball! We got it! 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 Shiny basketball! Now the problem is I can't remember which one it was. Was it the one on the right? I can't remember which one it was, but we got shiny basketball, guys. That's the perfect end. Is that the one on the right? That's it. it has to be. That's the one. It's the one on the right. It's the one on the right. We got shiny basculin, guys. Shiny basculin. Let's go. Let's go. Now I need to catch this. Oh, God. I need to catch this. Oh, my God. I don't even know which one it is anymore. I think that was the shiny that just disappeared. I'm pretty sure that was the shiny that just disappeared. Oh my god. It's okay. If we can reload this back up. I must steal it. Steal it. GG's. Now I need to catch it. Oh my god. I need to catch this. Oh my god. I need to catch this. It's not a fail. It's not a fail. I'll, I'll, I will get this. I will get this fish. I will get this fish, all right? It's not a fail if you don't catch it. Because you can always reload it. All right, it's the one on the right. It's the one on the right. So now, that's good that it still pops up like that. So now, now I can analyze my approach. All right, we got it, we got it, we got it. Did we get it perfectly? We got the shiny batch going, guys. Let's go. <laughs> we got it. We got it, guys. All right, just pulling back a little bit. If we get another one, that is fantastic. But we got the shiny batch going. That is a fantastic way to end the live stream. So, no more. No more. That's it. That's it. Shiny batch going. We're done. We're done. The fish. It's done. Oh, 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 I don't want to do that. I want to press this. Now, let's make sure that I got the right one. I need to make sure I get the right one. I'm pretty sure I did catch the right one, but let's have a look. There it is. That's an oops. That was my uh, my bottle. I'm not going to let Draconic fail. Thank you. Catching it is the next challenge. That was a huge challenge just to catch it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Shiny, basculine. In the bank. Let's go. We can get Basque Legion now. All right. Fantastic. And uh, it is actually fairly noticeable. It go. Oh, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Um, 
it's bright or green and it's got a little bit of gold on there that's really really cool i need to evolve this into basque legion but i won't be able to do that tonight of course all right let's see if we can get another outbreak guys <laughs> i'm gonna watch the video where you spam the table <laughs> sure i'm happy i got on time here his evolution looks good if i'm right basque legion looks so good but shiny version i do not know shiny basculine we got basculation guys and uh let's try to see if we can get a little bonus round bonus round bonus round for you guys uh what's in our pokemon let's um dun, 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 dun. oh uh yeah basculine is uh that's a shiny one right it's the shiny one i don't need to go far for for this one so that's fine basculine goes here we only need four more we only need stantler Lilligant, Arcanine, and Zorark. Those are the only ones that we're missing. So we're definitely getting there. We are getting there. I'm going to move all of these over in a second. <laughs> okay. Um, move those and move those. Okay, we're done. We're done. How did you get uh, so much shines? I got a lot. I got a lot. Outbreaks. Outbreaks are the way to go. And we've also got four, uh, three spots left for any random shinies, which could be the Drift Blooms. Of course, they're up there. Shiny Drift Bloom would be fantastic because uh, it's a really good shiny look. It's got a really cool look to it. Sneasler, Sneasler. I've just been playing this a lot. Just been playing it quite a ton. All right. All right, uh, bonus round. Let's see if we can get a shiny Drift Bloom, guys. Not an important one, but it's a bonus. It's a bonus. Not shiny out of the gate. That's fine. And for this one... Um... Did it see us? I did see us. That's fine. Oops. God damn, this tree is, uh... Yeah, okay. Hmm. Let's just fight this one. Let's fight this one. Uh, we'll have fun. I'm gonna go steal some. No, no problem at all, buddy. We're gonna maybe wrap it up in a second anyway, but uh, this is good. Did you get an Arcade uh, plush from Fjordran? I didn't hype, although... Um, I'm almost tempted to buy one and just put it on my shelf. Just just as an Arceus reference, uh, just for... I think that would be a really cool touch, to be fair. It would be a really cool uh, touch for the shelf, so I'll need to look into that. Hopefully I can get one at least, So, but we'll see. That would be a really cool touch, though. Just catching the drift blimps left and right. That's no problem at all. This is just a bonus round. That one's enraged. There's only three left? Only three left. That's no problem. So we don't get shiny there, which is no problem. Nothing to worry about, guys. Uh, let's go shiny ghastly outbreak. Shiny ghastly outbreak? Nice. Isaac, do you guys know where you can find an alpha route? I know where you can find an Alpha Guard of War, but that's really about it. Sadly to say, I don't know where you can find an Alpha route, so... Really sorry about that one, buddy. Only found eight. Only found eight Drift Blooms, guys. Still find Ruins, I'm pretty sure... Ah, that's where you can find routes, so that's a good idea. Guard of War is on the uh, far eastern side of this map. But, uh, yeah, apart from that, I don't know where you can find an Alpha route. So, you can find an Alpha Glade inside the temple, if that helps. So, Hunter, welcome back, Hunter. Hello and welcome back. Hope things are going good. And, Wouter, let's go Shiny Ghastly Outbreak. That was you that said that. My apologies. Welcome on in, buddy. Hope things are going good for you. Uh, sure. Uh, let's just go. Gonna head out. Awesome job with the Shiny. Thanks, Hype. Thank you so much, buddy. That was a good little end there. You know, I'm going to keep on going for a little bit. 
Just trying to see if we can get some random outbreaks. Uh, just last minute random outbreaks. Stantler, Growlithe, Zorark, and... Um, there's, there's one more. There's one more. Lilligan. Lilligan. Those are the only four Hisuian ones that we need. And then I'm done. I'm just going to go to another random place. Right. Wish everyone a happy rest of the day. Thanks, Hi. Thanks so much for the kind words, buddy. You enjoy the rest of the day. Hope things are going good. DLC. Uh, people are hinting towards potential DLC. And I would welcome that. But what would they give us? Because they've already given us... Um, They've given us every legend and mythic possible, so what DLC could they give us? That being said, they could give us some Gen 5 stuff. That would be interesting, considering the uh, the uh, the uh, disaster trio, the weather trio, or whatever. Uh, and one uh, went away from gold rank on Master Duel with Utopia. Dude, nice. That is uh, actually uh, rather awesome. Hopefully you get it. Hopefully you do get it. All right, Weasel is up next. So we're just doing random encounters at this point. Just random encounters. And uh, we're just trying to see if we can get a little bit lucky. Only random encounters until we can get uh, one of the other four Hisuian ones remaining. All right, Golduck, what's up? Uh, right, no shinies there, which is fine. Why did the Weasels already sense we're here? That's kind of annoyed, but okay. I feel like for DLC we get a multiplayer mode. That would be very interesting. I don't like that idea. Not for this. The battle system is um is uh, could you imagine a battle system with this game with everybody having access to Arceus? That would be uh, kind of broken, to be honest. That would be kind of broken. How did that weasel just? I don't know, know what's going on there. Wait! Okay! Okay, okay. I thought that was the shiny there for a second, but it wasn't. I just seen the light and I thought... Oh my god, that's shiny. What is that? That was a... Godless redeeming lift some weights. Alright, let's lift some weights, guys. We're going to start lifting up some weights, guys. That was a big, loud one. Alright. Uh, I'll let you guys uh, see Draco a little bit. And uh, let's lift some weights in the process. So, so Draco, you can get to chill out and hang out. And I'll lift some weights for it just now for you guys. Hey, oh, hey, Murray, how's it going, buddy? We got a redeem on some weight lifting. A way to get to normal decidui and the starters. Uh, time space distortions, uh, decidui. Time space distortions, buddy. One, two, three, four. Five. What's next for Legends Arceus? Six, seven, eight, nine, DLC probably. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, just five or six, fifteen, sixteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Oh yeah. Draconic, something that all Cynthia family members have is they are a pain to beat. They are, Malik, but at least they share that same trait. They all share that same trait of being absolutely annoying to beat. So, hopefully we don't have to deal with that once again. Uh, but yeah, DLC. You found Chimchar and thought it was shiny, but it was not. Chimchar shiny is like a kind of, like, burgundy red. Is burgundy the right uh, word to use? Possibly, possibly. Alright, that weasel's, uh, yeah, that weasel's fine. Okay, uh, well, I, you know what, I'm just gonna go and catch it. Because uh, if I don't, uh, it's gonna be the drift limb situation all over again, so. So we'll just catch it. Hopefully. There we go. Okay, we're head on back. Okay, don't mind me. I'm just so paranoid by the sound effects in this game now, so. And Mari said hello. What's new? What's new? Uh, game's complete. We got Arceus, and uh, we got Shiny Basculin as well. Shiny Basculin is also in the bank, which was fantastic. So, we only need four more Hisuian forms, and then that's us. There is 
very little for us to do in the game. Apart from I uh, get the um, shiny charm and just uh, explore other potential um, shinies. So I was on about a way to get the normal forms of all his terrain forms. Oh, uh, that might be through um, Pokemon Home, potentially. Oh, Duskull. Let's go. The Duskull Evolution Line. Apart from Dusknoir, um, Duskull and Dusclops is one of my favorite. It was the very first shiny that I ever got in Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald. All the way back, guys. All the way back. So, if we can get a shiny Duskull here, that's going to mean a lot. So, Shiny Arcus. I bet Shiny Arcus. <laughs> Shiny Arcus is, um, you get that for getting, like, a full Pokedex completion. I'm not even lying. Uh, not, like, level 10 everything, but perfect everything. That seems like such a big task. So, makes sense. See something yellow, and I thought that was... Never mind. This girl's like to hang out in, uh, creepy, scary places. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was a miss. I don't think we're getting it. Still not getting my uh, my favorite uh, <laughs> ghost shiny. Is that the last one? That might be the last one. That's definitely the last one. Let's fight it. Um. We forgot rank 10. Rank 10, but on top of that, just completed every form of research. Like, perfected everything. I feel like that's something that I would probably end up doing. But, I don't know. We'll need to wait and see, so. Alright, that's everything reported. That Electabuzz. I don't know why I was thinking about that Electabuzz being a Weasel or something. That was just, you know, 10. There's all our, all our dust skills. Like this method, this method of uh, outbreak shiny hunting, it gets our level ten status up rather well, don't you guys think? I mean, look, look there, there, there you go. I mean, we're already doing pretty well for for dusk gold, so it's not too bad. Give me a second, back to the village. Let's see if there's anything else. So much for wrapping up. <laughs> we're we're keeping on going. But give me a thumbs up. Who's still here? Just so I know the numbers uh, when we decide to do a raid. So that would be really, really good. Oh, there's nothing there. Nothing there. Hmm. Okay. Yes. Head on back towards the village. Rank 10. Uh, thumbs up from Godless, which is good. Some good stuff. I think we're going to have to save everything till tomorrow, Godless, in terms of uh, dueling. Oh, God. It's nothing again. Um, just because of the time and all that. So, if you would like one quick game, I can give you that. Um, uh, let's see if we can get another outbreak here. Return to village. It's getting pretty late, guys. I'm... So we got just one thumbs up from yourself, Godless. How many more of you guys do we have? Are we going to have the numbers for our raid? Or are we just going to uh, go quietly? Just end the stream. Oh, God, Magmar. That's, uh, I'm not exactly looking forward to that Magmar fight. Um, We'll see. Magmar is uh, kind of annoying. Just catch it with a wing ball. And that would be, that would be sorted. But uh, it's not that easy. Exactly that easy. Okay, there is that. That one's, yeah, that one's definitely enraged. So is that one. Uh, they're all enraged by now. Okay, let's see. Thumbs. Alright, so Harry's got thumbs. <laughs> cool. Alright, so we got we, we fought against a few Magmars. I guess we can knock some of them out, right? I guess when I'm trying to complete the Pokedex as well, I can bring some Pokemon out. Yeah, I can bring Pokemon out that uh, still need that level 10 research, so. If 
only there was an easy way to tell up without going into the Pokedex every single time, so. Looks like Andrea's got their very first ever shiny, so that's awesome. Gotta check that out. There's people here, they left this as you started hunting. No, that's not true. That's not true. I can always go back to, um... This whole live stream was meant to be based on Legends, and uh, getting all the Legends all done. This is just bonus content. This is just bonus stuff, so... There's only four. Only four Magmars? Uh, I can deal with it. Dealing with them right now, so... Or unless you're talking about how many's left in the stream. In which case, if we don't have the numbers, I think we're just gonna have a quiet end to the stream, so... Alright, no shiny Magmars popping up. That's okay, that's okay. Jesus Christ. Oh, there's five. Alright, never mind. Collision detection, guys. Seriously, collision detection. Oh, uh, you know what? I've had enough. I've had enough. Come on, all of you. Every single one of you, Magmars. Oh my god, that's a uh, really strong place for. Gonna make that to have people here. Gotta go. Jesus, this, these magmars are being a bit of a pain. All four magmars. All four magmars up against a level 96 Samurai. Let's go. All right. If we don't have the numbers, we're gonna have a quiet end to the stream, guys. That's no problem. Uh, I don't mind. So, so if it's just godless, uh, come out lurkers. If it's just yourself, godless, and if Harvey's going, well, see you later, Harvey. Take care of yourself, buddy. If it's just us, we'll knock out these magmar, see if they're shiny or not, and then that's going to be the end. And um, sure, Godless, we'll have a game. We'll have one, maybe two games. Okay. Fight. Aqua Tail. This is Samurai's getting the experience right. Go over here, ready to escape. Aqua Tail Strong Style. Okay, and uh, we're all done. We're all done. Shiny Magmar, please, or not? Only one Magmar remains, huh? Only one. That's fine. That is absolutely fine. Doesn't get caught in that. What about that? And now I get to put you in my uh, stream title. Oh, good, good. <laughs> I'll only have one or two games, like I said, because I'm. It's getting late in the night. Oops. Oops. oops, 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 oops. I nearly did that completely wrong. That would have been embarrassing. Would have been more embarrassing if I didn't. No, I, I would have been okay. Would have been okay. Just reading Chingled Fire quickly. No problem. Only three magmars. That's disappointing. But okay, sure, whatever. All right, we're gonna have a quiet end to the stream. Uh, since we don't exactly have the numbers to raid, uh, that's a bit unfortunate. Hopefully, Magmar's all complete now. Okay, uh, return to village. Let's see if there's any more to do. If there's one more, ah, uh, we'll leave it for next time. We'll leave it for next time. See what there is. Oh, there's nothing. Okay, that's it. All right, quiet into the stream. Um, we'll talk soon then. Godless. Um, just think about food as well. Anyway, thank you all so much for tuning in. For those uh, still here, hopefully you enjoyed the stream, the legends, everything's been great. It's been awesome. Take care of yourselves, please. Enjoy the rest of your weekend, and uh, hopefully I won't be streaming tomorrow. No stream tomorrow, but uh, hopefully we'll see you back on Monday. We'll re resume. Our, um, our schedule, which will be good. Take care. Thank you all so much. And, uh, and good night, everybody.